Skyless 4827, keep your speed up at golf, cross runway 25 right, ground point 75, traffic holding up position. Cross, 25 right. I have a 31-year-old M&D 11 freighter with FedEx flight 3901. We'll be starting off our broadcast here today. We'll be taking off the closest runway to our cameras and our microphones. Runway 25 left here at LAX. And already rolling it down. Sky was 3363 LA Tower, wind calm, runway 25 left, clear to land. 25 left, clear to land, Sky was Always a good way to start the show. How about another heavy? American Federal Airlines Flight 12. I'm sorry, 260 Parker. heading to Miami, Florida. 777-200ER now already rolling down. A very busy south side, 25 right. Heavy contact of South Park. Off yeah, to good. my Hammy. It's a little appetizer for you. American Airlines Flight 122 also heading heading to Miami. It's an A321 is our next takeoff here on the south side. Followed by American Airlines Flight 1598 heading to Chicago O'Hare in a 737. 800. You guys are so quiet this morning. Is everyone still asleep? <laughs> Cayman Airways. 737 Max American 8 will be heading back to Georgetown. 480 should be pushing back from the American gates of the West Gates. The hottest club at LAX. So we wait for that American A321. Our legend Jane back again today with an amazing $550 Super Chat through PayPal. Awesome support from Legend Jane as always. Shane says, good morning, Kevin. I hope you and Rudy have a wonderful day. Thank you so much, Jane. Awesome support as always. I'm looking at the wrong camera. Awesome support as always. Thank you so much, Jane. Good morning. Good morning. All right. Back to the action. Thank you, Jane. I should be seeing that Cayman Airways 737 Max 8 pushing back here shortly. We do have that American A321. A boarding takeoff. Roger. Make a right turn at golf. Do you need any assistance? Right turn at golf, we'll let you know. American 122. American 122, make the right turn on Bravo and then contact ground 121.75. All right. Golf, Bravo, and then uh, ground, American 122. The boarding takeoff, and it will let ATC know if they need any assistance. Right, Usually we hear no, none distance. needed. Cross 25 right at Keep Juliet over the ground, because 33. Eye on that. Zero Victor Charlie, traffic holding in position at Foxtrot, cross runway 25 right, and then ground point 75. 
cross two five, a right ground point seven five, six five zero Victor. We are approaching the top of the hour, the top of the broadcast. Thanks, you guys, for tuning in. You early risers. Daylight savings time in effect overnight. Not affecting your plane jockey. All right. Takes us to the top of the hour. And officially 8 a.m. here in beautiful Los Angeles, California. Welcome back, everyone, for another awesome day of LAX plane spotting right here on your home for LAX live streams. That is Airline Videos Live. Today is a big Sunday show here on March 10th, 2024. And I am your plane jockey, Kevin, here at an Imperial Hill. It should be a very busy Imperial Hill as we have the A380s and 747-8 aircraft and so much more taking off here on the south side. It's going to be a fun filled action-packed day. So sit back, relax, we've got you covered. Plane Shockey Rudy will be standing here next to me coming up later this morning. Until then, make sure to hit that like button. Share the stream with your family and your friends. Zippy just arriving on the north side on two Four right, remember two four left, currently closed down. That is the reason for the A380s and 747 8s now taken off here on the south side. Line up away, two five right, six five zero Victor Trump. Air Premia 787 9 Dreamliner coming in from Seoul. Also landing on the north side on two four right. Looks like it's bypassing Lima. Means it's heading to the southeast side of Tom Bradley. Will give us certainly a better chance for that as a south side takeoff. Of course, our chance is pretty good already. All right, the flight heading to Chicago O'Hare now rolling down at 25 right. Contact Will we hear our taters today? Will we hear tater tot and later tater? Chances are, probably. <laughs> I'm in the mood for a little contact departures today. Craig, Craig Russell with a $5 super chat. Thanks so much, Craig. Hotel that I'm staying, it's called the Marriott, is located in the center of Houston, and it's got a underground tram that goes from the hotel to the terminal. How cool. Great time there. Thanks, Craig. Tower in the morning, Delta 780, 10 miles, 25 left. Delta 780, only tower number two in car, runway 25 left. Delta 785, left, Delta 780. Delta 457, cross 25 right, ground point seven five. I feel like everybody's still asleep this morning. <laughs> We're all whispering. We're all whispering. We don't want to wake anybody up. Alexander Z, a member for 23 months, as the Silver member says, Good morning from Germany. No strike today. Hooray. Yes. Should have all of our A380s and 747 aircraft here today. Like I mentioned, it's going to be an action-packed day. We're so excited. I cannot handle it. <laughs> MSC Air Cargo. It's a rare bird here. 
at LAX. This is operated by Atlas Air, by the way, heading to Hong Kong. It's a 777 freighter, just brand new, just delivered in December of last year. It's flight 8650 pushing back. It's currently on taxiway Alpha, though it's currently blocked by a bunch of planes and the buildings. That will certainly head here to the south side. SF DHL. Polar Air Cargo Fleet 962 heading to Cincinnati, also in a 777 freighter that will also head to the south side. Zippy, zipping on over here to the south side. Of course, we'll continue to zip along and head to Tom Bradley. From what I could tell from Friday's show, high top the H Hotel, Zip Air Zippy still taking off on the north side on 2-4 right. So don't expect really to see Zippy zipping on out of here on the south side today. But of course, you never know. It's LAX. Just when you think you figured it all out, all things change. That's what keeps it fresh and exciting. You guys are all having a great weekend so far. I expect a lot of people sleeping in this morning. A lot of people losing an hour of sleep. Southwest 2106 LA Tower, number three, wind calm, runway 25 left, clear to land. 25 left, southbound, southbound, southbound. Zippy making that left turn on the taxiway Lima. At Golf, cross 25 right, pass behind the JetBlue, taxi via Charlie 5 of the ramp. So our chances were pretty slim to have Zippy as a Southside takeoff later this morning. And but the, with Zippy making that left-hand turn onto Lima, I think our chances are pretty much slim to none at this point. More than likely, we'll have to two, four right there on the yeah, north side. Make the turn either way. He'll, he'll let you know which way to turn. Okay. Alaska Sky West, flight 3363, heading. Well. Heading back to San Jose, California, possibly in an E-175, heading to 25 right. Also, American Airlines Flight 834, heading to Austin, Texas, 737-800. As well as JetBlue Airways Flight 224, heading to JFK in an A321. All those planes heading to 25 right. Is Zippy now heading it to the southwest corner. Of Tom Bradley. It looks like there's an empty gate just to the right of the Qantas A380. Linda gifting five airline videos live memberships. Thank you so much, Linda. Bob is here this morning. Good to see you, Bob. He's not even paying attention. All right, Bob, you ready? <laughs> Drop it, Bob. Drop it, Bob. <laughs> Linda, gifting five airline videos live Thank memberships. Thank you so much, Linda. Heavy is with you. Visual approach, two five left. Ninety six zero one heavy LA tower number three. When calm, runway two five left, clear to land. Two five left, clear to land. American ninety six zero one. Oh, I guess he's heading up to the north side of Tom Bradley. JC, a member for 15 months. This is Silver Member. This is Cav. Reagan National is winning your return. Seventies all week. It's funny you. you mentioned that i was thinking about that when i was taking a shower this morning i have no idea it just popped in my mind about i was thinking about the months ahead next month is april and it was a year ago may that we took the show on the road to dc so i think another trip to dc should be in the planning stage at this point 
JC, enjoy those beautiful temperatures. Aviation Mike, what have a great mods with the $10 Super Chat. Thanks so much, Mike. Happy Southside Next Super Dick right Off. Hotel. Time to call it the Sunday Show, the Super Sunday Show for the next few months. <laughs> Um, I would never do that because I think another live stream who broadcasts on Sunday calls it the Super Sunday show. So I respect that. We'll keep it with the big Sunday show. So there's no confusion. But good idea there, Mike. Good to have you. Thank you so much. American Airlines flight 834 heading to Austin. The 737-800 is our next takeoff here on the south side at 25 right. We do have that MSC Air Cargo operated by Atlas Air, a 777 freighter heading to Hong Kong flight 8650 heading to the 25s here on the south side. I'll find the hole for you for that. Morning Star, American 607 visual, runway 25 left. American 607 on track, preceded by heavy 777, contrary turbines, traffic holding. American Airlines flight 9601 coming in from Sydney, Australia. 777 at 300 yards, just a minute out from a south side arrival on 25 left. Jet 8650 heavy, make the turn up, two holds, whatever, main 25 left. Thank you. 7216 right, turn hotel number six, holds, whatever, main 25 right at Julian. Fighting able, working on base, hotel seven. Bird, that's that's okay, either way. This full trip to 2-5 right Julian. Turn to 2-5 right Julian, stop for 20 seconds. Rob Thompson with a $2 Super Chat. Thanks so much, Rob. Up at 3.30 a.m. making coffee. Forgot about the time change. You sound like me, Rob. I got up. My alarm went off at 3.30. And I totally forgot that I lost an hour of sleep, which would normally feel like 2.30. It didn't really didn't matter to me. Got the coffee flowing. Got to work. Felt like I need any other morning until I walked out of the office this morning and I remembered it was still dark out at 6.30 in the morning. I thought, ah, oh, I forgot about that. It's the 777 at 300ER with American. So next arrival on 25 at left, coming in from Sydney, Australia. Next arrival is on a six and a half mile funnel, runway two five left, one on the way. Bottom of the way, five left, ten right. Tip with 224, minimum delay, please. RNAV Docker, wind zero zero three, runway two five right for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, five right. RNAV Docker, tip with 224. Second, 834, contact departure. Four, three, 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 so we got that 777 freighter heading to 25 left for a takeoff. Flight heading to JFK. All right, we've got the triple seven freighter now rolling it down at two five left. It's a brand new triple seven freighter. Just delivered it in December of last year. Again, MSC Air Cargo. It's operated by Atlas Air. Scout 6270, lost his tire number three. Wind calm, runway 25 left, clear to land. Clear to land number three, 7275 left, scout 4073 tower. Turn for four, wind calm, runway 
two five left in Atlanta. Two five left in Atlanta. Gus forty seven three left turn number two when calm. Remain two five left for Atlanta. And America, Next take off on two five right. Alaska Airlines flight thirteen thirty six oh, heading yeah. to Puerto Vallarta yeah. in a seven thirty seven Max nine. And American okay, Airlines well, flight yeah. two heading to the JFK. Two, it's an A three twenty one number two for takeoff. Followed by American Airlines flight twenty six twenty seven sixty six heading to Dallas Fort Worth Texas, also in an A three twenty one. And JetBlue Airways flight seventeen hundred. It's an A321, also in line here on the south side. A friend, Jim, with a $6 super chat. Good to see you, Jim. Morning, Kevin. Here's to a great Sunday show. Hoping we can turn the page after a tough week at United. I'll tell you what. When it rains, it pours. Right, Jim? But the good news is no one was hurt. Yes, a few planes a little beat up. But uh, the best news, no one was hurt in any of the incidents this week. American Airlines flight 607 and coming in from Chicago O'Hare in the 737 to 800. Next takeoff happening now. American Airlines flight 2 heading to JFK. It's an A321. American two contact departure. Departure, American two. Tower to fourteen eighteen gate two five left. So that American 777-300ER gate is currently occupied. So hanging out there, get some sun after that long flight from Sydney. Kitten Duo becoming a silver member once again. Thank you so much, Kitten Duo. Danny Ortiz with a $5 super chat. Thank you so much, Danny. Good morning, Kevin and AVL family and friends. How are you, Kevin? Always and enjoy the live stream from LEX. Can Bob leave us? Can Bob leave us going to Las Vegas? Bob, you want to go to Vegas? You want to go to Vegas? He said, sure. <laughs> sure, why not? <laughs> so he has a puzzled look on his face. Uh, Danny, I'm doing good. Uh, I'm sure you guys saw on social media that we, Rudy and I had a photo shoot yesterday in Pasadena, yes, a, a photo shoot, full-on photo shoot. Um, I put a little teaser of, of it. Oh, I'm good. I put a little teaser of it. Bob is offering me a Pop-Tart. <laughs> I didn't know you ate Pop-Tarts, Bob. I had no idea. I thought, you just, I thought your whole diet was in and out burger. All right, well, add that to the list, Pop-Tarts. All right, so yes, we had a photo shoot yesterday. Uh, it went really well. This is, uh, well, it's for a lot of things. Um, obviously, we need some stock photos of Rudy and I. Um, so yeah, it was a good photo shoot. We were busy with that yesterday. Hey. It was 1700. Unfortunately, for whatever reason, they missed, they missed that. And uh, I don't know how you didn't get that edict time because it was sent to you for CBDLC. Taxi down the runway, exit right at Fox so, yeah, Trot. Yeah, have been busy. And then into Charlie and turn left. All right, Fox Trot, 
Charlie, and we'll turn left on Charlie. Okay, and they, they did give you a little bit better time, 1600, just because uh, of your situation. So uh, 1600 will be the wheels up time, so that 50, 55 will put you on the runway. So just, again, into Charlie, turn left, contact round 0.75. I think they're talking to the Jet Blue. Yeah, we'll go on Charlie, and we'll call ground over there for Jet Blue 1700. Good 1952, Jet Blue 1700. Right on the What's up? The North Complex. Away. United, right are you getting ready? Are you getting ready your United stuff after the week? <laughs> Our friend Steve, right there, he's giving me a United Airlines cards, playing cards. <laughs> I was joking with him. What are you getting ready your United stuff after the week they've had? <laughs> Record 2018 at Juliet. Thank Traffic you, Steve. will hold in position. Cross two five right ground point seven five. Juliet, clear across 25 right, ground All right, so that will, JetBlue is uh, turned off the runway. Up next, American Airlines flight 1952 heading to Charlotte, 8321. Followed by Alaska Airlines flight 1332, 737-900ER heading to Cabo. Also, Spirit Airlines flight 2456 heading to Dallas, Fort Worth, Texas, an A320. That American 777-300ER now starting heading to a gate. Not quite sure where they're going to put the 777. More than likely, I think heading into Tom Bradley as I see Terminal 4 is still packed with planes. So more than likely heading to Tom Bradley, this American 777-300ER coming in from Sydney, Australia. becoming a silver member here today. Thank you so much, Bill. And Barbara, member for nine months. This gold member says, good morning, Kevin. Thank you for the best plane spotting channel. You are awesome, Barbara says. Well, thank you so much, Barbara. Appreciate those kind comments. Christian, a member for one month as a gold member says, hello from Venezuela. Have a beautiful day. Viewers, Kevin and crew, your streams are now always on my TV. As I work from home. Oh, that's great. You know, we are good background noise. <laughs> good background noise. And we make an even better radio station. When you have us just in your car on the, your radio, it's great FM radio. And background noise. The 20 0 8 LA Tower wind 0603 runway 2 5 left, good land. Alaska 1332 one out Docker wind 0 one takeoff. Okay, you got our uh, spare wings 2456 two five right line of point. And two five right line of point three four three. So American surely American slowly but surely making the way over there to the southeast corner of Tom Bradley. Now, the Super Chess, thank you so much. Niles is high, I'll stay all night to watch the big Sunday show. Well, thank you. Don't lose too much sleep. <laughs> Which is always, there's always a replay. Of course, it's much more fun when we watch it live so we can watch it all in real time together. And the flight to Cabo, now rolling down at 2-5 right. I was expecting that Cayman Airways 737 MAX 8 to push back. Still sitting there at the gate. Our next takeoff here on the south side is Spirit Airlines flight 2456 heading to Dallas, Fort Worth, Texas in a 12-year-old A320. Yeah, 
76 RNF Docker, wind 073, wind 025, wind 70 Docker. Wind 076 RNF Docker, wind 0702, wind 025, rain line avoid. 0622, line avoid, 25 right. Spirit 2456, contact departure. Take care, 2456. Contact departure. Gosh, I hope we hear tater tot today. Thirty-nine Aeronautica Chief gifting five airline videos live memberships. Thank you so much, Thirty-nine Aeronautica Chief. Bob's over there enjoying his pop tart. I had no idea he liked pop tarts. It was very nice of him to offer me a pop tart. <laughs> All right, Bob, put the pop tart down and drop the box, Bob. Thirty-nine Aeronautica Chief. Gifting five Airline Videos Live memberships. That was United Airlines flight 1276 heading to Cancun, Mexico at that 737-900ER. Up next, American Airlines flight 1622 heading to Reagan National in A321neo. It's followed by Alaska Airlines flight 1338 heading to Cancun at the 737-MAX-9. Christian with the super chances. Good morning, Kevin. OG LA plane spotter. Well, thank you so much. <laughs> the OG. You know, at the photo shoot yesterday, the photographer was asking, were you, were you the first, you were the first live streamer, airport live streamer in the US? I said, yeah. Of course, Jerry was the first. There was a few others in Europe, but we were the first airport live streamer here in the U.S. The original. That is Delta Airlines Flight 392. They're on taxiway Kilo. We'll be heading to Reagan National, the 757-200. The 757 originally delivered to TWA in February of 1999. So the 1481 LA Tower, wind calm, runway 25 left, little end. 25 left, little end. 2010, hold short of runway 25 right to Julian. Short 25 right to Julian, Mark. We'll be making that left-hand turn into Taxiway Bravo. Next takeoff here on the south side, American Airlines flight 1578 heading to Boston at an A321.
a member for 23 months as a golden member. Thank you so much, Charles. So it's good morning, everyone. One more month for the two-year anniversary. Still hoping for a live stream of my home airport, Atlanta. Well, Charles, we'll see what happens. <laughs> it's, it's, it's on the list. It's not on the short list, but it is certainly on the list. United Airlines flight 1185 heading to Cabo and then A320. Next up, United Airlines flight 1416 heading to Houston, Texas and a 737 at MAX 8. Followed by United Airlines flight 1890 heading to Newark and a 757 at 200. She is in Wisconsin, a member for 17 months as a silver member says, I want my hour back. <laughs> I think so does this airport. Boy, it's... It's quiet. I wouldn't say it's it's not busy, but it just seems quiet. Like everyone's still asleep. Of course, it will be rocking and rolling here all day long. I said 458, taxi up to the whole bar, please. And I'm pushing back the Qantas A380 Super, originally coming in from Sydney, Australia, Flight 11. That will be towed to the Qantas hangar out to the west side. Our friend Jesse with a $5 Super Jet. Thanks so much, Jesse. Good morning, Kevin. Flying from Sydney on a daylight savings night day. Must be so much more disorienting, eh? I would say so. You gonna try it, Jesse? <laughs> try it. Let us know how it goes, Jesse. Also pushing back a United Dreamliner. That flight also coming in from Australia. That will be towed to the Tech Ops Center, the new hangar here at LAX. Joni Swanson with a $4 Super Jet and a cup of coffee. Thank you so much, Joni. You know what I need in the morning, Joni. Thank you. Richard Flair with an awesome $20 Super Chat. Thanks so much, Richard. Hello from Chicago. Here in Chicago Midway, Kevin. I saw Nick Flight X getting a tour of Hawaiian's new Dreamliner at LAX. I'm surprised you weren't hiding inside the Dreamliner to drive, dive, bomb his video. Uh, well, we were busy yesterday with a photo shoot in Pasadena. That is why we weren't there yesterday. It just so happens that one Saturday we <laughs> sent up for a photo shoot is the day that I actually had that media event. Oh well, next time. Next time. Next takeoff is at Delta Airlines Flight 392 heading to Reagan National, 757 at 200. 
I'm sure there's plenty of videos and photos out there of inside the Dreamliner. Our next behind the scenes exclusive behind the scenes video with Breeze Airways coming up in just a few weeks. Charlie sent me the script. What was it the other day? I haven't even had time to read it. <laughs> I was like, sorry, we've been kind of busy. I will, I will read it tomorrow, and I will officially voice, voice the script tomorrow, so you can start editing. We are planning to release that video on the 23rd. That's a Saturday before we head to New York JFK Hotel. So. I don't want to hold him up anymore, so if Kevin's got to get, got to get on it. Got to send him my voice so he can start working on our next BTS video. I can't wait to show it to you guys again. Breeze Airways. This is the United Dreamliner making that left-hand turn, heading to the hangar, and this Qantas A380 Super also heading to a hangar on the west side. We did get an, a really gorgeous shot of that Hawaiian Dreamliner arriving here on Friday night. We were high atop the H Hotel, arriving on the north side, arriving on 24 right. During Nighthawk, I post the video later that night. It's a beautiful shot of it arriving for the very first time. Historic moment here at LAX in Hawaii. Of course, they won't start passenger service until May. So we will certainly see that Dreamliner here very often, certainly in the morning. Next takeoff is Alaska Airlines flight 1414, heading to Liberia at 737 ER. We got the metal birds. We got the humming birds. You know, I'm telling you, <laughs> animals know when there's a, a video camera on them. I'll tell you what, animal it really knows when you got a video camera on them. Horses, horses, they can pick up on that kind of stuff. It's really strange. Kitten Duo, gifting one airline videos live membership. Thank you so much, Kitten Duo. GE with the two dollar super chat. Let's switch GE. Is this any thoughts on the recent airline issues? Well, the wheel falling off. That that is interesting because that doesn't happen too often. You know, I was Fox 11 was here. We were out here covering the diversion of that 777 after it took off from SFO, diverting here to LAX. So I was out here doing a live stream, and next to me was ABC Network. They did a little news hit. And then the local Fox station that I used to work at came out here and was covering the story, and Susan, the reporter, 
interviewed me about what I thought about it and, and stuff like that. And I was telling her, I'm like, you know, this really doesn't happen too often. A wheel falling off of a plane. If I remember correctly, the last time a wheel fell off of a plane was the Dreamlifter with Atlas Air. Correct me if I'm wrong. I'm sure there might have been others, but at least in the U.S., I think that was the last one. And, of course, there was video of that as well. So I'm selling her it doesn't happen too often. Wheels falling off of planes. She was kind of surprised by that. She goes, well, I feel like we're doing the story all the time. I'm like, well... The wheels are not falling off the plane all the time. I, I said, alert twos happen all the time. Certainly, things happen, hydraulic issue, whatever it may be. But wheels falling off, not not a, it's a kind of a rare thing. Speak of the devil. <laughs> we were just talking about about you, except that was the triple seven two hundred. The the the, f the flight diverting here to LAX. The one losing the wheel on Thursday was a triple seven two hundred ER. That was just a triple seven two hundred. Up next, American Airlines flight seventeen ninety nine heading to Philadelphia in a triple seven two hundred ER. Still trying to figure out what 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 was the cause of the gear collapse of the 737 Max 8 in Houston? Was that was that pilot error? Was it caused by a wind? Was it? fast and slick runway. Well, I mean, that's better than the alternative, I guess, which is a fault fault with the gear. That would cause a lot more of a mess with the airlines. Um, interesting. And of course, the one we caught on Friday was, was a hydraulic issue with the A320. That, not a rare occurrence. We have seen that certainly uh, many times, certainly with different aircraft, the A320, the 757. So, GE, to answer Sorry, your question, I, you know, United's just having a bad week, and they'll be fine. They'll be fine. Everything's... It's just, you know, when it rains, it pours. Another 2609, RNF Docker, went calm, runway 25 right, clear for takeoff. RNF Docker, clear for takeoff, 25 right, United 2609. Last 1179, LA turn with 2 right line of the way. 2 right line of the way, let's do it. That was Hawaiian Airlines flight 33 heading to Kahalui at 8.330, taking off there on the south side. Our next takeoff here on the east. I'm sorry, north side, south side, United Airlines flight 2609 heading to Boston. It's a 757 and 200. Left 1129, RNAV Docker, wind calm, runway 25 right, clear for takeoff. RNAV Docker, 
at the gates. Our next takeoff is Alaska Airlines flight 1179 heading to Seattle, 737-800. We also have Air Canada flight 776 heading to Montreal at an A330-300 wearing the Star Alliance livery. And it's heading to two five rights. Up on the north side, Philippine Airlines flight 112 coming in from Manila on the 777-300ER. If you guys haven't yet, make sure to hit that like button, feed the bees, subscribe if you're new, and make sure your notifications are all set. Cross 25 right, ground point 75. Cross 25 right to ground point 75. Avia Tonka 732, Austin Star number 2, wind 0 8 0 3, runway 25 left, clear to land. Clear to run, runway 2 5 left, I'm going to take a 7 Alaska 1179, contact departure. Alaska 1179, get it. Got a 99 heavy, turn right Hotel Niner, hold short of runway 2 by right. Hotel Niner, hold short 2 by right. Twilight 800, Delhi Tower, good morning. Good morning, Twilight United Dreamliner here on the south side of Robin on 25 at left. This flight coming in from Melbourne, flight 99 on the 787-9 Dreamliner. Scouts 4118, wind 0803, RNAV Docker, runway 25 break for takeoff. RNAV Docker, runway 25 break for takeoff, scouts 4118. Runway 25 right, intersection Fox Trail, line up and wait. Off the white, uh, 25 right, intersection Fox Trail. You're probably wondering, Kevin, all this action is great, but where are those A380s? Well, our first one, Korean Air Flight 17, coming in from Seoul, the A380 Super, now just 21 minutes away. Remember, now these arrive a little later in the morning. Scheduled arrival at 8.30. Oops. <laughs> Make sure to hit that like button. Uh, scheduled arrival at 8, I'm sorry, 9.30. Estimated now at 9.09. Asiana Airlines late 2.02 coming in from Seoul as well. Scheduled arrival 9.40. Estimated now at 9.21. And that is 32 minutes away. Right also, have Cathay Pacific flight 84 coming in from Hong Kong in the 777 and 300ER, 45 minutes away. Here on the south side, China Airlines cargo flight 5382 coming in from Taipei, a 777 freighter now just seven minutes out. Also, Korean Air cargo flight 8207 coming in from Seoul, 777 freighter 22 minutes away. Still waiting on that Air Canada A330 here on the south side. A friend at 757 Chip gifting five airline videos live memberships. Thank you so much, Chip. Chip, you like Pop Darts? <laughs> Air Canada 776 heavy RNAV Docker, wind 070 at 4, runway 25 right full length, for takeoff. I used to eat Pop Tarts. Not anymore. Bob, you ready? All right. Drop up, Bob. So, if I saw that ship, gifting five airline net videos live. Membership, thanks so much, Chip. Flight 100, contact departure. Out of departure. Scout 3255, flash recoveries, traffic will cross town field, remain two by right bowling, line up and wait. Cover it, bowling, line up and wait.
I used to eat those pop tarts as a kid, and I, you know, what they come in like three to a box. <laughs> you just can't eat one. Of course, they come two in a pair, but geez, too good, too good. That's why I don't eat them anymore. I just, I can't eat just one. No, you guys are all going to start bringing me pop tarts now. Thanks, Bob. Nitro Don Clark, company Silver member once again. Thank you so much. Michael Quinn, a member for 12 months, is a platinum member. This is on the United Airlines Max 8. What isn't clear to me if the gear collapse caused it to go off the runway or did it going off the runway cause the gear to collapse? Looking forward to a great show as always. Yes, Michael, I agree with you. And I think that was my question. It's like, was the gear collapse because of running off the runway or did it run off the runway because of a gear collapse? So I think that's where my, my confusion was. It, it's, is it a mechanical issue or is it a pilot error? Docker, wind 0804, runway 25 right, quick for takeoff. Runway 25 right, quick for takeoff, runway 0832. Level 924, lost in the tower, runway 25 right, line up and wait. Richard Fleur back with the $10 Super Chat. Thanks so much, Richard. Kevin, landing gear is supposed to lock when deployed. Pilots are also supposed to follow the yellow lines on the runways and the taxiways. Yes, absolutely, but do we have enough information to know if any of that was the root cause? Cayman Airways, the 737 MAX 8, now pushing back. Next takeoff is American Eagle Sky West, flight 3255, heading to Denver, in an E-175 LR. Next thing off here on the south side, Delta Airlines flight 924 heading to Dallas, Fort Worth, Texas, and an old Northwest 8320. Be followed by United Airlines flight 2039 heading to Chicago here in a 737 900ER. Got the Philippine at triple seven at 300 ER. Should be making that left hand turn on to Lima. And the Philippine 777 now making that left hand turn onto Lima. We'll be heading to the gates of the hottest club. Our next off here on the south side. United Airlines late 2039 heading to Chicago O'Hare and a 737 900 ER. Scouts 4643, wind 070 at 3, runway 25 right, let's take off. 
Line of the way, 25 right, American, and 2546. Got a 2039, contact, so got a departure. Good day, United Flight. Down to C5382, heavy, lost on the tire, number 2, wind 0703, runway 2, Bob Luffer to land. This is the Philippine 777. Make that turn, more than likely make a additional left hand turn onto Taxway Kilo, and then we'll continue going north, and then more than likely we'll make another left hand turn onto Taxway Delta, and then head into the north side of the west gates. Since the Cayman Airways 737 MAX 8 is currently blocking Taxiway Lima. CHF with the $5 Super Chat. Thanks so much, CHF. Good morning, Kevin. I'm looking forward to a great day of plane spotting. My favorite channel on YouTube. Thank you. Good morning, CHF. Appreciate that. Delta. A350 heading to Atlanta, flight 515, the A350 900, making that turn onto Kilo. Uh oh. <laughs> it's a face off between the A350 and the 777. So on Friday, I did see an A350 take off with Delta on the north side of 24 right. So the, those A350s can indeed take off on this shorter runway on the north side. Kevin Morgan with an awesome $20 super chat. Thanks so much, Kevin. Speculation is just that, speculation. Just got to wait until the NTSB preliminary report comes out. Absolutely, Kevin. I'm just asking questions. I'm not stating right, facts. 5389, we're gonna get a couple minutes in. Roger. We got our first A380 Super on the downwind legs flight. 17 coming in from Seoul. We'll be arriving on the north side at 24 right in about six minutes from now. 2546 contact departure. Good day, American 2546. This is Jet 968, runway 25 right, intersection Fox Trail, line of the way. The first of many A380 Supers here today, and of course it will land on the north side, but all 380 Supers and 747 8s now taking off here on the south side at 25 left due to construction on the north side, closing down runway 24 left. Can make the hard right turn on that occurred on Wednesday, Wednesday morning Check with your company, hold and will be closed until mid-July. Right so we got about six months of south yeah, side takeoffs. Right. Good morning, guys. 267 with the outside GTM official 25 left. 277, contact departure. Parks, yeah. Yeah, 267 in trail with a heavy Thank you. We got a 1093 cross 2 by right, ground point 75. Ground point 75, cross 7. Good to 9 heavy, turn left on Alpha 8, turn left on Alpha, don't stop. Alpha 8, don't stop. <laughs> don't stop. 29, you have an occupied gate, is that correct? Uh, I haven't been able to get a hold of them right. yet. Alpha okay. 8, turn okay. off. No going long for the okay, China Airlines Cargo 777 Great. Freighter. That's Cayman Airways heading to Georgetown, 737 MAX 8, currently in Taxiway Bravo, heading to 25 right. Things are starting to heat up here this morning. This Delta A350 now making that left-hand turn on to Bravo. This flight heading to it, Atlanta, Georgia. Sun Country 8501 at the shoreline, turn left heading 220, traffic 3 mile funnel, wind calm, runway 25 left, quick for takeoff. Left heading 220, 
25 left, clear for takeoff, my country, 85 by 1. Large time, 15, runway 25 right, full length, mounted away. Back at 1225, LA Tower number 2, wind calm, runway 25 left, clear to land. LA 25 left, clear to land. 7 contact ground Delta Heavy about to take off on 24 right on the north side. Delta Airlines flight 480 heading to Honolulu in a 767-300 ER. Next takeoff here on the south side on 25 right is Volaris flight 915 heading to Guadalajara in an A321. It's followed by United Airlines. Well, we have the Sun Country Hybrid. Take it off on 25 on the left. Sun Country 8501 at turn left heading 220. 20, Sun Country 8501. Sun Country 8501, contact, still better parts again. 124.3, grid A. Sun Country Airlines, 8501, heading to Kona, 737-800. We got that Delta 767-300ER heading to Honolulu. Taking off on the north side at 24 right. It's a gorgeous, beautiful day in the neighborhood. Michael with the ten dollar super jet. Thanks so much, Michael. Check out Juan at Blan Sirio about it. He explained the whole story. It looks like fast, fast taxi and wet runway. He's a triple seven pilot for American. Oh, and a good morning to all. I will check out Juan. Thank you for your awesome support. Green Air. Play 17 coming up from Seoul, our first A380 super arrival of the stream. Up next, boy, I'm going to tell you, Imperial Hill packed this morning already. Early birds. Over 3,000 of you guys watching all around the world. Thanks, you guys, so much. It's just after 9 a.m. We'll do an official top of the hour after this A380 arrival on the north side. Scouts 5389, wind calm, RNAV Docker, runway 25 right, clear to take off. All right, RNAV Docker, 25 right, clear to take off. Got a 417 contact departure. We're at 1225, you're right at Hotel 6 here. And then hold short of runway 2 by right of Juliet. All right, hotel 6, short of uh, 2 by right of Juliet, 12, 25. Cayman 481 LA Tower, traffic will cross runway 2 by right, line of the way. 2 by right, line of the way, copy the traffic, Cayman 481. Cross two by right, Who's excited to see this A380 take off on the south side? I am. Cayman Airways is our next takeoff here on the south side. It's like 481 heading to Georgetown. 
All right. Officially top of the hour time. Just after 9 a.m. here in beautiful Los Angeles, California, you are watching continuous live coverage of LAX plane spotting right here on your home for LAX live streams. That is Airline Videos Live. Today is a big Sunday show here on March 10th, 2024. And I am your plane jockey, Kevin, back here at Imperial Hill. Good to be here with all the other plane spotters already here. Plane that jockey Rudy will be joining me this hour, standing right next to me. Until then, sit back, relax. Good morning, good afternoon to all of you all around the world. Good to have you as we continue on here. Is the flight to Georgetown, the 737 Max 8, now rolling down. 25 right. Over a 25 from Bryant, Southwest Airlines flight 2150, coming up from the Valley of the Sun, Phoenix, Arizona, the 737 at Max 8. Next up, Delta Airlines flight 515, heading to Atlanta, Georgia, and an A350 900 now already rolling down. Very busy, 25 right. Yeah, 2361, turn number 3, wind 3, final 0 at 3, runway 250, we're slowing at 180, guys, we're American 1225, traffic in position, cross 2 right, ground 4 Next, another heavy United Airlines flight 1140 heading to Dulles in the 787 9 Dreamliner. Justin Shaw, a member for 31 months, is a Diamond member, has enjoyed your Friday night show, now ready for the big Sunday show. Yes, indeed, it was good. It was good, somewhat good day. We had to start a few times <laughs> due to some technical issues, but. Let's turned out well. That is Spirit Airlines flight 2322 coming up from Newark on this A320 at Neo. Got a 1006 caution with Germans from a 25 right line of void, LA Tower. Line of void, 25 right, 10 United 1006. 28207, heavy lock. Got Crane Air Cargo flight 8207 coming up from Seoul. The 777 freighter down just a minute out, number 2 for arrival here on the south side. Coletta Air flight 627 coming up from Anchorage, a 747 400 converted passenger plane, now cargo plane, 25 years of age, just 12 minutes out, heading toward the south side. It could be a flyover of us here at LAX. We'll keep an eye out for that. Right behind that queen is the king, Asiana Airlines, like 202, coming in from Seoul. A380 Super, now just 13 minutes out. X-ray Alpha, Charlie Alpha, Zulu, turn left at this next high speed, please. Left turn Alpha, 7, left turn on Alpha. Charlie Alpha, Zulu, remain as frequency, taxi to the ramp, where do you go today? Spirit 2322, cross 2 by right now, 4, 7, 5. Spirit 2324, keep the track, cross 2 by right now, 4, 7, 5. 
Turner, Swift 1814 with you, uh, keep on up. Swift 1814, only power number three, cost for German control and heavy triple seven. Wind calm, runway two five left, good land. Good land, keep on up, Swift 1814. Tom at 787. Play 8086, 787, nine Dreamlander now pushing back for Tom Bradley. Next take off is United Airlines flight 1006 heading to Las Vegas at the 737-900ER. It's followed by American Airlines flight 2343 heading to Raleigh-Durham at the 737-800. Where are they taking that? <laughs> Well, they're just moving the gate. So apparently the streamliner not taking off just yet. Moving the gates. Interesting. Patrick Smith, a member for 21 months, is a silver member. He's happy daylight savings day. All flights are early. <laughs> well, I don't know. Are they? Everything's been pushed back by like an hour. So originally the A380s coming from Seoul would have been arriving in the 8 a.m. hour. So that now pushes the departure times for the the A three eighty is heading back to Seoul now in the noon hour was eleven. Now at noon, so everything just gets pushed back by an hour. Just just said Korean Air Cargo 777 freighter making that left hand turn onto Alpha 8. Green Air, A380 Super making that left hand turn onto Lima. Setting off is Spirit Airlines Flight 203 heading to Charlotte. It's an A321 Neo. And that's followed by United Airlines Flight 1912 heading to Denver at a 737-800. Got that Kalena Air Queen. Looks like it is now making that turn. It'll be flying over us here. At LAX heading to the south side. It's flight coming in from Anchorage. Media are actually giving me a pretty hard time about calling the A380 the king. 
It's the king. <laughs> Sorry, at least here on the AVL, this is the king. Action going on. Set a nineteen twelve contact departure. You say a little wind. All right, our next A three eighty Super Asiana coming in from Seoul now in the down that wind that leg. Be arriving on the north side on 2 4 right in six minutes from now. say the king and you all know what I'm talking about when I say the king some people can't accept it that's fine Air Mexico flight 649 heading to Mexico City a 737 at max 9 I'm about to make that left hand turn onto Bravo it's followed by Delta Airlines flight 1143 heading to Houston, Texas, and an Airbus A220-100. Off here on the south side, American Airlines flight 31 heading to Honolulu. It's an A321 Neo. Just three minutes out from a south side arrival in Asiana, A3 and a Super now just four minutes out. Just over downtown Los Angeles. We'll be heading to 24 right there on the north side. Actually, 146. Coming up from Mexico City, it's an A321 Neo. Rudy's favorite. My out of the two liveries with Viva, I prefer the green over the, the orange, the peach color. Not a fan of the peach color. 
I like the green. Makes me thirsty for some Topo Chico. <laughs> By the way, the studio that we were at yesterday in Pasadena for the photo shoot, it actually had a self-serve Topo Chico. That's what we need in the office. Topo Chico self-serve. Up next for takeoff here on the south side, Alaska Sky West, flight 3363, heading to uh, San Jose, California. It's an E-175 LR. Actually, I take that back. There's another flight taken off before that, but it's not on my radar. Honey, 627 Heavy, where are you parking today? South Pad, um, uh, South Pad, Bravo. Roger. All right, number two for arrival here on the south side is Coletta Air, the queen that we just saw fly over us. Flight 627 coming up from Anchorage. It's a 25-year-old 747-400, an old passenger plane. Oh, Bob's leaving. All right, Bob. Bob, what kind of Bob uh, popcorn was that? Blueberry. No. no, no, no. <laughs> blueberry? It didn't look like a blueberry. <laughs> Thanks, Bob. Bob's taken off. <laughs> yeah, I saw a Delta Airlines flight 742 coming from JFK, 767-300ER, following that queen. On the north side, Asiana Airlines, Number two, the A380 Super. Asaf Era Union, flight 7004, coming up from Guadalajara. It's an Airbus A300. Four minutes out, south side arrival, 25 left. And also heading to the north side, Cathay Pacific, flight 84, coming in from Hong Kong on the 777-300ER, now just 16 minutes out from the arrival, a 2-4 right. The Coletta Air Queen, next arrival here on the south side, will she go along? Come on, go long. Haven't had very many go longs. So I think we had one last Sunday. Almost at the very end of the day. Looking pretty good. Still picking up some speed there. I'm feeling a go long on this one. And I think we got it. Officially going long. All right, should be making that left-hand turn on to Lima. That's an old passenger 747 400 now converted into a cargo plane. Is 
Luciana A380 Super is next arrival on the north side of 24 Ryan. Got kings and queens everywhere here this morning, and it will continue throughout the course of the day. I see a plane to jockey Rudy. Delta 767 at 300ER, touching down, coming up from JFK as the Kalina Air Queen continues down to Alpha. The A380 Super up next for arrival on 24 right. Air Sprint 20 LA Tower Radio Check. We're here. Thank you. This is Confirm for Air Sprint 20, 24 right. Air Sprint 820 Affirmative. You'll be moving towards the north side in a little bit. Yeah, north, thank you. Again, this A380 Super will be taking off on the south side here today on 25 left and will be for the next six months all the way into mid July. Delta 757 to 300, now take it off on 25 right. Hello, good morning. Well, it's a good thing we didn't pick the same color today. <laughs> Terry M with the two dollar super chat. Thanks so much, Terry. Good morning, Kevin from Winter Wonderland again. Uh oh, Did you guys get hit by some winter weather there in Michigan. Kevin Morgan, a member for 34 months, is a platinum member. Says there is so there is an actual Bob. There is <laughs> Taylor, Kevin a silver member once again. Thanks so much, Taylor. Yes, there's an actual Bob. But Bob, he's, his new thing now is to come and go. He doesn't just stay here all day. I don't know why he's gotten into coming and going throughout the course of the day. I don't know. It's like his new thing now. I don't know. I'm his boss, I don't know if I approve of that, but what am I to do? Bob does his own thing. United Airlines late 2013 coming in from Orlando, a 737-800 now crossing over 25 right. Aero Union, the A300 touching down here, coming in from Guadalajara. We'll not see this go to Lima as it will more than likely turn off at Alpha 7, possibly 8. Actually, it's going to be 7 because we still got that queen on Alpha. But good news is we probably will see it take off a bit later. Tater. Alpha 
Alpha 7, Alpha and Rome, 50 and I'm the only one in my family that doesn't wear glasses. So I think I'm, I'm doing something right. <laughs> All right, thank you. Looks like I got really warm. Sky West, American Eagle heading to SFO in an E-175. United Airlines heading to Tampa, Florida. United Airlines flight 279 and the 737 MAX 8 taking off. Over. Next takeoff here on the south side heading to Port Vierta. American Airlines flight 764 and the 737 800. Asiana A380 Super coming in from Seoul. We saw it arrive on the north side at 2-4 right, making its way over to the gates. 
Sox A380 Super will be taking off here on the south side. A 2-5 left a bit later tater in today's broadcast. Will we have both A380s, Korean Air and Asiana, taking off back to back? It's always a possibility. Will we see it here today? Stay tuned. Find out. How you like that for a teaser? <laughs> Hello. Good morning, Rudy. Good morning. How you doing? I'm. I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> are, you, are you suffering from a lack of an hour of sleep? Yeah, it kind of hit me a little bit. I'll be fine. I'll power through, as they say. I don't know. It didn't bother me at all. Of course, I'm always out of whack with time. <laughs> yeah, I woke up at 5.30. I was like, I can do this. And then I don't even remember falling back asleep, but I went back to sleep, and I woke up at 7, and then I was super groggy. Like, oh, I should have just stayed up. Too much sleep? Yeah, I've been suffering from too much sleep the last couple of days. Suffering for too much sleep. Yeah. Too much sleep equals grogginess. Well, then stop sleeping so much. Yeah, I'm just going to go back to getting no sleep. <laughs> Our friend Skittles with an amazing $75 super chat through PayPal. Thank you so much, Skittles. Skittles says, Kevin, I wish you both, you and Rudy, a great show today. Cheers. Cheers, Skittles. Thank you so much. Thank you. Amazing supports. Wow. Still working on all that coffee, Skittles. I'm about to open my first bag. Oh, your first one? Yeah, finally finished the industrial size Coffee from Costco. Oh, yes. This is Cathay Pacific, the 777-300ER coming from Hong Kong. Next arrival on 24 right. It's flight 884. Flight time is 11 hours and 34 minutes. I didn't see it not too long ago. Hours ago. Yeah. Feels like it was a minute ago. <laughs> Rudy and I had our official photo shoot yesterday I had a good time it's yeah. fun i was a little nervous going into it because i'm like really uh, just a little bit really i had no idea i'm like what we're just you nervous about i i was just hoping i wasn't gonna look tired or out of it but as soon as i started looking at you know the preview i'm like okay all right not too bad well we had a good photographer and knew no knew his lighting yeah expert i was really impressed Nothing a little Photoshop can't fix. <laughs> yeah, he did really well with just the raw pictures, oh, yeah. but I know he's going to do a great job with the oh, yes. editing. Can't wait. A lot of different poses we were doing yesterday. <laughs> Some a little goofy. <laughs> yeah, at one point I was like, I'm just going to make up my own poses and I wasn't sure how he was going to react to that because I was just being silly. And then he's like, no, I like that. No, more, okay. more. All right. At one point, we were acting, we were giving so many different poses. It's like, all right, smile on this one or do this one. <laughs> I, I, I was like, I felt like the movie Tootsie. Oh, yeah. <laughs> when Tootsie is doing the photo shoot and they're just, you know, all over the place. Zoom, zoom, zoom. <laughs> I'm like, can you keep up? <laughs> Yeah, it was a lot of fun. It's a good time. It might have to do that as like a yearly thing, you know, yeah, yearly on, photos, like yearbook pictures, yeah, like yearbook <laughs> photos. <laughs> Michael <laughs> becoming a silver member once again. Thank you so much, Michael. Slambo, a member for 15 months as a silver member, says welcome aboard, Rudy. Thank you. Taking off to West Palm Beach on an A321 JetBlue Airways, flight 2010. 
I feel like life is an hour behind today. Doesn't that just feel like it's... Like the, the energy is just... Everyone's still asleep. Oh, yeah. In that regard, it's an hour behind. But I'm like, I feel like I'm trying to catch up because we're an hour ahead now. But I, I see what you mean. Rita said she's going to make coffee later. Make it here? Yeah, I don't know what that means. Are we talking like Nescafe, like instant coffee? <laughs> Are we talking about like she's bringing her own coffee maker? Uh, I'm, I'm sure we're going to find out. Is she roasting the beans here at the hill? I'm <laughs> sure we're going to find out. Of course, all the Pond Airways flight 6 coming up from Tokyo to Rita, 787 9 one are on her way in, 27 minutes away, north side arrival. It's nice and sunny this morning. Yes, it's been a, a, a nice day. I mean, it, it feels like it got a little warm just now, but I suspect that it's going to do that back and forth, back and forth all day long. I've been kind of running around this morning trying to get some errands done before the work week, and I just felt like it's just warm. Maybe it's just because I'm moving it's around a lot. The sun, the sun. Yeah. If you're in the direct sunlight, the sun is it's hot. It's yeah. warm. Yeah. We didn't really get much of a winter break. I'll try to think of these moments when we're in New York. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> This is Delta Connection, 3766, taking off to Tucson, Arizona, on an E-175. And American Airlines, flight one, coming in from JFK on this A321. Speaking of JFK, I'm wearing my JFK t-shirt here today, getting prepared oh. for our trip. What is it? Three, three weeks, weeks from yeah. tomorrow? Yeah. Three weeks. Yeah, I woke up this morning thinking, okay, I have two more weeks of school, then I get a week off. That's when we go to JFK. Super thrilled about that. Yeah, I was also thinking it's kind of difficult for a lot of us to do this time change, but the good news is that we're going to get more sunlight. Yeah. So I do like that. Less Nighthawk as we continue into spring and summer, unfortunately. Apparently, Ed is misbehaving. Uh-oh, now what? Blackouts on BTS? Blackouts. Ed? Ed, were you partying too much last night? What's going on? No blacking out. <laughs> is it doing it right now? I don't know. Let's see. Looks fine to me. Here, run, run just an additional cord in one of the different outlets. And we give you eyes, and all of a sudden you think you can run the show. American 409 LA Tower, just waiting for traffic off the north side, runway 25 right line of boy. 25 right line of boy, American 409. Seems fine. Am I swapping it or just leave it? Just leave it for now. If it does it again, then just swap that out. Okay. You're Curtis, a member for seven months as gold member since good morning, Kevin and Rudy. Been an interesting week for United with those two diversions and the slide off the runway here in Houston. Yeah, we've been talking about it all morning. Bad week for United, but the, it'll be fine. 
PNYC, a member for 15 months, is gold that members to say Kevin and Rudy watching ABL from 31,000 feet and jump blue. It's like 426 as I make my way back to JFK from Tampa. Looking forward to the TWA Hotel Shows. Yeah, it's actually two weeks from tomorrow when we fly out. Two weeks? Yeah, two weeks. Oh. M G. Yeah. Wow. We have a lot to get done. <laughs> I gotta start packing. <laughs> start packing. I gotta look for all my warm attire. Layers, right? Layers. I don't know. You gotta pay attention to the the weather. I mean. They've been getting kind of all kinds of weather so far this year. Sometimes hmm. it's warm, sometimes it's really cold. Airlines flight 409 taking off to Eagle on an A319. So it looks like the Cathay Pacific 777 heading into one of the gates there on the north side. What is our flight info? It like leaves the A321. It leaves around like 4:30 on Monday. It's like one of the later flights out. It gets us to JFK just before 1 a.m. East Coast time. We're on JetBlue 11:24. Oh, he, see, Rudy's much more organized than your plane <laughs> jockey, Kevin. 15 days away. Got that DHL Polar Cargo Flight 962 still making, will be making her way to Cincinnati, a 777 freighter. I believe I announced that flight hours ago, still sitting here on the south side. This is Alaska Airlines Flight 310 taking off to Washington Dulles on a 737-800. Up next, Alaska Airlines Flight 1334 heading to Belize City and it's a 737-800. American 1393 Light Tower, heavy Dreamliner, short final convoy, turbulence, wind calm, runway 25 left, 30 land. If you guys are on Twitter, we're called X. Make sure to follow us. Our handle is Airline Videos. It's all one word, Airline Videos. Right there on Twitter, X. It's a great place to keep up to date with everything going on here on Airline Videos. And Airline Videos Live. American one traffic in position at Juliet cross runway 25 right half by the Delta here called ground now point seven five today. Cross two five right Juliet behind the uh, Delta over the ground, American one. This is Alaska Airlines 1334 taking off to Belize City on a 737-800. See ya! Here we have United, United 2434 20, coming in from Newark on a 787-10 Dreamliner. The Dreamliner has a beak, like a bird. Oh yeah. Flight time is four hours and 51 minutes. Here, birdie, birdie. Lars 923, wind calm, and a docker on a 25 right, let's take off.
Go 3144, let's turn to 25 right line point. 25 right line point, go 3144. A lot of plane Sorry, spotters morning, here already. Yeah, busy morning. Good morning, wind calm, runway 25. You, becoming a gold member. Thank you so much. So after the photo shoot yesterday, we went, had a little dinner. It was a place that was called Dog House. Yeah, Dog, Dog House. Dog House. You didn't like the hot dog. <laughs> yeah, at that point I was kind of full. It's a bit much. It was loaded with bacon. I didn't realize it had mustard. I'm not a huge fan of mustard. Should have said something. Oh, I saw it on the menu. This is Volani's 923 taking off to Zacatecas on an A320. Yeah, I'll be honest with you, like, the hot dog itself tasted kind of cold to me. Tasted. It was cold. Oh, like the, the sausage? The, the actual hot dog. Sausage, yeah. It just was kind of... Yeah. I don't know. That was the only part I really enjoyed, though. <laughs> it, it was good, but I just it, I wish it was a little warmer. I don't know. It was, it was okay. Yeah, it was a little bit too much for me, because I also had gotten a little bit of Ben's, uh, the, hamburger. the slider hamburger. They serve it on Hawaiian rolls, which is really good. But yeah, at that point, I was pretty full. Curtis, gifting one airline at a video's live membership. Thank you so much, Curtis. American 1393, Hotel 9 here to Lima, and Old Short. Last time I was at one of those dog houses, when I lived in Burbank, there was a Taco Bell, old old style Taco Bell, no okay. drive through, the old, you know, the old style Taco Bell. Yeah. It was still a Taco Bell when I moved to Burbank, and eventually they closed down that Taco Bell. It's right across the street from Warner Brothers Studios. and. Eventually, they turned it into a doghouse. Oh, it's okay. a, it, you know, it's still. They didn't add anything to it. I mean, it's still the signs of an old Taco Bell. Huh. But the one there in Pasadena yesterday, that was a much bigger doghouse than I have been to. No, that was a fun place, fun spot. There was a flea market happening that was actually. By the time we went to dinner, it was already kind of wrapped up. I love Secretary Pasadena. Yeah. It's a fun spot. Old Town, Old Town Colorado Boulevard. Boulevard. There's a lot to do up there. Yeah. Got to go back some time. It's a track. <laughs> How long did it take you to get there? Uh, it took me about an hour to get there and about Ooh. 45 minutes to get back. It actually took me longer to get back. I'm surprised. Because on the way there, it was about 35 minutes. And on the way back, it was about 45. Not huh. that much longer, but... Did you take the 110? No. I took the... I think I hopped on the 5. Okay. okay. To the... Uh, oh, okay. Gotcha. Yeah. This is Sun Country Airlines 8724 taking off to Kansas City on a 737-800. We'll see a rare bird coming here to the south side. It's an older Canyon Blue 737-700 with Southwest. I wonder how many more they have of these left. It's not very many. That is for sure.
Thing is, there's not very much wind right now. Uh uh. The trees are not even swaying. Not even one bit. <laughs> Nothing. No wind. Look at that. Guy with 196 contact with Next takeoff here on the south side. Delta Airlines flight 811 heading to Miami, Florida, 737 900 ER. Aeromexico flight 646 committed from Mexico City, a 787 8 Dreamliner, seven minutes out, south side arrival. On the Pond Airways Flight 6, coming up from Tokyo to Rita, 787-9 Dreamliner, 18 minutes out. Tower, hello, 2X405, uh, all the video for traffic, 2 and Doctor, and five right left, take off. Direct 105 LA Tower, wind calm, runway 25 left, third to land. Left land, 25 left, QRX, 105. Go, 76 LA Tower, wait for one off the north side, travel across, runway 25 right, line of way. Delta 811, contact departure, good day. Pet sitting the plane spotter with the $10 super chat. Thank you so much. Pet sitting the plane spotter. Thank you, Kevin, and for your weekly streams. You're the only channel I watch, and you brighten my day. Some days, this is the only people interaction I have in my line of work doing pet care. Ooh. Well, thanks for all that you do. Yeah. Very nice. You pick the right channel, come to the right place. Nothing wrong with hanging out around a bunch of pets. I love pets. I love pets. Especially cats. Some days I'd rather be <laughs> hanging out with a bunch of dogs and cats than yeah. <laughs> people any day, right? <laughs> exactly. American 1393, this is Alaska Airlines 1406 taking off to Manzanillo on a 737-900ER. It's like coming in from Nashville, Tennessee, American Airlines, like 1393, a 737-800 not crossing over 25 right. How are your cats doing? They are good. I so I got this package in the mail uh, and it was filled have, with JFK uh, merch. Yeah. I'm like, yes. oh, it's Christmas. So I emptied it out. Yeah. And guess who moved into the box? Ah, <laughs> Toby. Toby, he claimed it right away. So on my way out this morning, I'm like, Toby, where are you? Out? You know, because one time. Wait, hold on. Okay. Claimed it? So Daisy yeah. would want it too? No. Oh, no, she wouldn't. One time I was in a rush headed out to the grocery store thank goodness i was only gone for a little bit and when i got home i couldn't find toby i'm like toby toby where are you and i felt so bad i opened up my patio door i had locked him into my patio like balcony oh no and it was it was a little bit warm that day so i, I felt so bad and like i said thankfully i was only gone for about 15 20 minutes but poor toby he was I could tell he was kind of frightened, like, you forgot about me. Oh. So ever since then, I've always made it a point to make sure I know where he is. Like, he, you're, you're in here, right? You're not in the, in the balcony or, you know, he likes to run out if I open the door. So I made sure he was inside the apartment, and of course he was in that box. Boy, oh boy. So I'd be surprised. I wouldn't be surprised if when I get back home after the stream today, he's still in the box. <laughs> <laughs> we should make it, put a, a door on the box and yeah, make it into a house. Yeah, it's a good idea. By the way, that, that golf stream in G650 ER that we just saw land coming in from Monterey, Mexico. Guitar executive. Or is that Monterey, California? 
That is Monterey, California. California. Yeah. Rachel, a member for three months, is gold at member since three months already. Jeez. It's all right, Rachel. Thank you. This is Alaska Carter, Airlines 1442 right right taking off to Zihuatanejo on a MAX 9. Frank Russell back with a $5 super chat. Thanks so much, Craig. A city that never sleeps. Avial that never sleeps. JFK is a perfect match. This will be epic. Will be my second time there. First time for Rudy. Well, first TWA. time plane spotting and TWA. Yes. Yeah. This will be my third time in New York Down in general. Three, 42 LA car truck will cross down field at full length of runway 25 right. Line up and wait. Full length of runway 25 right. Line up and wait. And that officially takes us to the top of the hour. <laughs> Just after 10 a.m. here in beautiful Los Angeles, California, you are watching continuous live coverage of LAX plane spotting right here on your home for LAX live streams. That is Airline Videos Live. Today is a big Sunday show here on March 10th, 2024. The plane jockeys back together here at Imperial Hill. Thanks, you guys, for tuning in. We're just getting started here today. Hope you guys are all having a great weekend. Welcome, Rudy. Yes, happy Sunday and happy daylight saving time. Yep, I'm feeling happy. it. <laughs> Steve's over there. <laughs> oh, he's, he's sleeping. Yeah, he's sleeping and taking photos. We need Thanks the coffee. Guys. <laughs> oh, yeah, where's the coffee, Rita? Yeah, Jeez. Rita. Come on, Rita. <laughs> Make sure to hit that like button if you haven't yet. Share the stream. This is Delta Atlantic 341 to an A350 900. To land, Next takeoff, Southwest Airlines flight 3642 heading to San Antonio, Texas. And an Old Canyon Blue 737-700. Like I mentioned, we're not going to see too many more of these. Months ago, there was only like three left. So I don't know if this, this could be the last one for all I know. Yeah. Did you know Southwest that it's not daylight savings? It's not plural. Right We're not Docker savings anything? No, it's <laughs> saving. <laughs> daylight saving time. I mean, we've got a bunch of plane spotters over here. You know what's missing today, this morning? Families. They're all sleeping in here today because usually the families are all hanging out to the right of me. Plane spotters always over there. Families, MIA this morning here at Clutters. We are quickly approaching the spring break season. I don't think schools around here are on spring break just yet, but in the next couple weeks coming up. This is Southwest Airlines 3642 taking off to San Antonio, Texas on a 737-700. Face to face, another A350. Should be making that left hand turn onto Bravo. How are you? <laughs> Of the north side and the full length of runway 25 right line of way. 
That is JetBlue 324 taking off to JFK on an A321. John, a member for 12 months. It's a gold member. It says, good morning, Kevin and Rudy. Operating Alaska Airlines flight 380 today to Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Have a blessed day, Team Topo Chico. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I got your email this morning, John. We will uh, definitely be tuning in as you take off this morning. Oh, we can't miss it. San Francisco Giants yes. special livery, right? Special livery on that Max 9. John, did you know you have a special livery this morning? I wonder if sometimes the pilots just like, walk up to the plane and they're like, oh, I got a special livery today. Oh, nice. Yeah. All right. Bonus. <laughs> Next takeoff here on the south side. American Airlines flight 2608 heading to Chicago O'Hare, 737-800. It's followed by American Airlines Flight 990 heading to Atlanta, Georgia in an A321. Yeah, that's the one thing I'm really excited about when we head out to JFK. Are we going to have a something special? Oh, the newer livery? Perhaps. I don't know. With my luck, I, I never get the specials. <laughs> you know what? I would ra I'd rather have a newer A321 with newer cabin yeah. and the older livery. Yeah, obviously the A321 Neo coming back is a newer plane. This is American Airlines 2608 taking off to Chicago O'Hare on the 737-800. Bienvenidos, Aeromexico 646 coming in from Mexico City on a 7878 Dreamliner. American 2608, contact departure. Is this thing working? It's working. Okay. <laughs> Jeff Blue 1388, LA Tower. 1388, up. Ready to go? Ready to go. Blue 1388, relay 25 right, line up away. 25 right, line up away, Jeff Blue 1388. The flight coming in from Mexico City. 787 8 Dreamliner. See, if you notice, this has a registration here in the US. I believe this is one of the Dreamliners that is partially owned by Delta. American 990 contact departure. Departure, good day, American 990. Jeff Blue 1388, wind calm, RNF Docker, only 2-5 right, clear for takeoff. 2-5 right, clear for takeoff, RNF Docker, Jeff Blue 1388. Jeff Blue 1388, only 2-5 right, line of some ARF trucks making a move, but I don't believe there's anything. I usually get alerts on my phone about any alerts here at LAX, and nothing on my phone. Let's go. Hey, Tower, making a point. Oh, What's your name? American 2012 LA Tower. Oh, nice. Winter 1013, runway 25 left. Go to land. Go to land. 25 left. American 2012. Scott, where are you from? Covina. All right. American 2012, what's the gate today? 42 Bravo. Roger. Yeah, we're just coming in from Beijing. Wow. Go 3241 RNF Docker on a 25 right clip takeoff. 25 right clip takeoff. RNF Docker, no thanks. American 2012, 
This is JetBlue Airways 1388 taking off to Boston on an A321. Somebody has an ambulance waiting for them. I don't see anything. Wyatt Flight 3 heading to Honolulu, heading up to the north side. Squat, uh, squat, you cat, uh, spot uh, the 20 dollar uh, super shot here today. I think some squat cats. Minutes, March 10, 1956 in England. The first aircraft to exceed 1,000 miles per hour is an Engli Eng English ferry Delta II piloted by Lieutenant Peter Twist. It reaches the speed of 1,132 miles per hour, a world record at the time. Well, thank you so much. Swan Cats and all this day in history. <laughs> thank you. You know, no matter what day, it always seems there's some aviation history. On the Pond Airways. Flight coming from Tokyo Arena, next arrival on the north side at 2-4 right. Flight time from Tokyo is 8 hours and 57 minutes. Up next, Delta Airlines about 341. It's an A350-900. Next takeoff here on the south side at 25 right. Dreamliner, this Dreamliner, Air Mexico Dreamliner will head to the north side to the gates of Tom Bradley. Hi, how's it going? Well, 341 heavy with Say zero and zero at oh, three. You're welcome. Doctor on a two five right, let's take off. Oh, excellent. Two five right, take some stickers. Rudy, you know Rudy, right? <laughs> Hi, what's your name? No, good to meet you. Thank you so much. Eric, <laughs> they're working on a gate for you, you that uh, won't be occupied, so join Hotel to Juliet, Bolt Shore, runway 25, oh, right? Oh, very What's nice. Let's show a 25, right, American. Uh, oh, okay. Okay. So yeah. The Dreamliner will head to the north side. We've got that E350 now rolling down at 25 right here on the south side, the second E350 Delta flight of the day. This is Delta Airlines 341 taking off to Atlanta on an A350-900. Air Canada 785, LA Tower, good morning, wind 350 at 3, runway 25 left, Atlanta. 25 left, Atlanta, Air Canada 785. By the way, today is our big Sunday show. What does that mean? Oh, yes. I just had something fly into my eye. <laughs> well, <laughs> someone's excited. All right. No Bob here. He already left. He was here this morning, took his pop tart, and he left. What are we supposed to do now? I know. Ed, Ed, <laughs> why don't you show him what oh, we got boy. first? How about an official Airline Videos Live t shirt? This could be yours if you're an ABL member and are in the chat. We give you a code word to enter. Our first live drawing of the show will happen next hour. Oh, yes. In the meantime, you can go check out shopabl.com, pick out your color. 
American 24. Who's excited for that? I'm always excited. Right yeah. I'm always excited to see who's going to win. Yes, exactly. Oh, what is this? Bonza? Bonza? This must be Flair. What's Bonza doing here? <laughs> must be operating for Flair. Yes, yes. I've seen Bonza flies into, is it, is it Melbourne or Sydney? Oh, it is Flair. So Flight Radar's got it wrong. Interesting. <laughs> Here, I thought we were going to have something special. Forty-nine thirty-two, wind calm. Right after Docker, runway two five right. Clear for takeoff. Right after Docker, two five right. Clear for takeoff. Japan Airlines flight six two, coming up from Tokyo to Rita. Seven eighty seven eight, Dreamliner. Nine minutes out. Delta Airlines flight four two, the A three fifty nine hundred, coming up from Sydney, Australia. Running a little late here today, still 32 minutes away. Bonza is leased from Flair Airlines. And he recently repainted. Oh, yes, the risk guy was 4835. That was 4835, thanks. You're going to Omaha, correct? Yes, sir, Omaha, Nebraska. That's 4835. Scout 4835, pulling front way 25 right, line up the way. Pulling 25 left lineup or 25 right lineup and waste goes 4835. Thanks. Where did you just see the, the camera sitting over there? Yes. Ooh. And <laughs> getting even more excited. Well, I. Should we show it off? Yeah. So we finally got our, our new cameras for some behind the scenes content. Not. It's a little different content that we, you've been seeing with behind the scenes. This is, this is your plane jockeys behind the scenes. It's a DJI Osmo 3. It's a little gimbal. I don't know if you saw that. That was cool. It's, it's like staring. It's like a little robot. Yeah, it went, um, so we have two of these. So Rudy will have one. I'll have one. We've got little uh, wireless microphones that you connect to it so you can hear. I almost want to name so, R2-D2. Beep boop. Yeah. <laughs> So it's fairly easy to so use, not calm, sponsored by any means. We paid full right, price for these. Hi. We'll do a, how about we'll test it out today. We'll have a little behind the scenes content here today. Yeah, there you go. All right. Testing one, two. Anyway, this is what we're going to be using. We're uh, live. I don't know. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> we'll do as much American BTS content as we can. This will be a little bit different than our main BTS stuff. Okay. Right, Rudy? That is correct, sir. You are correct. All right. <laughs> so I'll let Rudy play around with this. So basically, if you want to do selfies, you just click on this button. Nah. Oh. Like that. Oh. oh, okay. If you want to <laughs> shoot me, then you just go back. There you we'll go. let Rudy play oh, with this. I'll put the microphone on just in case. We capture something good. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that, though. Yeah. Super right. cool. Oh, Allison. and it's stabilizing, too. Yeah. Allison's like, can I be on the vlog? Yes. Anybody coming to the JFK? I already told you. You don't have a choice. <laughs> This is American Eagle 4835 taking off to Omaha, Nebraska on an E-175. How does it feel? Good. You think I'm it's noticing easy it's, it's stabilizing it because I'm, you know, I don't have the most steady hand. Well, the thing with this is, and it's funny that Rudy is doing this because I, you don't, here's the thing with a gimbal, Rudy. You don't, you don't have to constantly be moving. <laughs> it, the gimbal is meant to be steady on the hand. 
not moving, if that makes sense. Yeah. Or. But even then, I'm still like shaking. Well, but you know? Yeah, but you're over, you're over <laughs> here zooming in and out with your hand. That's, I mean, you could do that, but that's not really what the, the gimbal is meant to do. It's meant to stabilize if you're walking, holding it steady for the most part, instead of panning. What you're doing is panning, which is the gimbal's not really, it will work it, but it's not really meant for that. If that makes sense. Got it. I'm gonna, okay. How about a little selfie for you? Uh, <laughs> we got to get him familiar with the camera because he's going to be taking this to New York, documenting the whole trip, including the flight. So you got to get used to it. This is American Airlines 2002 taking off American to Las Vegas on a 737-800. Right okay, so that's the zoom. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, it also does face tracking, by the way. So you can tell it to track your face. It's that one. All right, Jimmy 2023 uh, just passed uh, GG. Uh, he said, "Clear to land uh, two five left, correct." So, if you set it down, watch this. Sorry, we're just playing with the toys. All right, so if you set it down, you've locked it on your. So now, if you move around, it's literally following you around as if you have your own personal <laughs> camera person. Isn't that cool? That is so cool. So if I, oh, oh. Like okay. No matter where you go, okay, I want one as long as you, your face, it could be track it. <laughs> wow. I know. Isn't that amazing? And again, this is not sponsored. I'm not trying to sell any of these DJI Osmos. It was hard enough to get this thing. They're not in stock. I mean, it's very hard. They come in stock and then they're gone within like a day. So it's the, like the newest craze camera. That is crazy. Isn't okay. that crazy? Yeah, that That's is crazy. wild. Would it lock on mine? No, see, it wants to lock on you. Who are you? It doesn't like me. Who are you? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Big truck 1071 the docker on the 25 right. Exit. Delta Airlines Flight 7 heading to Tokyo Haneda, A330 Neo, making that left hand turn onto Taxway Kilo. We'll head to the south side. All right, go ahead, uh, line up and 25 right, go ahead, 4755. Uh, Thank you. Section 501 LA Tower, which runway are you set up for? I was a big 25 left, Section 501. Section 501. Are you still back tracking back? yourself? Yeah. <laughs> it is, it's weird. Wow. But the great thing about that is if you're walking, if you walked and you set it on tracking your face, no matter what you do, it's going to like track your face. Wow. That is so cool. So so he's learning. He's learning. He's learning the new camera. There's all kinds of uh, settings there. Oh, okay. <laughs> Let me get back to announcing these flights. This is JSX 1070 taking off to Cabo San Lucas on an ERJ 145LR. We do have a DHL ABX Air 767-300 ER converted to passenger plane, now cargo plane. Flying over us, coming in from SFO. We'll be heading to the south side for the arrival on 25 left. All right, 2120, head will turn away offshore with 2205, run up the docker, run with 25 right, let's take off. Run up docker, 25 right, let's take off, right. The blue 2023 Hotel de Julia, hold short, run with 25 right. Hotel de Juliet, hold short at 25 right, Delta 
So we got that A330 Flight 7 heading to Tokyo Haneda, continuing taxi down at Kilo. Three, two, six, seven, traffic in position at taxi Juliet, cross runway two five right, and high back ground. Yeah. That more gifted memberships up first. Tina Marie gifting five airline and videos live memberships. Thank you so much, Tina. Awesome, Michelle Ras, one of her great mods. Gifting 20, 20 airline and videos live memberships. Thank you so much, Michelle. So that's 25 new memberships. Right, 2120 contact Bob, today. Bob's left. 2120. You know what we're going to have to do? We're going to have to buy a box of Pop-Tarts and just leave it here on the table. That way I think Bob won't leave us. Right. What's with these Pop-Tarts? <laughs> Tina Maria and Michelle R.S. both gifting memberships. Thanks, you guys. I don't know what's up with the Pop-Tart. He offered me a Pop-Tart this morning. Apparently it was a blueberry Pop-Tart. It didn't look like a blueberry Pop-Tart. I guess all Pop-Tarts kind of look the same for the most part. Probably north side, right? Our friend Steve. Operating Southwest 2892, about to take off to Oakland. It's a flight attendant for Southwest. We met him on the Northern Pacific Nacro flight last summer. Yeah, it was a good time. He, he showed up. I wish we were to use it in the video, but I guess it was It'd be kind of hard to explain it. He showed up with, I think it was some chocolates and some other stuff, and he gave it to the flight attendants. And he goes, and then of course they were like, wow, this is so nice. He goes, well, I'm a flight attendant as well. I'm telling you, chocolates, spring chocolates on your next flights. Yes. That was American 1755 taking off to Phoenix on an A321. Got another uh, cargo flight flying above us. This is China Cargo Airlines, a 777 freighter. Cargo King coming in from Shanghai. I was going to ask, how do you turn it off, but it just did an auto power off. <laughs> so I, I bought extra batteries. I bought a big enough micro SD card. So it should, and it, I, apparently it charges really quick. So Does it have a case? Yes, yes. Okay, good. Yeah. Because I'm sure this is all like sensitive. Um, I heard people drop it all the time and it actually is okay. Oh, I won't be doing that. <laughs> yeah, please. <laughs> but I'm just like, if I'm going to put it in my bag or something, I want to make sure it has like a. Oh, yeah, there's the case. Something yeah. to protect the, the gimbal component of it. Another flight heading to Atlanta, Georgia. This is our third A350 flight heading to Atlanta, flight 9960. I mean, what do you think about that camera? Here's the th here's why I chose this camera for vlogging. Because I think it's going to be easy enough. I mean, you can just set it down and it will still track your face. But on top of that, you know how sensitive people can be on the plane. You know, it's 
And I think something small like that, where you hold it in your hand, yeah, it, it doesn't make people feel uncomfortable. Well, that's the other thing. It's especially when we're boarding a plane. It's like yeah. it's kind of cumbersome when you have all kinds of equipment, right? Including your carry-on luggage. Yeah, because so. what is what is the flight attendant? What's the first thing they look at? They look at that camera and go, "Why is he taping me?" Yeah, I've had <laughs> flight attendants say, "Can you please not film me?" And I'm like, oh, oh, "Okay, sure, <laughs> I'll cut that part out." Delta forty-one comes to hotel nine to Lima, then hold short runway two five right. American 880, wind 2505, runway 25 left. And it will be fun. And American 880, quick land, keep on I think these are things that I'm going to have to Nine edit myself. I can't. I'm currently so busy with the other main and BTS stuff that I think this will, this will kind of have a different feel. It would be more raw. I imagine that you can actually, if you wanted to, I'm sure you probably won't do this, but if you wanted to, you could probably transfer the files directly to your phone, right? Yes, yeah, you can. So if you wanted to do something on the fly. <laughs> yes. Are you done playing with the toy? For now, yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun. It will be a lot of fun, you know, and I'm just, I'm always looking for ways to just add a little bit more content that, you know, obviously we're out here doing the live streams. we got the, the 4K at BTS. We've got all of our clips. I know a lot of you guys want some more BTS of us just doing our normal stuff. And now I'd imagine you can, if you wanted to have a second mic, can you pair it up to the camera? That I don't know. That was United 1395 taking off to Austin on a Max 8. I did buy the lav for that mic. So if you wanted to hide. Oh, so in addition to. Yeah, you just plug it in. To the little. Yeah, because sometimes I, I really don't want to see the mic. I'd rather have. I'd rather have, you know, put the mic in the pocket and put the lava on so it's not so obvious. Yeah. You see all these vloggers and podcasts. And why didn't we get back to the point where you got to see the microphone? Back in the day, you wanted to hide the mic. You didn't want to see the mic. Now it's all, this is my mic. <laughs> Make sure you see it. It's going to be like the whole thing in the shot. Yeah, please don't mind the coffee can in my face. <laughs> Flyer KJ also gifting five airline videos live memberships. Thank you so much, Flyer KG. So there's a Delta 757 about to take off on the north side to San Francisco. Is that a charter? What's the flight number? 8841. That would be a sports charter. Oh, yeah. All right, gonna drop the box. Five live memberships. Got the Japan Airline Dreamliner coming from Tokyo to Rita. It's like six two. Zippy was zipping on back. Got that tail facing the south. That will signal a north side takeoff. United 1331 Medevac, runway 25 right, intersection Foxtrot, line up and wait. Runway 25 right, Foxtrot, line up, wait, Medevac, United 1331. Next flight here on the south side, United Airlines flight 2140, heading to Houston, Texas, 737-900ER. 7600 Park starting to get busy. See, people delayed by about an hour. Yeah. Got their coffee in, ready to go. Roger. 
That is United Airlines 2140 taking off to Houston Intercontinental on 737-900ER. Delta 757 up in the air, up like a rocket. Whoa. Holy moly. That straight up into the sky. <laughs> wow. Jeez. What's the uh, rate of climb on that one? Currently 4,000 feet per minute. Jeez. Cargo King 221 heavy. Straight up. Must be no one in there. Yeah, we got Alpha 7, Apex 1820. Yeah, San Francisco. Doesn't require that much fuel. Probably nobody on board. Delta 7 Heavy at the shoreline, turn left heading 220 and 25 right, turn take off. At the shoreline, turn left heading 220, run right 25, turn take off. This is United 1331, taking off to Newark on 757 200. United Medivac 1331, contact. Medivac. Organs off to Newark. <laughs> Avery Peak Outdoors with the five dollar super chat. Thanks so much, Avery Peak Outdoors. Shout out to the whole AVL crew. Have a great show. Well, thank you so much. The whole crew. Yeah. Thank you. Triple Seven Freighter up next arrival here on the south side. This is the Cargo King coming in from Shanghai. Flight time is 10 hours and 39 minutes. The A330neo with Delta now rolling down to Five right, flight seven heading to Tokyo Haneda. Delta seven ninety four, traffic pulling position, Juliet, cross runway two five right, contact ground. Two five right, Juliet, contact ground, Delta seven ninety four. Top of forty one seventy two, Lima, cross runway two five right, contact ground. Sounds red. American Navy, traffic position, Juliet, cross runway two five This is Delta right, Airlines, right, flight contact. seven Actually, taking no, off to Tokyo Haneda on the A three thirty Neo. Straight ahead, hold short at Hotel 9, American 80. Parking 221 Heavy, Hotel 9 to Lima, hold short, runway 25 right. Hotel 9 to Lima, hold short, 25 right, South East. Delta 7 Heavy, turn left now, heading to the This is the 777 Freighter heading to the northeast corner of the south complex. Delta 7 Heavy, heading to Lima. Parker 243, have a good day. Parker 243, good day, Delta 7 Heavy. I totally forgot today. Today American we have Navy the Oscars. Just starting to push here, oh, so that's right. Hotel Niner, I'll get you going in a few minutes. We're all the private shuts at. All right, American uh, 888, hold short hotel. Okay, this Question. is a little early still. So 756, Billy Tar, yep. 756, the show it doesn't officially start until like, what, 5 o'clock? Pacific time. And Steve's flight now wind up for takeoff there on the north side. So Zippy should make a right hand turn onto Lima and head up to 2 4 right for a takeoff back to Tokyo Narita. In the China Cargo 777 Freighter heading to the northeast corner of the south complex. That A350 with Delta is our next takeoff here on the south side, heading to Atlanta, Georgia. The third A350 heading to Atlanta this morning. Right, 
Sorry, Steve, we missed you. Have a good flight. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yeah, Swamp Cat's back to the $20 Super Chat. Thank you so much, Swamp Cat. NEO is an acronym for New Engine Option. In addition, there is a CEO, Current Engine Option. A320 is the world's first airliner with digital fly-by-wire. Swamp Cat's with all the good tidbits yes. here today. Oh, look at that. Zippy making a left-hand turn on the Delta. Well, Zippy could be zipping on down here to the south side. The sun is out. That's, this is where the party's at. It's <laughs> all over here on the south side. It is. American Airlines Flight 2811 heading to Dallas, Fort Worth, Texas, the 777 and 200ER, number three, for takeoff here on the south side. We've got back to back heavy arrivals happening here on the south side as well. United Airlines Flight 399 coming in from Newark, 78710 Dreamliner up first, followed by the Delta. A350 coming up from Auckland, Flight 9905. I'm telling you, we're Delta A350. All right, on the golf today. hold short of 25 left, uh, you're back, Casey, 20 heavy. Air Premia also Power pushing it back. Flight will be heading back to Seoul. That should be a south side takeoff. Well, look at all the people here. Yeah, lots of people showing up to the hill. Take, take the new uh, vlog cam and show all the people. <laughs> show all the people? <laughs> show all the people. Step one, how do you turn it on? <laughs> oh, so you got to turn, <laughs> turn the uh, monitor. So if you want to do vertical, you do that. Oh, that's it? That's it? That's how you turn it off and on. <laughs> We're not going to hear you, though. All right, cross 25 left, oh. expedite the crossing, and uh, left on the hotel, Apex uh, 820. And we are tower, hanging out at Imperial right Hill <laughs> on Sunday. Heavy LA County 25 right, line of boy. Turn it on Fox yourself. 25, contact departure. Fox, we'll see you. There. <laughs> What are we doing, Rudy? We are live at Imperial Hill here outside of LAX. Yes, we are. <laughs> Boy, this, is, this is some top-notch BTS content over here, I'm telling you. And Air Premia turning that Dreamliner. We got buses <laughs> <laughs> to the west with signal a south side takeoff. Is it Chilo? Glow with a $15 super chat through PayPal. Thank you so much. It says, hey, Kevin, already flying from Raleigh, Durham to JFK to meet you guys with some cool and uh, North Carolina chips. Mmm. You guys are known for some chips. Very nice. Arno Trying Doctor, to see can it track right, planes? <laughs> oh jeez. Rudy, this is a vlogging camera, not a not a <laughs> main camera. So much potential. <laughs> I'm gonna come out here one day. Rudy's gonna have the Osmo camera doing plane spotting with it. And we have the American 777-200ER rolling on 25 right to Dallas-Fort Worth. And the Delta A350 next up for arrival on 25 left.
This is American Airlines 2811 taking off to Dallas Fort Worth on a 777 200ER. This is the flight coming up from Auckland. Still got the Sydney flight coming in as well. That's also an A350 running late. Hotel 9 Alino, uh, hold short 25 right. Jet Blue 424, wind 2404, RNF to Docker, runway 25 right, take off. RNF Docker, 25 right, take off, 424. Jet 4923, LA turning 25 right, line of boy. Line of boy, 24, or 25 right, that's 4923. Tower is on 4330, LA Tower, and 25 left compared to Lent. Well, let's just allow you to go to the field. Sorry, that's 399 heavy. 399 heavy. Uh, opposite, it could be 15, maybe 20. Member for 24 months, it's a type of members, has finally got my two year milestone. There's a new sheriff in town. Uh oh. Nice. Responsibility, Kai. Right. There you go. Let's go to Bravo 17, hold short 25. Thank you, Kai. It's uh, 399. We need sheriff stickers. <laughs> That's true, yes. <laughs> Max, member for one month as a gold member. This is greeting from Saskatchewan, Hello, Canada. Good afternoon. Hello. Zippy, zipping on over here for a south side takeoff. Air Premier should be starting taxi, heading to 25 right. So, the $2 Super Chat, thanks so much, Cell. Hi, Kevin. I'm at Boston. My flight is delayed. Uh oh. Hopefully, not too long. V Zach with a dollar Super Chat, thanks so much, V Zach. Sorry, United Love 38, 8 mile final, 2 left. At 1138 LA so we've got, got planes everywhere. We also have that DHL ABX Air. It's still waiting to cross over. Flight coming in from SFO. ABX Air flight 1820. Air Premier so now starting taxi to 25 at right. Uh, Julia, cross 25 right, ground 1 to 5. Over Delta 8325, cross 25 right, and Delta 9925 heading. Delta 8325, contact Delta departure. Delta 8325, cross over to 5 right. Flight time from Auckland is 11 hours and 25 minutes. It's not too bad. Uh, we're trying to get them on their frequency, and they're not. They're not responding. Back to 820. Morning, LA Tower, Delta 355. So when you came here this morning, was it dark? Uh, the sun was just rising. Yeah. <laughs> when I left the office, it was dark. Interesting. It last very long. That's probably about. Two, three weeks, and then it'll be light again. Yeah, yeah. At six. That was 264 and 25 right clear for takeoff. I have Docker. Remember, we used to start the show at 7 a.m. in the morning. Yep. Sometimes we start the show and it would be dark. Yeah, I was thinking about that yesterday. I'm like, I, I remember around this time, sometimes we would not be prepared for that. Yeah. And I was almost going to text you, like, uh, make sure to bring Nighthawk, but then I'm like, wait, we're starting at 8. So. Should be good, good to go. Penny with the five dollars super chat. Thanks so much, Penny. Hi, Kevin and Rudy from North Carolina. Love spending Sunday with you guys. Watching with my parents, sister Aurora, Bunny, BFF, Millie, and hope to meet you guys at JFK. Nice. Hello, everyone. Hello. 
You know, I was, I was thinking and I'm wondering, and I would love for you guys to take some photos and send it to me, and maybe we can share it on the stream next Sunday. You guys all get together with your family, your friends on a Sunday. Maybe you're sitting there having mimosas or whatever you're doing. If you're a group of people sitting in front of the TV set, all of you watching, send a video, send a photo, and we'll share it. I think it'd be so cool. I think a lot of people around the world, this has been their new Sunday tradition now, is yeah. wake up or spend the day, morning, whatever, and spend it with us. Exactly. It's the new trend. It's the cool thing to do on a Sunday. <laughs> And by the way, I was talking to, or I was going to talk about JFK. If you guys are coming to JFK, uh, we released a discount code that you can use at the TWA Hotel. And it's not just for the week that we're there. This will be a discount code you can use any time of the year, as many times as you like. It's AVL T. W A A V L T W A. It's all caps, no space. Kind of like our code words that we give out here on the show. A V L T W A. It's a code word. It's not a code word. It's a discount code you can enter on the website when you're uh, making your reservations. It's actually a really good discount code, I must say. Yeah. We definitely want to help you out if you are interested in hanging out with us when we're there at the end of the month, March 26th through the 29th. But again, that discount code, just not just for that week, any time of the year. Yeah. Thanks to the fine folks at the TWO Hotel for working with us on that. This is American Airlines Flight 1537 taking off to Miami, Florida on an A321 NEO. So now, technically, we have you covered West Coast, East Coast in terms of hotel rooms with airport views. <laughs> this could be a new trend, Rudy. Absolutely. And we have Alaska Airlines Flight 380 now lighting up on flight radar. We'll be taking off to Fort Lauderdale, our friend on board. John, have a good flight. Go ahead. Uh, we talked to the company. It's going to be uh, a few minutes before uh, we get any ground personnel. Delta 355, Hexu Hotel. I'm Juliet telling you, the TWA Hotel. Right okay, Hotel Juliet. The Cross energy there is just, it's amazing. Heavy. I'm excited. Hotel Can't wait. I've only heard great things about that hotel. Uh, it's going to be so much fun that, that viewers, mods, are all coming out. Short yeah. Hotel for now. Legit is going to be a party at the TWA Spring Break 2024. Oh, boy. <laughs> Again, the dates. 26th. That's a Tuesday. The last Tuesday of March through the 29th, 26th through the 29th. I see some uh, people asking about, uh, our, by the way, our, our merch ships all around the world. So no matter where you live, you can buy the merch. So if you are in the UK, just go to shopavl.com. Yeah, can you just give us a heads up when you do need to move Whatever you, you like, and then on checkout, obviously, when you put your address, it will figure out where you live. And that will send your merch all around the world. We send it all over the place, even in Africa. Hey. Hey. Oh, thank you. What is this? Oh, wait, are these the ones? Short of an right? Wow. Oh my gosh. The Disney Pixel 
promised last week. What are these officially called? Waffle Crisco from Stowe Crisco from Disneyland. Look at these. They smell amazing. O-M-G. Wow. <laughs> The smell alone. All right, so in this waffle Cristo, inside, it's not just a waffle. It's, I don't know, do you say it's stuffed or they make it with uh, rosemary, ham, turkey, and Swiss inside, dusted in wow. powdered sugar, served the side of strawberry preserves and maple syrup. Ooh. My. Gosh. Thank you. <laughs> oh, yeah. Air Premier, the, the Dreamliner, now rolling it down at 2 5 right, heading to Seoul. So again, this DHL converted 767 to 300ER, coming up from SFO, ABX Air Flight 1820, waiting to head over to the cargo area here on the south side of LAX. How is it, Rudy? Erica 2299, runway 25 right, clear for takeoff, RNF Docker. RNF Docker, clear for takeoff, 25 right, American Oh, it's so good. Delta I'm 18. hungry this Five morning, so I can't wait. Right line it's so good. The ham is a nice. Do I say kick? It's a nice yeah. uh, added touch to it. Have you ever had the Monte Cristo sandwich yeah, yeah, at the Blue Bayou? No. Uh, Hotel this is United 1888 coming in from Chicago O'Hare on a 757-300. Oh, you put the syrup on it. This is American Airlines 2299 taking off to San Antonio on an A319. So in on Zippy to zip on out of here on the south side. Third land, 25 left, United 667. I'm going to partake syrup wise, right? Oh, yes. Just, Kevin, don't get it on the computer. Syrup inside the keys, probably not a good idea. Do I put it on it? Yep. Rudy's like, have you ever eaten before, Kevin? <laughs> All right. It's very good. I'm trying to wait for the, the taste. I don't really, uh, I don't really taste the meat. You tasted the meat? 
Heavy at Where's the, the meat? No. <laughs> it's in there. I just don't taste it. All right, Quebec cross 25 left on Alpha over to ground 75, ABEX 1820. Delta 42 Heavy, exit Hotel Niners, then Texas Hotel to Quebec. Hotel Niners, Hotel Quebec, Delta 42 Heavy. It's, it's perfect because I was getting hungry. I was like, oh. Yeah, me too. What's that, Rich? This is Delta Airlines Flight 42 coming in from Sydney, Australia on an A350-900. Where are you getting the coffee at? You have a kettle? You're going to make coffee. Well, I've got my phone. It's at 3 at Lima, cross train 25 right, hold short of right 25 left. This, time, uh, this is like the, what, the fifth A350 with Delta we've seen here today. Three heading to Atlanta, two, five Atlanta. Five Atlanta. two coming in, one from Auckland, that coming in from Sydney. Tower Southwest 4217 with you, visual 25 left. Tower and 25 left, 25. Quiddleland 25 left, Southwest. All right, that officially takes us to the top of the hour. Oop. <laughs> Just after 11 a.m. here in beautiful, sunny Los Angeles, California, you are watching continuous live coverage of LAX plane spotting right here in your home for LAX live streams at this airline video live. Today is a big Sunday show here on March 10th. 2024. We are the Plain Jockeys enjoying this waffle. Oh boy, our mouths are full. Thanks you guys for tuning in. Hit that like button if you haven't yet. Share the stream with your family and your friends. It's DHL ABX Air 767 continuing down taxiway. Alpha here on the south side. Have the LA Tower crossing service ready to start the Hotel, hold short. Oh, you got one too, Rita. Yes. Hotel, hold short of 25 right at Juliet United 667, and we had some birds at 500. Zippy feet. is rolling. Zippy is, is rolling. This time, uh, 503 cross point, 25 left at Lima, continuing taxi Alpha, complex is on the other side. Zippy zipping on back to Tokyo Narita in the 787-8 Dreamliner. This is Zip Air, flight 23, taking off to Tokyo Narita on a 787-8 Dreamliner. This Global 5000 is coming in from Van Nuys. And we have Korean Air Cargo now rolling on 25 right. This triple seven freighter taking off to Seoul. All right, do I have time to eat more of the waffle? <laughs> so busy. Oh, you ate that whole thing, Rudy. Yeah, we're concerned that you can't taste the the ham. Oh, is there something wrong with 
seven Julia Cross. We're just right worried that you lost your, your sense of taste. Disregard the seven. Just continue hotel to Juliet. Thank you. Hotel it's hotel. there. It's so good. Traffic still holding. Tell us for Copy. Kevin with a $10 Mike super Mike chat. Thanks so much, Kevin. Happy Oscar Sunday, AVL. Kevin and Rudy, your best pitcher for all the best cinematography shots at LAX. I'm counting, counting down to my Asia trip. I'll be on EVA Air Flight 5 on Thursday, April 18th. Hello, world. Well, have a great flight there, Kevin. Counting down the days. Wasn't it last year? Yeah, wasn't it last year Rudy brought back an Oscar to me and said I won, yeah. <laughs> I won the award for best plane jockey or something? That's when the uh, gift shop was open at the Embassy Suites. That was the day Jerry was here, too. Big Jet Jerry. Oh. Right? Oh, yeah, I think so. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> Flight time from Tahiti is seven hours and 30 minutes. Tahiti is heavy, taxi hotel to get back home short, I'm going to get my right. Confirm hold short runway two five right at Quebec. Hold short runway two five right at Quebec. Send forty three on two five right. Start for takeoff. R N F Docker. R N F Docker. Clear for takeoff two five right. Clear for wings. Send forty three. On two forty three. Clear for takeoff. Clear for wings. Clear for two five right. Line up between. This is United Airlines 1910 taking off to Cleveland on a max night. What happened to John's flight? Did we miss it? Oh no, it's just sitting at the gate. Wow, you don't mess around, Rita. <laughs> Next thing you know, Rita's gonna be over there cooking dinner for the whole hill. I was gonna say, that's like a, a channel <laughs> idea for Rita. Cooking with Rita at the hill. <laughs> On location. Alaska 1432 and 25 right, clear for takeoff, RNF Docker. This is Spirit Airlines 1043 taking off to San Antonio, Texas on an A320neo. That half of that filled me up. Anybody want some more? What's up? <laughs> Rita said that hers was filled with meat. <laughs> Yours is filled with meat? Because I had meat. Well, I think mine had meat too. I just. Did you ever taste it? Clearly, I've lost my sense of taste uh -oh. here today. <laughs> Ozzie Man 55 well, with the super chat. Thanks so much, Ozzie Man. Great stream today. Will there be an AVL Awards someday with unofficial sponsors, Gulerats Doritos and Topo Chico? I don't know about the sponsors, but would we? What do you think, Rudy? I think we could, at some point, have our own awards. It's a good idea. I like that. The AVLEs. The AVLEs. We can have it at Chili's. Yes. This is Alaska Airlines 1432 taking off to Guadalajara. On a 737 900 ER. And Rudy will be the DJ. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, it's like the, yeah. the Dundies. We'll have it at Chili's. The Dundies. How can I explain it? I don't remember the rest of the words. <laughs> when he's trying to rap. Oh, yes. Terrible. Oh, yeah. How can I explain it? Uh, do, yes. do, 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 do. <laughs> and then falls behind. Gosh, darn it, Dwight. <laughs> <laughs> uh, one of the best episodes. This is Alaska Airlines 286 taking off to Newark on a MAX 9. Have you... Obviously, they don't shoot the office anymore. Did you ever go out to Van Nuys to where they shoot that, the location? Oh, you never have? No. Nope. Well, when you drive up, it looks just like the building. Ooh. I'll have to take you out to the, uh, the yeah. office. So we were out there. I was out there. I actually wasn't living here. I was living in Phoenix, but I came out that spring, the last season of the office, the last day they were shooting, we were outside. Waiting to see who we could see. This is Spirit Airlines 266 taking off to Philadelphia on an A320 Neo, and we caught a glimpse. Of the United Her Art here, in New York, New Jersey livery coming in from Boston Green. on the 757 200 flight 311. Green, it's your, uh, it's your livery. Yeah. Does that look familiar? Oh, yeah. Take a look. Well, more yours. She designed <laughs> that one. Yeah. The LA Retro design. Designed by Korean, who that's her that's her design on that 757. She designs all of our merch here at AVL. See similar characteristics. The control tower too is hers. Yeah. yeah, yeah, you could. I mean, if you look at your shirt and you kind of look at that, it's kind of it resembles kind of the same. The same nuances of the same artist. Yes. But I was. Going back to the Dundies was the Dundies, the <laughs> fake chilies. Oh it was yeah, a fake chilies. And when I went out to go find where they filmed the office, the fake chilies wasn't too far from LA the Tower main office area. It was a steakhouse. It really wasn't a chilies. It was a steakhouse. And unfortunately, the building's been torn down. Oh, it's not there anymore. That's too bad. It's a land. This is United Airlines 1260 taking off to Denver, Colorado on a 787-9 Dreamliner. And the whitest sneakers award goes to Pam Helper. <laughs> was she Pam Helper at that point, though? No, no, not yet. Was Pam. She was still dating that guy who worked in the the uh, warehouse. The warehouse, yeah. John with a two dollars super chat. Thanks so much, John. Says morning plane jockey Sunday fun day sure is. Thank you so much, John. Lewis G, gifting one airline at Videos Live membership. Thank you so much, Lewis. Pam got kicked out of Chili's now, I think about it. Oh, yeah. She was sneaking drinks off people's tables. You know how I originally found the office? It was 2005. Apple had just come out with a iPod video. It was the first yes. video iPod. Oh, that's right. And if you went to iTunes, you could purchase like TV shows or whatever for the first time and put them on the video iPod. 
NBC was giving out the free episodes of The Office. So everyone downloaded the free versions of The Office for their new Apple iPod. And I remember I took that and loaded it up with a bunch of Office uh, episodes. And I flew, I think I flew back to Michigan or somewhere that, that year. And I watched The Office on the plane trip on my new Apple iPod, video pod. Oh, so that's why Michael Scott gifted that to Ryan. Yeah, it was it was the big thing. <laughs> oh yeah, he that's did, uh, the Christmas episode. The that white was a, elephant. That's the first episode I ever saw. Yeah, there was a price limit, and of course he went above and beyond. That's a classic episode. And he ended up with an oven mitt that Phyllis knitted. <laughs> an oven mitt. Oh. <laughs> Leslie asked with a five dollar super chat. Thank you so much, Leslie. My best friend just came in on that Auckland flight. They were supposed supposed to fly back yesterday. Fun to see it come in on your broadcast. Thanks, ABL. What a pleasure. Hope they had a great flight. Rita, do you want that other half? Do you want that other half? <laughs> this is Delta Airlines 806 taking off to Atlanta on an E321. Direct one zero five at golf, cross frame two five left hold short of frame two five right. Okay, uh, no, Rita. Two, yes, no. Right, no. Short. No. All right. Maybe I'll get hungry again. Barbara Sterling, a member for 15 months, his gold member has recovered from the illness. Now trying to get there to meet you both. Great channel, much fun, and great effort. Much love, AVL. Hello, Barbara. Hello, Barbara. Good to see you here. Glad you're yeah, on the man, You've been talking about coming out to LA for a long time. Yeah, poor Barbara's been under the weather, but hopefully you're feeling better now and you can come visit us. Give you a big hug. Me and my hugs. Yeah, Rudy and his hugs. You can't get hugs like that anywhere else. QRX one zero five cross train two five right right now at Golf. QRX one zero five cross train two five right right to Bravo. Okay, cross train two five right to Bravo. Right to Bravo. So we will have these two A three eighty supers taken off here on the south side here today. Celia Al with the two dollar super chat. Thanks so much, Celia. Any chance for a plane and jockey podcast before long? Well, you know what? I mean, right, it's funny you, you bring that up because we've been talking about this for a while. I and we were talking about it yesterday when we were at that studio in Pasadena. I I'd like to create a video version of the podcast because I think a lot of that's the new rage is is video instead of just the audio. And so we can sit down. I want to create like a real set a, a, not like a, when i say a tv set you guys are probably thinking like you know huge thing it just needs to be a small little set rudy and i are sitting there next to each other um we can maybe have a third chair for a guest or whatever but that's what my thought is taking it to the next level of a video podcast and I'd like to do it live as well so that's what we're aiming to do the audio only podcast sure we could do it if something comes up but i don't think it's a main focus at this point and certainly if we we do create that little studio um i think we'll do them more often obviously hopefully yeah. that answers your question coming up there was a podcast studio in the the building that we were doing the photo shoot yesterday and I think, I don't know about you, Rudy, but I was just looking at it like, uh, a dream. Yeah. You were asking all the right questions. I'm like, okay. And I was like, I was like, how much is this going to cost to recreate this? I don't, it's, it was a bigger, it's a bigger scale than what we need, but, um, 
Tower, good morning, Alaska 5. Oh, it's the top big. Right direction. <laughs> <laughs> Chad, 0262 with an awesome $50 super chat. Thank you so much, Chad. Awesome support as always. The pair is celebrating in the streets of downtown LA. <laughs> You know, I had, I had the drive through downtown LA yesterday to go to Pasadena, Rudy, and I haven't been down there in quite some time. I mean, I used to drive through there like every single day. You know, I finally got to see the high rise building that a bunch of taggers got into. Did oh, you yeah. You see that story? Yeah. Such a weird thing going on there. You've got this building, it's a very tall building right next to Crypto, the old Staples Center, and it's just tagged from ground up into the sky. It's just wow. really weird. Yeah. This is American Airlines Flight 27 taking off to Tokyo Haneda on a 787-8 Dreamliner. Now, Warren Rodriguez is letting us know that the Qantas so A380 that we saw this morning is the one we did the BTS on. Oh, really? Yeah. Very cool. Wow. Wow. What happened to John's flight? That's 4763 now at Juliet, cross 25 right, contact on point 75. Dr. Quake and Baker with a $10 super chat. Thanks so much, doctor. Oh man, that restaurant, The Office filmed at Van Nuys, 94th Street, Aero Squadron. I love that show. It didn't last past COVID. Kevin and Rudy should buy the spot and make it a plane spotting theme bar. Actually, the building's gone. It's been demolished. It's been long gone. I, this is way, geez, when was this? Night 2013? 2013 wow. was the, the year. 2012, 2013, that building was already gone. Have got that guitar executive golf stream heading to JFK. It's the next takeoff here on the south side, followed by United Airlines flight 801 heading to Hong Kong in a 787 9 Dreamliner. I see you guys keep on talking about the C-32A. There's actually two of them. And yes, uh, officially came in as Air Force Two. Well, both of them came in on Friday. One, the one later, was officially Air Force Two coming in from Phoenix. I imagine that those will take off tomorrow morning. They usually do as the vice president usually comes to Southern California, has a, a house in Brentwood. And, heavy LA and so five, usually right, comes in for the weekend and then will head out on Monday morning. We did catch that arrival on Friday, high top the H Hotel. This is Qatar Executive 105 taking off to JFK on this Gulfstream G650ER. Heavy radio check. I'm getting every other Air Force 1. everything I said. You departure frequency 1243 United Aviation being a member for three months as Gold Member says, Hey, I remember watching all you guys stream on 2022 New Year's. I'm so happy to see you guys today. Love you all. You know, a lot of people find our streams on the New Year streams. I hear that a lot. Yeah. Happy New Year. Warren, <laughs> a member for 14 months, is a silver member since the Qantas A380, the one you did on the BTS, is there at LAX. And I think she's parked in the exact same spot 
We did the BTS, which is on the east side of the hangar. Up next, the United Airlines 801 heading to Hong Kong at a 787-9 Dreamliner. Hi. How's it going? Yeah. Uh, those are not ours. I don't know where Reed is at. <laughs> when she comes back, she probably will. I think she's got to lower the tripod a little bit for you. Yes, yeah, it came in on Friday, yeah. Blur 962 heavy LA tower for wake turbines. Heavy LA Tower, right. 262 heavy at he wanted to take a picture of your hoodie so he knows who to follow. Oh. Right, right. Bravo, traffic hold. Uh, right, right. Bravo, traffic hold. <laughs> this is United Airlines 801 taking off to Hong Kong on a 787-9 Dreamliner. All right, so I see John's flight. He's made that turn on the Bravo. Also, that DHL Polar Cargo 777 Freighter heading to Cincinnati, crossing over 25 left. We'll have a departure on 25 right coming up. Landis with a $10 super chat. Super chat. Thank you so much, Landis. Hello again. Near KFAT. Fresno. Fresno. That's what I thought. <laughs> I'm in a food food coma now. <laughs> and a Japan Airlines Dreamliner up next for arrival on the north side. Two four right. Coming in from Osaka. Flight time is nine hours and fourteen minutes. Getting closer to the takeoff, south side takeoffs of those two kings. Who's excited for that? I am. Um, oh, yeah. First day of spring, is that next week? Really? Yeah. Wow. Do we have a first live drawing coming up soon? I normally say, Bob, let us know what the first prize is, but Kevin, let us know what the first prize is. It's official AVL Airline Videos Live t-shirt comes in many different colors. You can check them out at shopavl.com. This can be yours if you're the lucky winner. We'll give you a code word to enter coming up. But you do have to be an AVL member here on YouTube. All right. <laughs> this is United Airlines 16. 21 taking off to Orlando on a 737 800. 
So out there, the United Dreamliner. This is the Flight 33 coming up from Tokyo Narita. Hanging out there, getting some sun as the United, her art here, coming up from Boston, now oh heads God, to the, the gates. Flight coming in from San Salvador, Delta Airlines flight 1966 in this 757 200. Polar 962 heavy, right? Two five right, so we have a few 7 freighters about to take off here on the south side. Up first, DHL Polar Air Cargo Flight 962 heading to Cincinnati. It's a 777 freighter. And then Coletta Air, DHL, Flight 262, heading to Tokyo Narita, also in a 777 freighter, heading to 25 right. Rudy's got the vlogging camera out again. I want to make sure I know what I'm doing here. Bravo Golf, exit Alpha 7, turn left Alpha, contact Alpha 7.5. Two listeners on the front. Polar 1936, Alpha Marshall. Tower America 1995 LA Tower Street here at Neighbor 265 on the first plan. Clear to land 25 left, America 1995. Alright, so we have our friend John's. Where did he go? <laughs> Why does he keep on disappearing from the radar? Yeah, where did he go? I, I saw him turn. Delta 867 right? Put the take off right now, Still at the gate? Did he go back? Yeah, they went back to the gate. He did? Yeah. Uh oh. The undersea astronaut with a $5 super chat. Thank you so much, undersea astronaut. A little poem for Kevin and Rudy. Streaming AVL while studying all day. Master's degree is just weeks away that I can come back out and play. Much love. Oh, yes. <laughs> You're almost there, buddy. <laughs> Congrats. Congratulations. Is Rudy now addicted to the Osmo DJI Osmo 3? Maybe. <laughs> that means we're going to get some good BTS action. Oh, yes. By the way, there was a wide angle that was clipped on there. It must have fallen off in oh. the car. Oops. I didn't see it. I didn't lose no, it. No, I think I lost it this morning. <laughs> I think it's at 4K right now. 4K, 24. 24 yeah. frames per second. Yeah, it's pretty good. So, Rudy, give us some BTS action that we can post. Give us some uh, information that you won't see on the main show. Hello, everyone. We are currently live here at Clutters Park, Imperial Hill, right outside of LAX. We're currently live for our big Sunday show. We are live. Kevin operating the main camera. Mm. All right, we got that Coletta Air 777 freighter heading to Tokyo to Rita, now taking off a 25 right.
got a Delta A330 Neo coming up from Tokyo Haneda, flight 8. It's the next arrival on the north side on 24 right. American 32, Remy 25 right, clear for takeoff, RNF Docker. Okay, clear takeoff 25 right, RNF Docker, American 32. Well, at least you're not afraid of the, the camera. That's a good thing. Yeah, I guess you could say I'm not afraid of the camera. <laughs> That is Japan Airlines, Flight 60, coming up from Osaka, 787-9 Dreamliner, heading to the southeast corner of Tom Bradley. Yeah, they definitely went back to the gate. Huh. SWAT Cats back with a $20 super chat. Thank you so much. Awesome support of the channel as always. Let's try one more time. Love to see Bob drop it just for the fun of it. Well, Bob left. <laughs> He's gone. He left a long time ago. Right after he asked me if I wanted the pop tart. He just vanished. Bob needs to quit. Bob and Norion. <laughs> Popping around. <laughs> <laughs> Bob's just bobbing around. <laughs> yeah, Bob, if you're listening, do you want the waffle? Oh, yeah, Bob, you're missing out. That thing was <laughs> filling. I got to say, half of that was filling. Yeah. It's a good Sunday morning. Hi. Yeah. Good Sunday morning uh, meal. Yes. With coffee. Oh. Do you want coffee? Order coffee. Maybe. Hey, how's it going? Good to see ya. I don't think Rita would. She would. Be she hurt. went to go get. What did she go get? Oh, see, what? she forgot the filters for the coffee. All right, order coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I have a, a... We can use it next time, I guess. Oh, you know what? Maybe I should pick it up. That way I can go use the facilities. Okay. But... I'll wait until after the top of the hour, because I don't want to miss that. Oh, we still have to do... And the drone. Okay, yeah, giveaway. Oh, yeah. All right, why don't we do the giveaway? Yeah. Uh, do the giveaway. Dakota Steinhardt, okay, member for 13 months. It's gold. Members, it's good afternoon from Ohio. Kevin Rudy, it's snowing here. Southern California's weather looks a lot more appealing. Excited to see the JFK shows. Yeah, I told you guys. Was it last week when you guys were all walking around your flip-flops and your shorts in the 70 degree weather. I said, it's not done yet. Going slightly mad with an awesome $20 super chat. Thanks so much, going slightly mad. Haven't been around that much lately. I'm still your number one plane spotting fan. Plane jockeys have been working at Plymouth Village again, part-time, and the PV plane spotters say hi. I was Aww. thinking about them the other day. Well, hello, good to see you. That is awesome. I was thinking the other day, I was like, I wonder if they all still get together and, and watch us. Oh, it's BTS, all right. Apparently not. Wait, well, what's going on? 4,001, traffic to hold a position at Juliet, cross-trend to 5 right, contact ground point 75. Cross 5 right, Juliet, uh, ground point 75, 4,000. Brian Henry with a $2 Superjet, thanks so much, Brian. Hi, Kevin and Rudy, 65 and beautiful here at DFW today. 
Ooh, that sounds perfect. Hello. All right. Should we do our first live drawing? Yes. Here is the official rules of the game. So you do have to be an ABL member, you have to be in the chat. I'm about to give you a code word. You're going to enter that just once. You do it more than five times, then I'll kick you out since Bob has already left. He's just bobbing around. And so just once, twice, three, four times maybe, but over five, then you'll be kicked out. So just do it. You really have to do it just once. And it, the code word is all green on the screen. All caps, no space. All caps, no space. Once, twice, three times, maybe. That will go on for an, a minute and 43 seconds. The music, once that is up, we'll come back here and say the time is up. And then we'll announce the winner in 15 seconds later. We will roll that music. You have until the end of that music to say I'm here and accept there in the chat. Nightbot will announce who the winner is. If that is you, you're going to say I'm here, I accept, and then you're going to send an email to info at airlinevideos.com with your name and your address. I'm getting a little feedback in my ear. <laughs> name and address, T-shirt, color, size, true to size. If you're medium, stay with a medium. You're probably good to go. And a link to your YouTube channel so we can verify it is you. All right. I guess that's it. Anything else, Rudy? Nope. I think you covered it. All right. Sounds good. Who's ready? I'm ready. Yeah. This will be the first of two live giveaways here today. And on your mark, good luck. Get set. Go for it. AVL. AVL. Get your code word to enter. This official Airline Videos Live t-shirt. You go check them out at shopavl.com. Come in many different colors. Many of you guys when you win these t-shirts always go for the royal blue or the black or the navy. Those are like the top three colors. Good choices. Shirt looks really good in the royal blue. All right, enter AVL for your chance to win this official AVL t-shirt. We do this live drawing every Sunday, two live drawings every Sunday for your chance to win as long as you're an AVL member. And again, are in the chat where you give this code word to enter this hour. Enter AVL. Again, AVL. Make sure it's all caps, no space. For your chance to win this official Airline Videos Live t shirts. I wear these things every day. Every day I'm wearing our merch. Boy, this stuff holds up nicely. This t shirt, the name brand. Who makes the t-shirt is Bella Canvas. You know what that is. It's a very high-quality t-shirt. Very comfortable, very soft. Yes. I've never put them in the dryer, so I don't know if they shrink or not. I've never done that. I always air dry it, just to be safe. All right. ABL. Go to work. All right. So we wait. What? Oh, we gotta. We gotta decide who the winner is. Bells view one two one. Bells view one two one. You are the winner in, in ten seconds. Rudy's going to start the music. Hopefully respond soon. Bells view one two one. You are the winner for this hour. Again, we'll have another live drawing a bit later. Later. Oh, there we go. The music has officially begun. Now, if Bell's View 121 doesn't claim the prize, we will announce another name. Bell's View. Congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations. We'll look out for that email. And remember, awesome. info at airlinevideos.com. Your name, your address, color and size, very important. Color and size as long as well as your YouTube channel links. We can verify it is you. Random Guy, gifting one Airline Videos Live membership. Thank you so much, Random Guy. 
Rudy had a great idea, and I think we're going to take him up on the good idea oh? of the making a video out of the rules so I don't have to do that every single time and yeah. forget half the rules. Welcome to Airline Videos Live. Airlines. It's a lot of pressure. <laughs> it's a lot of pressure to get up there twice. Sometimes you do it three or four times in one broadcast. And to remember all the rules, American I'm going to have you do it next time. Rudy's doing it next time. Y'all follow the rules. Y'all know what the rules are. All right. <laughs> This is Viva Aerobus 519 taking off to Guadalajara on an A321neo. Sir, can you check your hotel to the map on the short plane right? Hotel number 4, right? Waiting to cross over this flight. It's coming in from Las Vegas. Alaska Airlines flight 703 at the 737-900ER. This is American Airlines 613 taking off to Chicago O'Hare on 737-800. Rich says we should animate it like we did the Korean Doritos story. Oh, right? you know what? That's probably a good idea. Yeah. Though I really did like the idea, and I think... Did we announce what we were thinking of doing with that? A safety video. I think we did last Sunday, didn't we? Yeah. And I think we talked about it last night. I was going to voice it, and then Rudy was going to demonstrate like he was a flight attendant. What do you think? Yeah. Animation or Rudy real time <laughs> demonstrating? I think it'd be funnier with Rudy real time video. Maybe we could do AI. One of the one of the um, <laughs> clips could be me at the computer, like typing the code word. Yes. Squinting at the computer. <laughs> I like that idea. This Gulfstream 4 is coming in from Camarillo. Getting closer to the A380s, pushing back. Also of Aero Union, flight 7003, heading to Guadalajara. An Airbus A300 lighting up. We'll have a south Radar side takeoff. Next right turn, taxi Coming up, yes. Turkish Off Airlines in the right. UEFA right. Champions League livery. A 777-300ER coming to Istanbul. A number two for arrival here on the south side. On the north side, Air China, flight 987, coming from Beijing at a 777-300ER. A minute out. We have another uh, China Eastern Airlines, flight 583, coming in from Shanghai, a 777-300ER. Nine minutes out. Looks like a north side arrival. Japan Airlines, flight 16, coming in from Tokyo, Haneda. 787-9 Dreamliner, 18 minutes out. Running about two hours late. And Air Tahiti Nui, flight 102, coming in from Pepeete. 787-9 Dreamliner, also running late here today. Seven minutes away. Singapore Airlines, the flight coming in from Tokyo to read on a 777-300ER. Arriving on the north side. Flight now heading to the gates of Tom Bradley. EVA Air, EVA Air, the 777-300ER heading back to Taipei. Looking. Like it made a left-hand turn onto Taxiway Delta there on the north side. That will be heading here for a south side takeoff on 25 right. 
Did they mention Tuesday's show here on the south side, back here at Imperial Hill? Tuesday will be here? Tuesday here. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Good call there. Well, you know. I'm just trying to think, wait, what? what's happening? What's happening on the south side? More <laughs> south side action. Yes. It's going to be a super Tuesday show. We'll be back high atop the H Hotel on Friday. I'll probably be out here Wednesday or Thursday trying to grab that breeze video that I promised Charlie last week <laughs> on Thursday. That's right. <laughs> kind of got disrupted because of breaking news. Yep. So what is going on with John's flight? Is it? Yeah, I don't know. They went back to the gate and transponders off now. Hmm. So I wonder what that is. Somebody gets sick. Somebody being unruly. On the north Hotel side, Air China, the triple seven at 300 uh, ER. Uh, next Julian, arrival on American two four Florida. right. Flight time from Beijing on this 777-300ER is 11 hours and 26 minutes. Seven to three hundred ER, heading back to Taipei, heading here for a south side takeoff. That Turkish triple seven at three hundred ER with that special livery eight, arriving eight, here eight, on the eight, south eight, side eight, at two five left. Eight, one, five, two, three, eight, nine, nine. American 2978 at 2 8, cross 25 right, contact ground point 75. Appreciate Mike Tango heavy at 2 8, cross 25 right, contact ground point 75. Oh boy. First A380 now pushing back. Green Air Flight 18 heading back to Seoul. It's begun, Rudy. It's officially begun. Here we go. This is the Union of European Football Associations Special livery. Yeah, I would not recommend walking from here to the H Hotel. Kind of not advisable. Yeah, when they built the tunnel, it goes under underneath the two fives. 
they didn't think about pedestri pedestrian <laughs> uh, walkers. Yeah, I, it's kind of unsafe to walk through there anyway. So you're better off getting an Uber or a taxi from here to the H. Now from the H, you can easily walk to the north side. Yes. Got the Eva Air Triple Seven and the Turkish Triple Seven Three Hundred ER. Going to be crossing paths. Turkish on Charlie, Eva on Bravo. Eleven zero five runway two five right. Clear for takeoff. Orient at Docker. Alright, Orient at Docker two five right. Clear for takeoff. Mark eleven zero five. Seventy seven two seventy four. Clear for takeoff. Orient at Docker. Turkish making that right hand turn onto Lima. Taxi hotel, 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 niner, he's still off right. Hotel, 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 niner for the gate occupation American 767. Tower today, West 1510. Thank you. <laughs> Did I? Wait. Did I? Oh. No, I was talking about it. Was it on Tuesday or Friday? I was talking about the Boston St. Martin extension oh. of the trip. I was saying that you were kind of, you know, throwing it out there as a possibility. Yeah. And I think it might come true. Dreams do come true. <laughs> we got to figure out when. Obviously, it will be the summer. So what do you guys think about that? We'll go to Boston and then head to St. Martin all on the same trip. Yeah, when's a good time to go to Boston? When's a good time to go to St. Martin? I would say the earlier the better, like June, like before Alaska. But when is Alaska? I don't know. We got to cram a lot in like two months. I guess that's what we did last year too, huh? We're not going anywhere before the 24-hour live stream, right? Uh, well, I'll probably go somewhere. I don't know if you will. Okay. So <laughs> we can figure this out later. Yeah. I'm just saying that you guys have been requesting St. Martin. Let's yes. go for it. Absolutely. Probably won't be a long trip there, like a day no, or so, yeah. but it's probably all we need. So it'll be an extension of the Boston trip. We'll go Boston to St. Martin. Oh, June to December, Hurricane Alley. Oh, well, look at that, Rudy. <laughs> The fall is best for Boston. That's what I've heard. Fortunately, that's that's a no-go for me. Yeah. Oh, the joys of being a teacher. I'm stuck with summer. <laughs> <laughs> Legend Jay, the Math Gifting 50 Airline Net Videos Live memberships. Thank you so much, Shane. Awesome support as always. 50 more gifted memberships from our Legend Jane. Wow. Thank you so much, Jane. All right. I almost said Bob drop it, but he's long gone. He's bobbing around. Legend Jay, Gifting 50 Airline Net Videos Live. Memberships, thank you so much, Shane. 
Peter with a five dollar super jet. Thank you so much, Peter. Hi, Kevin and Rudy. My friends are flying at Delta Airlines flight 912 from Orlando. Hoping he's able to say hello in ATC. Estimated time of arrival is 12 and 22. 912. Hopefully, it's the south side arrival. 912. Awesome. Thank you. China Eastern Airlines, the 777-300ER, coming in from Shanghai. Next heavy arrival on the north side. Powered up 501 heavy to eat out. So 501 heavy, Illy Tower, tell the heavy tree liner cross the link tree block, 25 left, there's the land. And Aero Union A300 now rolling on 25 right. This former American Airlines A300 is taking off to Guadalajara, Aero Union 7003. It's going to say 7003, that's not right. Well, I guess that's right. It's so cool to find out where these old planes, who they originally flew with. Yeah, delivered to American in September of 1992. Up next, Eva Air Flight 5, 777-300ER, heading to Taipei. An Air Tahiti Nui, second Dreamliner flight coming from Pepeite, arriving here on the south side. Korean Air A380 Super should be starting a taxi here shortly. Of course, the Dreamliner will hold before crossing over 25 right as we have that triple seven. Heading back to Taipei, now rolling down 25 right. Eva Air Flight 5 taking off to Taipei on a 777-300ER. I see a lot of people talking about St. Martin not being a good live stream place. Were we thinking of doing a live stream or are we doing 4K footage? Um, uh, uh, live. Oh. It's not going to be like a main live show. It's going to be like no. we're here be up for a couple of hours. Yeah, it's definitely going to be very slow. I mean, we know that going into it. Yeah, no, I'm not expecting this to be, I'm, it's just an added bonus. Anonymous with a $5 super chat through PayPal. Thank you so much. This is Hi Kevin and Rudy. I don't know if you keep up with the camera news, but did you know Nikon just bought Red Cinema? I did not know that. Well, that's pretty big news. All right, we got a lot of action going on. It is the top of the hour. Delta Sky Team 767-400ER arriving here on the south side. This flight coming in from Atlanta, Georgia, flight 501. It's been a long time since I've seen that here. All right, so the Korean Air A3D Super holding short of Charlie will be crossing over here shortly, and that officially takes us to the top of the hour.
It's officially afternoon here in beautiful Los Angeles, California. You are watching continuous live coverage of LAX plane spotting right here on your home for LAX live streams. That is Airline Videos Live. Today is a big Sunday show here on March 10th, 2024. Oh, the cameras are all ready. Everyone's about to get their shots. Oh, everyone's getting excited here at the Hill as we have our first A380 Super. Going to be crossing over the two south runways. We'll be taking off a 25 lap. This will be happening throughout the course of the afternoon. Everyone's ready, including Rudy. Yes. <laughs> and because of this, I'm going to hold off on asking where everyone's watching from. Yes. I don't want to miss any of this. So nope. we'll ask the next hour. We'll be here still. So sit back, relax, and enjoy. All right. Let's get back to the action. Blue Dragon Who, a member for 17 months as gold member. This is just go when your schedule permits. Don't overthink the best time. Well, that would be summer. Nice shot. Also, Asiana A380 Super now pushing back. Do we possibly have back to back A380 takeoffs? 75 Alpha is occupied. Actually, it's open. Actually, Hotel Juliet, hold short, only 25, right? Hotel Juliet, short, only 25, right? Also, Philippine Airlines to 777 at 300 ER heading back to Manila. Flight 113 heading here to the south side, as well as Cathay Pacific. Flight 85 heading back to Hong Kong, also in the 777-300ER. Well, I tell you, the south side is a happening place. We all knew it was going to happen. That's why this is an awesome place to be for the big Could Sunday big show. Oh, no? yes. Of course, this will be happening for the next six months until mid-July. But maybe we hold off going anywhere until after mid-July. No, My summer's not that long. In a couple of weeks from now, this, you guys would be like, oh, there's another A380 taking off on the south side. <laughs> Chris, I postponed uh, a camp I normally run in the summer in hopes of, let's just go everywhere. Let's just go <laughs> everywhere. When was that again? That was right after. It's going to be the week after 24 hour live stream. All right. So well. that's been postponed. So let's go somewhere. All right. <laughs> yeah, I think next summer it's going to come back. So I want to take advantage of the extra week I get. Cooch Gawa with an awesome $100 super chat to YouTube. Thank you so much, Cooch Gawa. It says, keep up the good work. Well, thank you so much, Cooch Gawa. Awesome support as always. We will certainly do our best. We've got a tree behind us. It blossomed with flowers, which means it's going to start. It's the tree. It, it blossomed, which means the leaves are coming next, right? That's why Kevin's allergies are going crazy. <laughs> Rudy's looking over at me like, are you all right? I'm over here like. Yeah, I thought something. Like crying. I thought you got like sunscreen in your eyes or something. <laughs> We got those two kings. We'll be heading to the south side as well as these two triple sevens. Philippine and Cathay Pacific. This is the place to be. Green Air A3D Super still waiting 
Our hotel back there can have to sit again. I can see them holding up the A380 Korean Air until the Asiana A380 is ready to taxi and more than likely have them cross over at the same time. It's always a great shot. Got that many, many times last spring and summer when we were having the A380s take off here on the south side. Always an exciting moment, isn't it, Rudy? Oh, yes. I'm surprised there aren't more plane spotters out here today, like right I think, now. I think the, the time change has kind of thrown everyone off a little bit. But it was so busy this morning, and then they all took off. Oh, so, while well, it's Oscar Day, you know, people could be having parties or something. You know, we are in Hollywood after all, really. Yes. Are you grinding the beans? Oh my gosh. I'm telling you, she does not Barista Rita. So it looks like John's flight popping back up on the radar, heading to Fort Lauderdale, flight 380. American 255 at Juliet Crosswind, 25 right ground point 75. How's, how's Ed? See, okay. <laughs> oh, Ed. What are we going to do with you, Ed? <laughs> Ed's got eyes now, he can see. Yes. <laughs> Watch out now. <laughs> A lot of action, boy, look at that. It's got planes everywhere. More like traffic jam. Yes, huge traffic jam. <laughs> Japan Airlines Flight 16 coming up from Tokyo Haneda, 787-9 Dreamliner arriving on the north side. Be heading to the gates of Tom Bradley. I see on the news they're, they're talking about the super bloom. All the wild flowers everywhere. Lovely. Great. Out there in the Inland Empire. It's a good thing I, I I took my Allegra this morning. <laughs> I did my Flonase. <laughs> you normally do that? Not always, just for this time of the year. Yeah, in the last couple of days I've been like ugh, suffering. I tell you, in California, I really don't have allergies, oh, yeah. but some some years it just it gets you. Yeah, I gotta do the I gotta do the sinus rinse again. I hate doing that, but yeah, it's. All right, so we got yeah. both A380 Supers. Looks like they're going to cross them over at the same time. All right, at Juliet, cleared to cross, 2-5 right. Don't hit our traffic and over to ground point 75. Delta 912, see ya. Uh, three, zero, two, four, now cross both of them. Cross two, five, right. Cross two, five, left. Back to the See ya. All right. Green Air Super now cleared to cross over two, five, right. A zero, two, zero, one, super. Philippines 130, following the Cherokee Bravo 130. 
Thank you. Nice. So Korean Air A380 Superflight 18 heading back to Seoul. Should be crossing over 25 right. Asiana A380 Super right behind on the taxiway Lima. So it looks like there will be a little gap between Asiana and Korean Air. ER will be taken off on 25 at right is now the Korean Air A3D Super now on taxiway Alpha heading to 25 left. This is Philippine Airlines 113 taking off to Manila on a 777-300ER Mabuhay. So heard Asiana now can cross over two five right as the Korean Air A three D Super still on Alpha heading to two five left. I saw that Cathay Pacific triple seven at three hundred ER heading back to Hong Kong, heading to two five right.
Dunkirk, there's a takeoff. Okay, they can't really turn off. I'll have to wait on my 25 right, can't they? Switching something on the American 658. Asiana A380 Super continuing down to Taxiway Alpha, heading to join Green Air A380 Super. Both these A380s heading back to Seoul. Heavy early retirement, left, third last. Third last, two five left, Next heavy takeoff is that Cathay Pacific 777-300ER, a two five right. Three five right, two five right. It's good to have the A380s up right, right. close. Oh, Once again, you can feel the excitement in the air, Rudy. Oh, yeah. Triple seven three hundred ER heading to Hong Kong now rolling down at two five right. Cathay Pacific Flight 885 taking off to Hong Kong on a 777-300ER. Cathay 885, heavy gun, thanks for the counterpart there. Thank you, Cathay 885. All right, we'll swing back to the two fives. Both A380 Supers heading there. <laughs> Kevin Pagram, member for 30 months as a Diamond member says, hey Kevin and Rudy, happy Sunday. I hope you both have enjoyed the Biscoffs that gave you at SFO. I figured it has been a while since the last time you had Biscoff. I'll bring more when I visit LA. Till then, keep up the great work. Thank you, Kevin. You can't tell I've had those Biscoffs, Kevin? Come on. <laughs> Rudy, did you enjoy them? Yeah, they're all gone. They were so good. <laughs> Daniela, becoming a silver member once again. Thank you so much. I'm, I'm just in awe right now because Rita literally is boiling the water and she's, she's dripping the coffee. <laughs> it's impressive. Southwest 1500 on that talker, which is right, right? Fiji, the A350-900 coming up in 90. Next arrival on 2-5 on the left. Right, right, right. 2-5 right, clear for takeoff. Southwest 1500. Yeah, our friend Southwest Joe is just less than a week away from Headed to Fiji. Oh, yeah. I'm jealous. <laughs> I can't wait to get on a plane. I'm excited for the New York trip. Yes. Well, you're Ooh. flying in style. Awesome. That's good. That's good. <laughs> oh, thank you, Skittles. Three and a zero, they're super coming. Final on a hyper. 
This is Southwest Airlines 1600 taking off the Houston Hobby on a Max 8. That's really good coffee. Oh, I'm good, Rita. Juliet cross. Runway 25 right, ground on 75, PGA 10. Southwest 1600 contact, still got departure. Still got departure. All right. First of two 83 supers taking off. First of many, I should say, throughout the course of the day. Flight 18 heading back to Seoul. 10 year old A380 super delivered in February of 2014. Now rolling down to five left. coming up. Airspin 846 on the top of 7, left on the Alpha and Ground Point 7-5. Alpha 7, Alpha Ground, 7-5. Fiji, the A350 will head to the hottest club, the West Gates. Every peak outdoors with the two dollar super chest is almost five thousand people watching. Jeez, yeah, you're right. Four point nine. Woo. All right. <laughs> Thanks, you guys. That was incredible. Almost 3,000 likes already here today, too. All right. Well, we've got Asiana A380 Super. By the way, we'll have the Lufthansa Queen take off here on the south side. The Emirates A380 and the Lufthansa King also taking off here on the south side. So leave your TV sets on wherever you're watching. We've got quite that afternoon lineup coming up for you. Chris, we got the afternoon rush well on its way as well. Wait, how come I don't see the... Is the Lufthansa King coming back today? Oh. <laughs> Eight hours oh, away. Yeah, we're not going to see that today. Oh, oh, well. We'll have to save that for next, well, Tuesday. No Lufthansa King here today. Running four geez, hours. over four hours late. Yeek. Well, that's a bummer. I even told Rudy yesterday, I said, don't count on Proud Bird. Yeah, I texted <laughs> all our friends. I said, we're not going to the Proud Bird tomorrow. <laughs> Might have to resend that. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think we'll be able to tonight. <laughs> This is Delta Airlines 673 taking off taking off to Nashville, Tennessee on a 737-800. Got a friend John coming up for takeoff here soon. I was talking to our friend Steve over there. He's really taking it hard today. Oh, this is John up next. 
he said he might give us a shout out. Let's see. Bravo 3737 on a doctor, I'm going to keep right left take off. I right left 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 The one flight, it doesn't tell him the contact departure. Are you kidding me? Three to uh, SoCal. Alaska 3 to contact SoCal, thank you. Go to SoCal, Alaska 3 to have a great day, AVL. Safe. Yes. <laughs> thank you, John. And John was even like, what? What? You're not going to ask me the contact departure. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thanks, John. Have a great flight. Murphy's Law. That's a Murphy's Law. Well, I didn't moment. want to say anything because I don't want to talk over it, but that was Alaska 380 <laughs> taking off to Fort Lauderdale on the Max 9 to San Francisco Giants livery. Here we have Avianca 640 coming in from Guatemala City on an A320 Neo. Still in on that Asiana A380 Super. Asian a two zero one super start the left turn at box trot. <coughs> okay, what's your box trot on a two zero one? Isn't that weird? You don't find that weird? Like, out of yeah. all the flights, all the flights were waiting here, contact departure. They almost forget the one we want to hear. I'm like, did we miss it? super Airbus will hold in position on my 25 left for the land. 321 on a docker, my 25 right for the takeoff. This is United Airlines 2069 taking off to Houston Intercontinental on a Max 9. Should be seeing the Asiana A380 Super heading. Okay, that was for Colpa 360, right? 25 left. There he is. Clear to now runway 25 left. We got information of the traffic departing. Colpa 360. That was 310. Taxi via Hotel Juliet. Hold short over my 25 right. Taxi via Hotel Juliet. Hold short 24 right. Got us 25 right. Got us 310. Asiana Airlines flight 201 heading back to Seoul in this 8 A380 Super. Asiana 201 Super on a Piper, I'm in 25 left, so for takeoff. Asiana Hyper, drop down to Lonely, 25 left, Asiana 201. Drop 21 to Juliet Cross, I'm in 25 right, ground point 75. After Juliet Cross, 25 right, ground 121, 75. Asiana 640 at Lima Cross, I'm in 25 right, ground point 75. Our second A380 Super of the day. Rolling down to 2 5 left. Activate close on with 25 right and 2 1 2 5 left. 6 5 3 21, contact 2 5 departure. Asian 201, super contact, so shall be touching. 
On the Pan Airways, the Dreamliner heading back to Tokyo now, pushing back for the gates of Tom Bradley. Christopher Gunn and Mr. Alpha Echo with a fine dollar super chat. Thanks so much, Christopher. Now that the merger between Asiana and Korean, I'm sorry, JetBlue and Spirit is next, what's the next move for the two carriers? Uh, well, I think JetBlue wants to concentrate back on some things that they need to work on. Spirit, I don't know, that's up in the air. <laughs> Get it? Up in the air? <laughs> it's, I mean, they're <laughs> in some major debt right now, so I, that's a good question there, Christopher. By the way, we were in your neck of the woods yesterday, Christopher. Pasadena, always an awesome place to be. Yeah. Deanna S, a member for 11 months, is a silver member since a few days shot of a year of the great shows by AVL. Well, congratulations, almost a year of membership. Thank you so much. Well, LA Tower be about five ten inbound to if I left at the some oh, good I'm shots. Well, yeah, right. excited to go home and yeah. edit. <laughs> <laughs> Got a Breeze Airways flight 534 coming in from Richmond, Virginia, A22300, seven minutes out. KLM flight 601 coming in from Amsterdam. It's a 787-10 Dreamliner, 10 minutes out. SAS flight 931 bringing back the A350 again here today. 35 minutes away. How's that coffee? It's good. Strong, but good. I'm telling you, drip coffee, that's, that's the way to do it. Megan, 2288, I'm Docker, making 5 right, 7 take off. Super take off, 2 5 right, RNF Docker, 7 3 we also have Ida, A350-900, coming up from Rome, flight 620. Now, just 52 minutes away from Bravo here in Los Angeles. On the Pan Airways, the Dreamliner making that left-hand turn on two tacks away. Bravo will have a south side takeoff coming up. Oh, Rita. <laughs> Copa Airlines flight 360 coming up from Panama City is 737 Max 9 awaiting the cross over 25 right. What's going on? Rita's just grinding away while she was. <laughs> Member for 20 months. This is self a member since 20 months of good times. Let's keep them coming. Thanks. Thank you, Rick. String Bean Jean. Coming a silver member once again. Thank you so much, Jean. And Terry, I'm back with the $2 Super Chat. Thanks so much, Terry. Weight of the A380 and 747. What is that? Millions and tons? Or MTY. What does that stand for? <laughs> Is that a question? I don't know. Is it? Yeah. Terry asking a question. I'm sure Google has the answer. You know what I noticed about when you send a $2 super chat, you get really limited to how many characters you oh, can really? type. Yeah. Oh. So $2 super chats, you have to make it really short. I didn't realize that. Yeah. But then when you go up to, I don't know if it's above $4.99, you get more characters. And I think if you send. More than that, you could write a whole paragraph. Oh, interesting. <laughs> I did not know that. Yeah. Next take off here on the south side. All of a sudden, got cold again. <laughs> yeah, these clouds. I was so excited for the Asiana takeoff because I'm like, the sun is out. And then as soon as it took off, it got cloudy again. Life of a plane spotter. Well, you have the next six months. Six yeah. months to grab that shot. Yeah. 
Copa 360 at Juliet Crossing. Uh, Juliet, fly by drone on this side. Juliet, zero cross is by Ryan and uh, four seven five zero five ten. This is American Airlines 274 taking off to JFK on an A321. Latam Airlines flight 2479 heading to Lima, Peru. It's a 767-300ER. Slowly but surely. I can be serious. She's heading to 25 right. that Lufthansa is running four hours late here today. We have the next six months, Kevin. I know, but I, <laughs> I, you know, our first Sunday with the A380s taking off on the south side again. And of course, the last time this happened, we didn't have the Lufthansa A380 oh, on the south point. side. And the one day we come back with it on a Sunday, you're four hours late. Oh, well. Like you said, we got another six months. Jeff with the ten dollar super chat. Thanks so much, Jeff. Can't wait to meet you next weekend and do some plane spotting at LAX. Excellent, Jeff. We'll see you then. Thanks for your awesome support. Carol Workman upgrading membership to Platinum. Thank you so much for that awesome upgrade there, Carol. Mm -hmm. By the way, did we decide? I know we were talking about it like a week or two ago about when we get back from JFK. Oh, Sunday. Are we doing that Sunday show? I, I'm, I'm torn. I go back and forth and back and forth. I don't know. Because I, I got to tell you, the last time I got back from JFK, I was a walking zombie. Yeah, I'm afraid I'm going to be a walking zombie. I think we should not do the Sunday show. First of all, we have a long week. I have a long flight back, plus it's Easter holiday. So I think it's, I think a lot of people are gonna have other things going on. I think it's best just to post, cancel that show. I am on board with that. British Aerospace 125. British Aerospace. Next thing off, United Airlines, like 1400, heading to Chicago here, 757 300. You know, on top of that, you know, I never take a vacation. You realize that, right? I never take a vacation. I'm always working, always working. And so I'm very leery about ever taking a day off. So, I shouldn't feel bad about I know you guys like your Sunday shows. We're giving you four days at JFK. And, and another show thing. Before that. Yes. Another thing, keep in mind, I'm basically giving up my spring break to go on this trip. So, a, a day for me would be nice as well. Well, you don't have to be here. I wasn't going to force you to come on Sunday. If you don't want to come on Sunday, huh? I... <laughs> this is United Airlines Flight 1400 taking off to Chicago O'Hare on a 757-300. <laughs> yeah, the next... Uh, March, for me, has always been a very heavy month. And the next two weeks are definitely going to be jam-packed. I can see people yelling at the TV. Oh, I'm going to feel sorry for you, Rudy. You're spending your spring break at the TWA Hotel. I, I'm not asking for anybody to feel sorry for me. No, but I know. I'm just saying. Yeah. I'm just saying. When you said that, I instantly was like, oh, people are going to be like, oh, yeah, sorry, Rudy. Yeah. No, I get it. That's fine. <laughs> but yeah, we have our biggest competition of the year this Wednesday. We have a recruiting event Thursday. And then it's parent conference week next week, the week after. So the week before we go to JFK parent conferences that week usually just zaps the life out of me <laughs> oh great so you're gonna be tired going to jfk uh, yeah oh yeah 
but you got five hours to catch up on your sleep. This is All Nippon Airways Flight 5 taking off to Tokyo, Narita on a 787-9 Dreamliner. By the way, we hardly ever see a United 777-300ER. This one coming in from Newark, flight 2679. Kind of a rare bird for us here at LAX anymore. Breeze, flight coming in from Richmond. Rudy, hurry, grab, grab the Osmo and grab some B-roll for uh, Charlie. I'm joking. <laughs> I mean, no. <laughs> Oh, I gotta practice. What if you did do that to me? Like, hurry! No, I'm not gonna ever tell you to shoot that on the Osmo. No, but like, what if there's something I really need to grab fast? Okay, was I quick enough? Oh, wrong button. <laughs> So zoom in and out is up and down. No, don't ever use the zoom. Zoom, no, bad, bad. <laughs> this guy left flight 601 coming in from Amsterdam in the 77 nine Dreamliner. This is Aeromexico flight heading back to Mexico City. So if you guys are just tuning in, we purchased a couple of new vlogging cameras. We're going to uh, basically the first, the trip to New York is technically going to be the f first major vlog between the two of us. We bought two of these D DJI Osmo 3 cameras. Rudy's testing it out right now. We'll each have one of these as we head to New York and we're going to document the whole week, including the flight out, the, the trip to JFK, TWA Hotel. So we're testing out a little behind the scenes. I just got these yesterday. <laughs> it's been it's been hard to get these cameras, I got to tell you. They're, they're back yeah. ordered and then having to do with UPS and the del delivery. They actually knocked on my door at 8.30 last night. I thought for sure they weren't going to get delivered That's until so Monday. That's so funny because we were at dinner yesterday after the photo shoot and Kevin was kind of stressed out yeah. because he, for some reason, kept missing the delivery. I guess yeah. you had to be home to sign for it or something. Yeah, and I, ch and I told them, go deliver it somewhere else, and they didn't. And so they keep on delaying the delivery. So it told me it was going to come by 7 p.m. on Monday, knock, knock at 8.30 at night, a little tap on the door. It wasn't even the doorbell. I, I, if I was in the back room, I wouldn't have heard it. <laughs> and it's the UPS guy. I said, oh, I thought this package was coming tomorrow. They're like, well, are you happy it's here now? <laughs> yes. So yes. I just took it out of the box this morning. So now we're playing around with it. <laughs> oh. No, <it's> <laughs> so there we go. So so Rudy's 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 documenting some of the behind the scenes stuff here today. If it's good, we'll post it. We'll post it on social media. You guys have something to look forward to. Japan Airlines to Dream Letter now pushing it back. Flight 61 heading to Tokyo to Rita. 787 8 Dream Liner. That's the Aeromexico Dream Liner now makes that left hand turn onto Bravo. Up next, Latam Airlines flight 2479 heading to Lima, Peru, a 767-300ER. <laughs> Sp 
Speedster D, a member for 21 months. This is several members. This is big Sunday fun. Cheers, AVL family. Cheers. Cheers. Tamar A with a $5 super jet. Thanks so much, Tamar. Hi, Kevin and Rudy. Will you be at Imperial Hill on Tuesday? I'll be flying to Houston on United Flight 2069 and hoping for a south side departure. I will. I'll be here bright and early on Tuesday morning. James with the $10 super chat. Thanks so much, James. All right, Latam at 767 now take it off on 25 or right. This is Latam Airlines 2479 taking off to Lima, Peru on a 767 300ER. Doctor, please go. Right, welcome to uh, 684. <laughs> Rita, the barista over here, grinding more beans. <laughs> Paige Larson, a member for two months. This is Silver. Member says, AVL is my therapy. Thanks for what you do. Do well, our pleasure. Thanks so much, Paige. Aeropress. James, back with a $5 Super Chat. Thanks so much, James. Delta will have five daily 8350 flights to and from LAX throughout the end of March. That is cool. Oh, we've seen our fair share of Delta A350s here today. KLM heading to the west side gates, so the west gates. This is Delta Airlines 684 taking off to Raleigh Durham on a 737 900ER. Yeah, I finally got my silver medallion bag tags from Delta. Oh, nice. Got them in the mail. I don't really know what they're for. I think it's just bragging rights. Like, look at me. I'm a silver medallion member. <laughs> Sounds about right. Yeah. Yeah. Problem is, I have no flights booked <laughs> for Delta. <laughs> Can't you put them on your JetBlue bags? Yeah. Don't. I mean, none of that. I Nope. <laughs> Rob Thompson with a two dollars super chat. Thanks so much, Rob. Those cameras are not cheap. Holy cow! Um, are you talking about the, the Osmos? It's more expensive than a GoPro, I think, but it's cheaper than a than a normal camera. So if you're all wondering, Ben was at the photo shoot yesterday, and he was mocking my my smiles because they were they looked kind of fake. I will be honest with you. At one point, I'm like, that's an awkward smile. There was one photo. You were hat. You had the mics on, the headset. Oh yeah. <laughs> This is a brand new A321 Neo with JetBlue Airways taking off to JFK flight 2024. He had the headset on, he had a plane spotter hat on, and you were you had the iPad. Like you were taking an order at a drive-thru. <laughs> he looked like he should be working the drive-thru at Arby's. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't like that one. I think we should we should sell that as a stock photo to Arby's? fast food companies. Yeah. Just take the plane spotter off the logo. Yeah, put me no on branding. the cover of your training manual. Employee, employee manual. How to work the drive through <laughs> My name's Rudy, and I will be teaching you how to work the drive through yes. at our fast food restaurant. I used to love working the drive through 
Step one, always smile. <laughs> Southwest Air, 521, a member for 11 months. This is Silver Member, this is 11 months. Wow. RIP to Aria Akira Toriyama. Yes, passed away at the beginning of March. Japanese manga artist. Oh, okay. Manga? Manga? How do you say it? Manga? Sorry to hear that. This is Volatis 4331 taking off to San Salvador on an A320 Neo El Salvador. Japan Airlines Dreamliner looks like it's about to make a U turn and head to the north side. It was about a year ago when I stepped foot into a, actually went through the drive through of the Carl's Jr. restaurant only to get home to realize that there was no meat patty. Oh, that's right. On my burger. And when we went to Dallas, we were joking about the whole story. <laughs> Where is the beef? Where is the beef? It was literally the night before <laughs> we flew to Dallas. So when you got the brisket there in Dallas, I said, where's the beef? It's right here. Yeah, it's making oh, up for it. <laughs> Go on the town on that brisket. Five right at Juliet United. This is United 39 taking off to Tokyo Haneda on a 787-10 Dreamliner. Yeah, I don't have the best poker face, Ross. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the thing about working the drive-thru. You don't have to look at people face to face until they drive up to the window. So when you are on your <clears throat> when you're on your microphone and you say I have a complicated order, number two, no cheese. <laughs> now you say, hi, welcome to Arby's. My name is Kevin. What can I get you today? And you don't have to smile. See? Until then they there's come me. up to the window. Then there's me. Welcome to McDonald's. What do you want? <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. You never worked in fast food? You I... never worked in fast food? No, I worked at El wow. Torito. Oh, that's right. You worked at El Torito. You, uh, were you a server, or what, what did you do? I was a do? busser. A busser. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's much different. Than and I'll never forget, I had a customer upset me once, because their server was attending to them, and he came up to me and tapped me on the shoulder, and he goes, chips and salsa for the table. Oh. Stat. And I'm oh. like, um, okay. Anything else? <laughs> <laughs> Do any of you know Bon Kui Kui? <laughs> this Global 5000 taking off to Aspen, Colorado. Is that the... Welcome to King Burger, where you can have it your way, but don't get crazy. Oh, yes. <laughs> you sure you don't want a Coke? <laughs> you want like a, what was it, like a McFlurry? You sure you don't want a Coke? I got to clean the machine. I don't got time for that. <laughs> I'm telling you, everyone, their first job should be in fast food. Yes. There you learn a lot. Patience. How to, how to deal with people, that's the big one. The CRJ 700 taking off to Aspen, Colorado, Skywest 5553. Everyone's headed out to Aspen.
And we got that Aero Mexico Dreamliner heading back to Mexico <laughs> City and now taking off on 2 5 right. American 344 at Juliet crossing way 25 right, contact ground, 27 5 right. Aquí tenemos Aro México 647 a ah, la Ciudad de México. Jog at that, it's flight 647 going to Mexico City. What's that? Pastrami fries. Ooh. Yeah. Right, yeah. Go for it, Rudy. 30 oh. is 60. Okay, yeah. Well, it's the top of the hour. Oh. So it is? I'll, I'll go after that. All right. <laughs> and after I, yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> top of the hour time. Officially. <laughs> Officially. <laughs> I'm fired officially at the top of the hour. You're watching continuous live coverage of LEX plane spotted right here in your home for LEX live streams. That is Airline Videos Live. Today is a big Sunday show here on March 10th, 2024. Don't laugh, Rudy, you make me laugh. Um, Hello, everyone. Nope, it's not the end of the show yet. <laughs> <laughs> As we march forward, the afternoon rush well upon us. Thanks, everyone, for tuning in. Make sure to hit that like button if you haven't yet. Share this stream with your family and your friends. And let us know where you're watching from. <laughs> All right. Indeed. Thanks, you guys. <laughs> You know, the funny thing is, we're sitting here laughing. No one around us knows exactly what just happened. Not even Jerry. Jerry doesn't even know what happened. <laughs> he turned on the chipmunk voice. <laughs> By accident. No, I, I, I was on the wrong channel on the, on the mixer. <laughs> I always do that. We have viewers watching from all over the world, including Richmond, Virginia, Cary, Ireland, New Orleans, Maryland, New Delhi in India, Denver, Colorado, LAX, Syracuse in New York, Chicago, Daytona Beach, Florida, Sioux Falls, South Dakota, Grand Rapids, Michigan. We're looking at Japan Airlines Flight 61 taking off to Tokyo Narita, taking off from 24 right. Hampton, Georgia, Belgium, Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada, Temperance, Michigan, Cleveland, Ohio, Bowie, Maryland, Disneyland, California, Nashville, Tennessee, Walnut Creek, California. New Zealand, San Gabriel Valley, Ingersoll, Ontario, Canada, Lynchburg, Virginia, Pre Staten in Wales, Downey, California, Macapá, Brazil, Grand Canaria in Spain. Hello to everyone in High Point, North Carolina. Omaha, Nebraska. The viewers here in Clutters Park, Nairobi, in Kenya. Battle Creek, Michigan. Columbus, Ohio. Montebello, New York. This is United 616 taking off to Denver, Colorado on a 737-900ER. Cape Cod, Massachusetts. Southwest Oklahoma. The viewers in La Mirada, Atlanta. Cleveland, Ohio, Norfolk in the UK, Ladysmith, British Columbia, Canada, Warsaw in Poland, Portland, Oregon, Manchester, Chester, Virginia, Tenerife, Canary Islands in Spain, Mumbai in India, Winnipeg, Canada, Sioux City, Iowa, 
Clinton, TWP, in Michigan, Los Santos, Tyler, Texas, Newcastle in the UK, Fort Worth, Texas, I think that was Clinton Township. Burbank, Hollywood Airport, Fairfax, Virginia, Pasadena, California. This is JetBlue, 1463, taking off to San Jose del Cabo, Los Cabos, on an A320. Rockford, Michigan, Orlando, Florida. We have viewers in Sweden, Irvine, California. Simi Valley, here in California. Copenhagen, we have viewers in the Philippines. Nassau, the Bahamas. Cordelaine. Cordelaine. <laughs> Always mess that one up. Albuquerque, New Mexico. Cordelaine. This is Alaska 1219 taking off to Seattle on a 737 900ER. Abington in Pennsylvania, North Potomac, Maryland, Fresno, California, Fort Worth, Texas, Barcelona, Spain, Hudson Valley, New York, Los Gatos, Searing, California, La Mesa, Moringa in Brazil, Twin Falls, Idaho, Kingsford in Michigan. We have viewers in Germany, Birmingham in England, Melbourne in Florida, Cedar Springs, Michigan, East Lansing, Michigan. Boy, a lot of you guys in my hometown. Tampa, Florida. Let's see a couple more. Buenos Aires, Argentina, Salem in Missouri. Mesa, Arizona, Crown Point, Indiana, and Ottawa, Canada. That'll do it for me. Thank you all so much for tuning in. We are live from Flutters Park here in El Segundo, California. Yeah, Rudy's going to go step away for a few moments. That was American Airlines flight 6858 heading to Dallas, Fort Worth, Texas, and at A321. Our next takeoff here on the south side, United Airlines flight 3931 heading to SFO at 777 and 200 ER. Matter of fact, this is the triple seven that lost the wheel. This is it. This is the triple seven that lost that wheel at SFO. So that one happened on the 7th, on Thursday. On the 8th, the next day, it did go back up to SFO. It was up there for the day. United 1431, RNAV, Docker, runway 25, right through, takeoff. Yesterday, also made a run from LA to SFO as well. So it looks like it's been making runs back and forth. SAS, the A350, coming up from Copenhagen. Next arrival on the north side.
Max taking off here on the south side. United Airlines flight 1431 heading to Honolulu. It's a Richard Foreman, a member for one month. This is Gold Members is one of the best plane spotting channels out there. Thank you so much, Richard. Appreciate that nice comment. Gerard K, member for two months. This is Gold Members says, hey, Rudy, Kevin, and the AVL family. Great day for plane spotting with the plane jockeys. It sure is a beautiful day. Though I can't make up its mind if it wants to go cool or warm. I guess it's, we're getting, uh, we're getting all kinds of weather here today. As long as it's not raining, we're all good. Brian D, a member for 18 months, is a platinum member. So thanks for another fabulous day of plane spotting on this busy day at LAX. Kevin and Rudy, cheers to the AVL community. Thank you so much, Brian. Kelly Morris with the Five Dollar Super Chat. Thanks so much, Kelly. Okay, to visit you on the hill on May 12th. We are staying at the H Hotel. One night before flying home the next day. Yes, will I be here? May 12th. May 12th. What day of the week is that? That is a Sunday. We will be here. We'll see you then. Thank you, Kelly. Janet Pinky Todd. Gifting five airline videos live memberships. Thank you so much, Janet. Janet, um, by the way, I, I would assume that you saw our discount code for the TWA. It is AVL TWA, all one word. AVL TWA. All right. Drop the box. Janet give you five airline videos live memberships. Thank you so much, Janet. Swat Cats back with the awesome $20 super chat. Thanks so much, Swat Cats. Here is a simple way to make great hamburgers. <laughs> cool, crushed up Cool Ranch Doritos. Very fine, minced yellow or white onions. Your choice. And your favorite barbecue sauce all mixed together in ground beef and you grill it. Um, that sounds amazing. And if I was someone who cooked, I would make that right away. I would make that today on this beautiful Sunday. Anybody else? There you go. Crushed up Cool Ranch Doritos. <laughs> Thank you so much, Swat Cats. That, that sounds amazing. It really does. Richard with a $10 super chat. Thank you so much, Richard. American Flight Net 1799, LAZ or Philadelphia just flew over my house. How cool is that? You know, as a kid, I you know grew up in Lansing, Michigan. It's it's not. I mean, we had Capital City Airport, which was fairly decent size back in the day, but certainly not not anymore. But we are in the fi flight line, obviously, for the major airports, Detroit, Chicago. A lot of flights flying over there, but not even that. When I flew on Lufthansa, I remember the A34600 from Munich back to Chicago. I flew basically just over mid-Michigan, my hometown, coming back from Germany. That was very interesting. So my point is, as a kid, I may not have been around many heavy, action-packed airports. Hardly ever went to Detroit. If we did, it was a special treat. Chicago as well. But if I wanted to go to the airport, I had to go see DC-9s and 727s and 737-200s. That's why I always loved the 737-200 and the 727, because that's what I kind of grew up uh, around as a young plane spotter back in the day. So if I wanted to see heavy action any day of the week, I would have to look up into the sky. And that was about the closest I was ever going to get to seeing a 747 or whatnot. 
Of course, we didn't have those tracking apps as well, so you kind of you, you kind of didn't really uh, know what you were looking at. Right now. We'll get back to East Coast, yes, turn. Taxi with November. I think parking SAS at the West uh, Gates now. Air New Zealand Flight 6 coming up from Auckland at 777-300ER, just touching down here on the south side. I also have China Airlines Cargo, Flight 5382 heading to Miami, Florida, 777 Freighter lighting up. We'll have a south side takeoff on 25 left, more than likely, coming up. Porter Airlines, the 663, coming in from Toronto. It's an E195. E2 is the next arrival here on the south side. Thank you at Bravo 17, crossing way 25 right, right turn on Bravo and contact ground 0.75. Cross 25 right at Bravo 17, right on Bravo over to ground, code 777 will be heading to Tom Bradley. United Airlines Flight 38 coming up from Tokyo Haneda. It's a 787-10 Dreamliner. Four minutes out from a north side arrival. Currently over downtown Los Angeles. Ita, the A350-900 coming up from Rome. Now just 13 minutes out. Certainly looking like possibly a north side arrival on 24 right. I would expect to see Ita take off on the south side. Even though, even though a lot of these flights are arriving on the north side here today, don't give up hope. We will certainly see a lot of these heavies taking off here on the south side later in the show. Also have Air France Flight 66 coming up from Paris at the 777-300ER, 19 minutes away. Sorry, United 38 Heavy, clear the visual, 25 left. United 38 Heavy, lost in a tower, wind 2408, runway 25 left, clear to land. Clear to land on 25 left, United 38. By the way, we have another live drawing coming up in a few hours. Here's what we're giving away. How about an Airline Videos Live official hoodie? Tons of many different colors. Go check them out at shopabl.com. This could be yours if you're an ABL member and are in the chat. We'll give you a code word to enter. Once again, that is coming up a bit, little bit later tater. Air New Zealand making that final turn heading into the southeast corner of Tom Bradley. Porter, the E2, just arriving here on the south side.
Flight time from Toronto is four hours and 51 minutes. Looks like a SAS. Hey, I'm confused. We have the A350 back. But that landed on the north side, came to the south side. Now going back to the north side. Oh, that's right, because the taxiways are closed up there. So it had to come take the bridge route to the south side and then took November back up to Delta or Echo. Now heading to the north side of Tom Bradley. I would expect to see that A350, though, take off a bit later tater here on the south side. Yeah, that would be nice. Where'd everyone go? Probably to go get lunch. back yeah the airport just kind of like just got really <laughs> quiet all of a sudden <laughs> yep i'm back rudy's back guess who's back <laughs> back again rudy's back so emirates running a little late here today still an hour and three minutes out as well as the latonsic queen running about 45 minutes behind, still an hour and a half away. 747 to 8 Intercontinental. Air France, the triple. Nope, no, this is the Delta. Not Delta. <laughs> United. United, flight 38. Oh, I thought United that was heading to the north side. Right the high Interesting, right snuck over here to the south side. Dreamliner coming from Tokyo, Haneda. Do have an American 777-300ER heading to 25 right. China cargo, China Airlines cargo, 777 freighter heading to Miami, flight 5382. They also have Cargo King, China Cargo Airlines, flight 222 heading to Shanghai, a 777 freighter lighting up. And American Airlines flight 9602, the 777-300ER heading to Miami, number two for Take off here on the south side. United also have United Airlines, flight 2614, heading to Newark. 787-10 Dreamliner now pushing back for the gates of Terminal 7. Ita, now just five minutes out. It's pretty cool. Did you see it? There's an article on, is it Frommers.com? Yes. The article is entitled, The Best Airport Live Streamers. Yes. Now landing all day on a screen near you. Yeah. And we're number one. We were the first ones listed on that article. It's we're Frommers, number one. Frommers double M. I think that article came out, I think it was triggered. The article was written because of everything that happened last week. By the way, that 777 took off, the one that had the wheel oh, yeah, yeah. off, took off to back to SFO. Um, oh. I think that kind of like caught some people's attention. Like, what is all this airport live streamers? As of early March, 2024, airline videos, 767 
thousand subscribers. Yeah, we're almost 768. 767. Nice. We didn't my last favorite very long. I think we're all. I, let me double check. I think we're already past that. My favorite line of the summary about our channel. The number of batteries they use as they shoot from the rooftop of an airport hotel could power a small carnival. <laughs> a carnival. I'm just glad they didn't say a zoo. <laughs> yes. Can you put the link in the chat? Yeah. Some people are requesting it. So we're at two or seven hundred and sixty-eight thousand two hundred. So that's how fast we went up in subscribers since that article was written just a few days ago. Maybe that article increased our subscriber count. Mrs. Ed three becoming a silver member once again. Thank you so much, Mrs. Ed. All right, we got the triple seven freighter with Shauna Airlines. We'll be taking off on two five left again. That is the closest runway to our camera and microphone. So if you'd like a nice loud, just like my neighbor does, turn it up. Your new neighbor? <laughs> New neighbor, she never moved out. Oh, I thought she moved out. Oh, I thought so too. Oh no, she's still up there. Yeah, don't get me started. Oh, don't even get me started. No. I don't know if the complex is lying to me or not. I have no idea what's going on. All right. <laughs> this flight is heading to Miami. And that is Ita checking in. Will be a south side arrival coming up. Behind Abbey, Bravo to the full length of Blue 2085. We have a lot of action about to take off on 25 right, including United Airlines, flight 2449, heading to Las Vegas, 737-800 up next, followed by that American 777-300ER heading to Miami, flight 9602. That'll be followed by China Cargo Airlines, 222, heading to Shanghai and a 777 freighter. 25 right, clip take off United American 9602, heavy loss at a tavern, way 25 right, left way, trust will cross down. As United Dreamliner, play 2614, heading to Newark. We'll head over to 25 right. Bob's back. Bob, you, you came back. Do I need to have a word with you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay, now I can't get mad at you. He just handed me Pop-Tarts. Ah! Okay. Bob. All right. <laughs> I guess we could still be friends. You're so mean to Bob. I'm so mean to Bob. <laughs> Bob's just bobbing around with his pop tarts. This is United Airlines 2449 taking off to Las Vegas on a 737 800.
You can't have my Pop Tarts. <laughs> <laughs> what? What is that? Lay, lay off my ego. Lego my ego. A Lego my ego. Lego my Pop Tart. We could have said that this morning with the waffles. Lego my ego. It's uh, the A350. Next arrival here on the south side. We're blocked by a lot of cargo aircraft here on the south side. Yeah. Bob Tart. Bob Tart. <laughs> Got that American 777-300ER heading to Miami. Now rolling down at 25 right. This is American Airlines 9602 taking off to Miami, Florida on a 777-300ER. Perfect lighting conditions. All right, Eta, get behind, or get, move. I'm gonna clear this building. Oh, right behind the building. What's that? Oh, no, it's good. And the cargo king is now rolling on 25 right. Air Tahiti Nui, the Dreamliner, heading to Paris, flight 8, heading for a south side takeoff. This is China Cargo Airlines 222 taking off to Shanghai on a 777 freighter. All right, Ita. Go to Air France 777-300ER. Next arrival here on the south side as well. Flight time from Rome is 11 hours and 57 minutes. So we just like to show you the ghost livery there on the tail of Ita. I always like to tell the story though when I was shooting the BTS at SFL with James, we were on the ramp and Ita was pulling in to the gate. And I said, James, look, do you do you know about the, the ghost livery on the on the tail of the A three fifty? He had no idea. He looked up and he's like Wow, you're right. <laughs> I see some of you commenting about this being stainless steel, but it's a uh, carbon fiber, right? Painted blue. 
It's the best livery ever. It's gorgeous. I don't know, the model companies can't even get this blue right. Nice. Look at the difference between the oh, Airbus and the Nui. Finally, <laughs> after all these weeks. <laughs> hey, what's up? Welcome to the mess. Outside car. My gosh, it's a big box. <laughs> my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, yes. There we go. Right. Let's, let's get this. Our friend Eric from Boston just. Gave us the biggest box of well, side. Wait, now car. I have to use our new <laughs> <laughs> gear. My here. gosh, Eric! Thank you so much. Have you had these? Oh, you have had. Them. What's up? Oh, car. No, 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 no! I mean, you've had, you've had some. <laughs> oh, Rudy with the new vlog, vlog camera. <laughs> <laughs> All right, step by here. Ready, grab the ace. Oh, yes. Thank you, Eric. All right, thank you so much. Send a China cargo, China Airlines cargo, 777. Land here on the south side, flight 5138, coming up from Taipei. Going short. Let's see, 5138, turn left down to Alpha, and then contact ground point seven five. So we've got the Air France 777 still on hotel, as well as Eta in the air. Tahiti Nui Dreamliner heading down for the takeoff, heading to Paris. Thank you. <laughs> Air Sprint is climbing via the SID except maintain 5,000. That means you have to adhere to all the restrictions on the SID. Okay, you know, 2614 Heavy RNF, Docker went 2508, runway 258 for takeoff. Let's take off runway uh, 25 right, United 2614. Yeah, 1232, caution, return to the track, we're proceed by way of level 8. Level 8, level 8. Left 3252, contact departure. Oh, it's quite gone. 30 minutes. Alright, definitely in the southwest, 4174. Southwest 4174, LA Tower, heavy 787, depart on the right, caution, return, went 25 right, runway 25 left, good land. Outside of the Herard here. New York, New Jersey, livery number two for takeoff here on the south side. Up first, United Airlines flight 2614 heading to Newark at a 787-10 Dreamliner. That is followed by the United Herart here, New York, New Jersey, livery flight 1233 heading to Houston, Texas in the 757-200. Got that United Dreamliner now rolling it down to five right. Twenty two, turn right at Hotel Seven. Airbond sixty six eighty, cross two by right, ground point seven five. I don't think I need to get, uh, you get the signal. Airbond sixty six eighty, just cross two by right, please. The car just two front left, uh, right, right, airbond seven five. Airbond sixty twenty eighty, cross two by right, contact ground point seven five. Yeah, 2614 heavy contact departure. All right, Ita and Air France still waiting to cross over. We got that United Her Art here in New York, New Jersey delivery. Flight heading to Houston. Air France now going to cross over. Hey, Taro, 620 heavy, did you copy? Negative, sir. Fantastic. Hey, Taro, 620 heavy, hold short of runway 2 by right to Lima. Mm. Copy, thank you. We are short the uh, runway 25 right on Lima. It's at our 620 Eek. Low tower, United 2675, 2675 left. Yeah, 2675 left, I'm tower, 25 right on runway 25 left, clear to land. Clear to land, 25 left, United 2675. Yeah, 1233, RNAV Docker, wind 250, now to runway 25 right, clear for takeoff. RNAV Docker, clear for takeoff, 25 right, now to runway 25 Yeah, the 1635, lost in the time, runway 25 right, not up away. I'm not up away, United 1635. Uh, 1635.
right up next is the United Special Livery. The Herard here, California, I'm sorry, New York, New Jersey Livery. There's Sprint 846 at Foxtrot. Cross from 25 left and hold, turn over lane 25 right. Ita will hold before crossing over as the 757 is now rolling down. Ita is still waiting to cross over oh, Swap Cats back with the $20 Super Chat. Biggest much Swap Cats. That color on Ita Airlines is called Save Savoy Blue. Also, William Post, 627 and 1927 through February 10th, 2024. And in the eventer, a Pop Tarts passed away. Really? Really? Today? No, that was last month, a month ago today. Wow. Wind, 240 down there. Yeah, 635, contact departure. What the fuck did you do? Got 205, miles down, 35 left. Got 205, left down, wind 240 down there, runway 25 left, clear to land. 25 left, clear to land, got 205. That was United Airlines flight 1635 heading to Dulles in that 737-900ER. Next takeoff is Air Tahiti Nui flight 8 heading to Paris in the 787-9 Dreamliner. Ita still waiting to cross over. I have no problem with that. She just wants to sit there a little bit longer. All right, Air Tahiti Nui flight heading to Paris, 787-9 Dreamliner. I didn't hear it. Did you guys hear him tell Ita to cross over? I didn't hear that. I didn't hear him. I understand that, but I, I called you in the, before, too, when I held you short, and I tried to cross you, and you didn't answer again. Now, 2675, cross 25 right, ground 0.75. Copy 25 right, ground 0.75, United 2675. Uh, now, I, there's nothing wrong with this radio, so 8 heavy contact ooh. departure. <laughs> I did not hear ATC tell Ataro Ita to cross over. Two, when two trees run out of runway 25 left to the land. Yeah, I don't think anybody heard that. Or Ita. You heard it? Yeah, it was just before. No, no, no. Before FIFA. No, yeah, well, he was, yeah, there was that, but he, he, ATC just says, I told you three times to cross over 2 5 right. He didn't. He did, but I heard it. First time he did What are you listening to? <laughs> <laughs> what channel are you on, Rita? Are you listening to me? All right, well, then we just can go back. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe we'll go back. Charlie Golf, Zero Hotel, India, radio check. 
Just getting a radio check, thank you. Two zero five two right hotel six zero right on the hotel. Six zero. Right hotel. 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 Right Go 6205, Old Short of Runway 2 by Ready Golf. Short of 2 by Ready Golf. Right, 2617, contact, still got a pleasure. Someone's timing out. Someone's calling in saying they're timing out. They're not hey, legal. Are you going to roll or do I need to cancel your takeoff clearance? We are under all, sir. Our legal commitment. Ooh. Seven, five, seven, sir. I understand, but that's because uh, we have no weight between uh, the departures at this time. We have problems with the beach on the break. The beach on the Okay, but that's. He's going to be seven miles in trail now. So Charlie can help Sierra Hotel India. From a two five left now, line up and wait. Uh, I'm not a PC controller, but I, I'm, I'm shocked that they have not pulled him right now. This is what causes accidents. Seven when you get people all worked up. Let's see here. Back down the runway, I'll call your exit, okay? All right, we'll take you down. Yeah, it's going sideways real fast. Yeah, thank you, sir. There's traffic's going to cross down field ahead of you. Steve Ballmer's playing this here. Golf cross two five right, Charlie Ford the ramp. This is Air Mexico 783 taking off to Guadalajara on a 737-800. Wanted to hear what I'm missing. Here you want to take over real quick? I can talk. Yes. I'll take over. So Kevin can talk to our friend. There's Sprint 846 runway 2-5 right, line up away. Um, well? Armaco, 73, contact departure. 60 bucks, Armaco. I'm like, what am I missing? A22300. Contact departure. 
That was American Airlines 636 taking off to Charlotte on an A321neo. BTC needs a hug. We have Steve Ballmer's plane coming in. Uh, up and end, I've been That was American Airlines 291 taking off to Chicago here on a 737-800. This is American Flight 26 coming in from Tokyo Haneda, a 787-8 Dreamliner. The Singapore Airlines Flight 11 will be taking off to Tokyo. Narita on this triple seven three hundred ER. Thank you, Arnav Docker. Arnav Docker. Box two five thirty five LA Tower, Kashiwa German. Traffic will cross from the two five eight point of the way. Right, twenty twenty one contact departure to the park. You have to hang right twenty twenty one. That was Alaska Horizon 2021 taking off to Bozeman on an E-175. Hello. Wind 2308. I forget. There we go. All right. So Richard sending in a super chat. Thank you so much. American Flight 1799 LAX or Philly just flew over my house. Very nice. Falcon 84, welcome heading on Bravo 4 on the inside. Roger. America 2286, attacks Juliet, cross 2 by weight, ground point 75. Cross 2 by weight, ground point 75. 
wasn't a true honk for AVL moment. That was Rita. <laughs> oh, Rita. Rita, Rita, Rita. What are we going to do with you, Rita? Okay, 1557 RNF, Docker, wind, two trees, zero eight, runway two, five, break, the takeoff. RNF, the Docker, two, five, So uh, I know five, he's five, probably not listening, off, but, uh, and speaking of Breeze. Moxie 535, contact departure. Kind of stays behind the camera. This is Breeze Airways Moxie 535 taking off to Richmond, Virginia on an A220-300. So, he's probably not watching, but I, you know, the, the person that was just here saying hello to us for the first time is Eric with the agency that we work with out of Boston. He's been here for a week. He has a lot of clients here in Southern California. This is the first time he's actually been here. He's an aviation nut himself. He's actually a pilot himself as well. This is the first time he's come out and actually seen the setup, giving us sidecar donuts. So yeah, props to Eric. And it's funny, Bree's taking off. Eric, you know, he's the one working behind the scenes that is getting us these exclusive behind the scenes videos. So props to Eric. Thank you, Eric. I know he didn't want to go on. He's kind of behind the scenes type of guy, but he was here checking it out. So glad he showed up. Eric, have a safe trip. Yes, and I made sure to say thank you as well. Thank you for all the wonderful opportunities you have opened up for the channel. Yes. I did, I did invite him to dinner, but he already had the ones. Oh. <laughs> I said, ah, oh, darn, about that, yeah. next time. He said, yeah, when we go to, when you guys go to Boston. Boston, yeah. yeah. He said, yes, we'll have to have dinner then. Allison actually met Eric in Boston the last time I was there. Singapore flight 11. This is Singapore Airlines Flight 11 taking off to Tokyo Narita on a 777-300ER. So while you were over there talking to Eric, the controller that's still controlling here at the south side, boy, he was kind of having a, do I dare to say, meltdown a little bit. He was getting very tense with the pilots 
It's the same one we've talked about in the last few years. Oh, yeah. Same situation where it gets to the point where it makes the situation, whatever it may be, very tense. Yeah, I know some people would say, well, he's still doing his job. But at the yes. same time, it's... Yeah. Well, we're all human. When you start yapping and yelling at people, it doesn't make the situation better. It starts causing people to, because we're all human, we react to when people yell or right. scream or whatever in a certain way. It's just the human way we react. It just, it, it doesn't go well. Yeah, it raises those uh, stress hormones, those, you know, or it makes you just anxious. Well, it makes you not pay attention to really what you're up, you're doing. All right. <laughs> that officially takes us to the top of the hour. And officially 2 p.m. here in beautiful Los Angeles, California, you are watching continuous live coverage of LAX plane spotting right here on your home for LAX live streams. That is Airline Videos Live. Today is a big Sunday show here on March 10th, 2024. And we are the Plane Jockeys here at Imperial Hill. Thanks, you guys, for spending your Sunday with us. Much more to go. Wait, you know, we really still haven't even had the king and the queen show up here today. So much more to go, so don't go anywhere. Oh, yeah. <laughs> don't go anywhere. <laughs> don't go anywhere. <laughs> we have the NYPD livery with Jeff Blue arriving here on the south side from Puerto Vallarta. I also have Speedbird, flight 283, committed from London Heathrow, 777-200ER, arriving on the north side. It's also in the One World delivery. Very nice. Got a 352 LA Tower, me 25 right line up away. So Turkish, triple seven now pushing back. It's flight 180 will be heading back to Istanbul. And at any normal time, we would see that tail heading to the south like that. And we would think, oh, it's going to the north. Not today. I have yet to see a 777-300ER take off on 2-4 right. I've seen the Dreamliner, I've seen the 767, and I've seen one A350-900 so far. I have yet to see a 777-300ER. Of course, it all depends on how what their load factor is, how much weight they are, but I think the 777-300ER is just a little t a tad too large to take off there on the north side on 2-4 right, since it is one of the shortest runways here at LAX. You know, the 352 so expect that to make a U-turn here. Which one did you end up? I don't think I read any of those. Yeah, not even. SoCal train fan with this super chat. Thank you so much. DJ Jack Tech with the two dollar super jet thanks to DJ. We need later tater and not hater tater in the tower. <laughs> <laughs> well, I wouldn't say that, but yeah, I would it'd be nice to hear one of the taters here today. Ten high flush, becoming a gold member. Thank you so much. And Michael with the five dollar super chest is uh, Korean Air and Emirates two two five estimated. Oh. 2.25 p.m. and 2.28, both A380 Supers. United 352, contact departure. Spirit 506, cross 2, by way to Juliet, contact ground 0.75. Right, cross 2, 5 right, Juliet, going to ground, spirit wing, 506. That was United 352 taking off to Washington Dulles on a Max 8. So Eric also bringing us 
the largest box of sidecar donuts that I've seen. Yes. And I told Eric that that one was for you. Oh, oh, okay. Yes. <laughs> Look at that chocolate one. Ooh. Ooh. That one looks good too. Yes. All right. Ooh, the sprinkles. <laughs> this is all I need. Donuts. What happened to that diet? Yeah, diets are so 2020. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> what? Well, I can't wait until you read Sarah's Super Chat. <laughs> you going to have one? Yes. Six or seven. Thanks again, Eric. Bobby, no, we got eight. Bob doesn't get I one. I think you got seven. <laughs> I'm so mean. <laughs> no no donuts for Bob. Seven. Can you make it? <laughs> oh, we got it. Okay. Zippo 687, cross 25 right at you at ground point 75. Right Sorry, Rita, I'm getting this one. Here you go. <laughs> Who's getting the chocolatey one? <laughs> oh, the chocolatey one looks good, though. Hey, Sarah, guess where this plane is coming from? Boston. Boston. Boston in the house. This is JetBlue Airways 687. It's an A321 coming from Boston. I'll tone it down a bit. <laughs> Steve? Ask Steve if he wants a donut. Steve. Other Steve. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Do you want you want the donut? <laughs> um. Thank you. Those are really good. What is that? Just a regular glazed? Wow. They are the best Power donuts. American. What's that one? Like a, like a cinnamon roll donut. Ooh. It's really good. Tower, wind 240, right on, left, I inhaled mine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what donut? <laughs> yeah, there is no longer a donut. Thank you, Eric. <laughs> Sarah, the real deal there in Boston with a $20 super chat. Thank you so much, Sarah. Hey there, first. I thought you left to go get that ATC jerk. <laughs> Second, I met Eric in Boston too. Oh, that's right. Also, you have been giving incorrect information out there, Mr. Kevin. Allison and I offered to take you out for Chata. What have I said? I didn't say anything. What did I say? I said I'm waiting to get my shot. She offered. Did you turn it down? Wait, when did you offer to get me chata? Uh oh. <laughs> when when was the offer for chata? I just remember, I said go get go to the airport. I'll I'll get airport chata, and you gave me the look, like you thought I was from Mars. See, here's the comment I was referring to earlier. This poor ATC controller is responsible for thousands of lives. I don't understand all the negative comments. I'm shaking my head. That's what I'm talking about. Like negative comments of in the chat? Towards him, yeah. Well, but that's what I mean. Like, yeah, we understand. Yeah, he's doing his job. I, yeah, and that's not what I'm saying. I, I'm just saying human nature no matter what job quality you have, I could be on here yelling at all the, the people in the chat. Hey, you! You're going to instantly want to run away from that, right? You don't want to deal with that. 
But anyway, we've had this chat in the past with the ex yep. exact same ATC controller. I've been told he's very good at what he does. I'm not denying that. But we could all... Well, Rudy was busy talking to Eric at the time, but I was watching the chat with you guys, and we I think we all agree that it was getting a little tense. It was getting a little tense. That's all. Moving on. Alaska 1083, RNAV Docker, wind 2408, runway 25, right there for takeoff. Next takeoff is Alaska Airlines flight 1083, heading to Seattle, 737, max 9. Right, 777 making that U turn, now heading here to the south side. Bay Hotel 7, hold short 25, right, Juliet, American 299. That's another Delta A350 flight 395. Is that another Atlanta flight? Lots of 621 are now Docker, wind 2408, runway 25 right, flipper takeoff. Flipper takeoff, runway 25 right, Delta Lots of 621. Triple 524, one able, runway 25 right, line up the way. 25 right, line up the way. Alaska 1083, contact departure. This is Alaska Airlines 1083 taking off to Seattle on a MAX 9. Network with some popcorn. <laughs> Thank you for the super chat. That was, was that popcorn? It's popcorn. <laughs> popcorn for the drama. <laughs> so that Michael Jackson. Yes. <laughs> Well, Turkish with the special livery on this 777-300ER making that left-hand turn onto Bravo. Also, that Delta A350 also heading here for a south side takeoff. Don M. Member for 16 months is gold members to say, guys, great show. Hello from Sandusky. Rudy got the calendar from my aviator Airbnb. Why is it smaller this year? Kevin loved the coverage of United. Oh, um, you must have picked a smaller version. Well, we went, there was a larger and smaller version this year because it went to a different manufacturer than last year. That is the reason. Yeah, but if you went with a bigger version of the two, it's pretty good size. I think next year we we'll just do large only. <laughs> this is JetBlue 524 taking off to JFK on an A321. Next year just one size. <laughs> one size fits all. Right the big Q, the A351000 coming up in Doha. Next arrival on the north side at 24 right. Flight time from Doha is 15 hours and 35 minutes. Alaska 1025, wind 2408, RNAV Docker, runway 25 right, quick takeoff. RNAV Docker, quick takeoff, 25 right, Alaska. That's 4916 LA Tower, we made two by right and on the right. That's right, Lindley. That was 
Allison, I'm going to regret my words for the $5 super chat. Thank you so much, Allison. You said, no, I need to work. That was the first day. Yep. I said, no, I need to work. The first day. I could, I could see you saying that. that. <laughs> the first day of live streaming? Sarah? <laughs> Sarah, honey, don't you worry. When we go back to Boston, I will see to it. Oh, no, yeah. I will no. see to it that we take Kevin for chowder. Yes. Proper and, and the chowder. lobster roll. And lobster roll. Not from the airport. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, but here's the thing I don't understand, you guys. What's the name of that? The seafood restaurant? Legal. Legal. Yeah. Was, it, it was inside the airport. That's like, why that's was like it? you going to McDonald's in an airport. It's not the same. Oh, so legal is not like the, the well-known seafood. No, it is. Awesome. It, it is. is. So why couldn't like, I have the same product inside the airport? It's different quality in an airport. I mean, even if, like here we have Shake Shack in the airport. I, I would departure. rather go to Shake Shack outside of the airport. Are you saying it's like a McDonald's in a gas station? Yeah, exactly. It's the same thing. It's, it all comes out of the same box. Different, different quality. <laughs> all right. Colin 01. Remember for eight months, this is something remember since I have been reading. Where is the flight ticker left. from? Turn left on uh, that was designed by moi. I designed it and someone put it together. So it is designed exclusively for us. No one else has it. Though, someone else has duplicated it, but it's not as good as ours. But that is a flight tracker you're only going to see right here on Airline Videos Live. Sorry. Yeah, we don't hand it out. <laughs> Aviation Mike, one of our great mods, gifting five airline videos live memberships. Thank you so much, Mike. That radio is uh, two by two at best. I think it's their radio. All right. Bob's back. Bob, drop it. Aviation Mike, one of our great mods, gifting five airline videos live memberships. Thank you so much, Mike. Right, we got the Turkish 777 up at next. SWAT Cats back with the awesome $20 super chat. Thanks so much, SWAT Cats. ATC controllers have multiple ways to communicate to pilots besides voice. Transponders or digital communications are some ways I deal with those types of systems as an avionics technician. Well, now, if we go back to that, he was saying that he was contacting Ita to cross over, and he said, I've tried to contact you three times, and you're not hearing me, and we didn't hear anything. So I don't know, maybe he meant he sent them a message another way? I mean, we've listened to a variety of air traffic controllers here. And there's definitely different, I don't want to say personalities, but yeah, because they're not supposed to have a personality on the airwaves. For the most part, everyone's pretty level-headed at LAX. Turkish is now rolling. That is the Emirates A380 Super coming up from Dubai on the downwind leg. We'll be arriving on the north side in just six minutes from now. Delta 395, Arnav Docker, wind 240, 
Turkish 12 Echo Heavy, contact departure. Contact departure, to the Echo Heavy, have an assistant. You as well. America 382, I tear up the lanes, runway 25 right, line up away, caution, my turbulence. 25 right, line up away, American 382. JB LAX videos with the Flying Delta Super Chat. Thank you so much, JB. Great show today, Cav. Flying Delta to JFK in April. It's a 767-300, staying at the TWA Hotel. And can't wait. Excellent. Did you use our discount code? AVLTWA. Boy, look at that. It's going to be back to back. A380 arrivals on the north side. Green Air Flight 11. Oh, yeah. All right, back down here, we got that Delta A350. Delta 395, Indy, contact departure. Delta 395, Indy, LA Tower, contact, so cut departure. Delta 395, push and head departure. Delta 355, to Radio Hotel. This is Delta Airlines 3, 95, taking off to Atlanta on an E350-900. Speedbird in the One World delivery, the 777-200ER. Finally, now making her way over to the gates of Tom Bradley. Also, the big Q, the A350-1000, also making her way over to Tom Bradley as well. Get out of here, Bob. Bob, you leave it again. All right. Thanks See, for the Pop-Tarts. He, he notice he leaves when we're getting close to doing the, the giveaways. <laughs> well, what's that? No, 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 do it. Bo go bomb around, Bob. Bob. Docker, when two fours, nine, <laughs> two five, right, take off. All right, nice. Right. Right. Leave it again. Bobbing around, Bob. Bob, 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 Bob. Bob. Eleven forty-four. When two fours, nine, nine, right, two five, Careful. left, to the land. <laughs> Jeez. Ooh, okay. Hashtag pop tart. So we got the China Eastern 777 to 300 ER heading back to Shanghai, making that left hand turn onto Kilo. Back to back A380 arrivals happening soon on the north side. Coleman Hirsch with a super chat, and the Oscar goes to Kevin Ray and Rudy. Greetings from Germany. Well, thank you so much. Get an Oscar? Get an Oscar. I should have brought my Oscar from last year. Yeah. I totally forgot it was Oscar Sunday. <laughs> you know, I used to have to cover the red carpets every Oscars. What a long day. That would be like a 16-hour day. Most of it just sitting oh, around doing nothing. Good old days. <laughs> well, you know, eh, good old days. I'll take these days over those days any day. So, yeah. Dave H. Dave, back with the Super Chat. Thanks so much, Dave. Uh-oh, did I miss some ATC drama? Yeah, you can go back. I don't know what time that was. It was when Ita was about to cross over 2-5 right. Josh Aldridge, member for 23 months, is a Diamond member. Thank you so much, Josh. Josh is watching your breaking news streams over the past week, especially with your background as a video journalist, is why AVL is next level stream. Not only do you entertain and educate, but you inform as well. Great job. Thank you so much, Josh. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You know, all those years of being a TV news photojournalist has come in handy. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, what's going on over here? <laughs> Cafe Rita over here. <laughs> it was really, you know, focused on what you were saying, and then all of a sudden I just see heavy cream being poured out. <laughs> it's a shot for 
Victoria, both A380 Supers. There is the Korean Air A380 Super turning base. Coast 4091, LA 7, 25, right line of belief. 5 pound way, we're on 25, right, Coast 4091. Let's go to the. Remember, it's A380 Super. Coast 4091, traffic again, crossing down, 5 right line of belief. 25, right, love and we'll copy your traffic, Coast 4091. Flight time from Dubai on this A380 is 15 hours and 48 minutes. Scott 3704, LA Tower, wind 2409, runway 25, left clear land. Speedbird heading to the southeast gates of Tom Bradley. Got that Korean Air Flight 11 up next for a north side arrival on 2 4 right. Six hour mark. We get a commercial. Yeah. Estimated departure. Back to Dubai, 5.03 p.m. Oh, that's 5.03. Oh, that's right. Everything gets pushed now. So wait, so little of tons of king. Is that partner almost six? Move Tonsa? Normally. Oh. Um, let's see. Now, with the time change. Well, scheduled. Ooh. <laughs> Scheduled 6.30 p.m. <laughs> wow. <laughs> now estimated 11 p.m. Wow. Hmm. <laughs> well, that makes a very long day. 6.30 p.m. Oh, it's early 762. Legion 762, LA Tower, wind 2508, runway 25 left, clear to land. Well, that's what Tuesday's for, right? <laughs> well, I was just sitting here thinking I, I was going to start early like we did today, but I might just start around 11. Yeah, I would, especially if you want to capture that. Yeah, because, yeah, that'd be a really long day. Now this A380 will not be taking off until Scott after midnight. Board, turn right Hotel 7, cross 25, right attack to Julia, contact on point seven five. All right, uh, off at uh, Hotel 7, cross 25, right at Juliet, ground one eight, cross 25. Star Malta A330-300 and an old Shana Southern now cargo plane. I mean, from Mexico City, now just four minutes out, south side arrival.
Roger, tower. Good afternoon, Master. 68 and heavy. This is Japan Airlines flight 69 heading back to Osaka, the 787-9 Dreamliner. Also have Japan Airlines flight 15 heading back to Tokyo Haneda and a 787-9 Dreamliner. Still sitting at the gates on the southeast side of Tom Bradley, who should be pushing back here shortly. They plan Simon and Liz members for 15 months as gold members. This is Kevin. You never get the same quality at the airport. Double the price, half the quality. <laughs> oh, we're back to the chatter, chatter talk. Yeah, that's a good point. I guess that's what I was trying to convey. All right. Guess you're right. It's Max, 222. The $2 Super Chat says, I'm in JetBlue 100, heading to Fort Lauderdale soon. I think we see you. Just made that left-hand turn. In fact, oh, I thought that was you. Change to Tabby 670, wind 240 at enter, runway 25 right, quick for takeoff. Actually, right there. Ah, I see your tail. <laughs> Allegiant 762, join hotel to uh, Lima and hold short of runway 25 right. Hotel Lima, show 25 right. Flight to Osaka, now starting taxi. Could head to the north side. You got 20 minutes before your wheels off today. Tell you, I disregard. Uh, I'm actually going to get to two five right. So here at Foxtrot, traffic four mile final, cross two five left, cross two five right, turn one up. Johnny Eastern, the triple seven okay, three hundred ER, heading back to Shanghai, now rolling down two five right. Now at eighty one ninety seven right there. This is China Eastern Airlines 586 taking off to Shanghai on a 777-300ER, Sai Chien. Heavy cross to the ground so that Dreamliner made a U-turn, heading now to 25 right, the flight heading back to Osaka. I saw had the flight heading back to Haneda now pushing back. Ham Talk 71 with the $5 Super Chat. Thank you so much, Ham Talk. It would be epic if that special UAFA pronounced UAFA. Turkish Livery played the Champions League anthem on takeoff. <laughs> you mean inside the cabin? Yeah. yeah. That definitely had to be inside the cabin. That'd be cool. November 800, Julia. that? Converted China Southern A330. About to touch down on 25 left. Net at 8197, runway 25 right line of the lane. Galister Malta 6810 is coming in from Mexico City. Felipe Angeles International Airport. Monster 6810 heavy, turn left onto Alpha. So I'm confused. Is that Mosser? Or are they flying for Mosser? I would assume they're flying for Mosser. Well, their call sign is Malta. Eastbound on 1215, Mosser 
Monster, don't stop. Thank you. Don't stop. Is that? That is a 40 LA tower, wind 240 down at runway 25 left. It's not Steve Ballmer's plane, is it? At 8187 RNAP Docker, runway 25 right click to take off, wind 240 down at runway 25 right click to take off, wind 240 down at runway 25 right click to take off, wind 240 down at runway 25 right See you over here in about two and a half hours. <laughs> Richard with a ten dollars super chat. Thank you so much, Richard. In the U.S., in the U.S., voice is the only way for ATC communications. Pilots and controllers, two type A plus personalities. That sense at all. Yeah. Well. Yes and no. I mean, for the most part, we've heard a lot of the ATC controllers here, and I think they're all pretty much level-headed. And we really don't hear too much crazy talk. In, in fact, we probably hear more joking around more than anything else. Come on down. <laughs> And when I mean choking around, I mean having a good time, enjoying. The Emirates 8380 Super heading into the south west side of Tom Bradley. Got another A380 Super. You know, I look at scenes like this, Rudy. You're looking at almost a thousand people heading into Tom Bradley, having to go through customs. We were talking about this the other night. We were high atop the H Hotel. Met a couple of guys that were coming back from Dubai, and they were talking about global entry. And it's scenes like this that you really want the global entry because you're going to be in line with a lot of people. Yeah, and just think, you were if you were on that Emirates A380, you were on that plane for almost 16 hours, and then you still have to wait in line. Yeah. Just <sighs> 44, thank you for that. Yeah, I remember when I got back from Munich, I mean, that was only, what, 11 hours? Then to get stuck in that line, I was like, oh, I just want to go home. <laughs> so yes, get the global entry. Jet speed 444, RNAV Docker, wind 240, another runway 25 with a Fox truck, let's take off. RNAV Docker, 253. Japan 6 down heavy, runway 25 right on a blade rolling. Two five five. Nine up and away. Nine up and away. Good morning. Good afternoon. Twenty two eighty four. Contact departure. Twenty two eighty four. 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 Twenty two eighty four.
Uh, you the also have seven. International Gates at Terminal 7. Do I dare say 4? Do they have in 4 they do? 4, 3, 2. Does 2 still two still have at least well you remember two is the old international terminal before tom bradley was built i don't, I don't know if they so they used to because they had coach share air lingus and virgin used to park there at terminal two this is Japan Airlines Flight 69 taking off to Osaka, the 787-9 Dreamliner. So, 0 and 9, the two new terminals are going to be built here at LAX in the next couple of years. Those also will have international gates. In fact, Terminal 9 will be, is what they say, is going to be All-Star Alliance. And when... Yeah, we just have a bunch of, I guess there's a couple of paramedics that are uh, helping uh, up, uh, somebody in the aisle, and there, uh, there, we got a bunch of people standing up. I understand, I just want to make sure we can get paramedics to the gate and give them some information. As of now, I don't think we need paramedics at the gate, but uh, thank you. Which flight is that? I missed it. I just heard paramedics. People are standing up in the cabin. Maybe it's the United flight. 511 RNAP Docker, wind 2408, stand by. Jumper 523, hold short over my 25 rain. Hold short 25 right, Jumper 523. 511, runway 25 right, clip for takeoff, wind 2408. Air Nav, Jumper 523, hold short over my 25 right, Jumper 523. And United 440, we're, we're just going to let them know because we it's have United to let them know as soon as possible. This one right here. Yeah. We need to make sure that somebody's there for you. Absolutely, no problem. Uh, you can uh, let them know. Yeah, it, uh, or we'll get this more information if we get it. Chipper 100, runway 25 right, line up away. 25 right, line up away, Chipper 100. It's a flight coming in from Denver. It's a 737-800. Apparently, medical issue inside the cabin. Lots of people up out of their seat. Free and air, the A380 and making those final turns, heading into a somewhat empty, except for the A380s, Tom Bradley. Mr. Dillman, with a fine dollar super jet, thanks much, Mr. Tom, and can't wait for the Hawaiian 787-9 to do flights here. Also, Lone Star 1 just changed from 931 to 88660. Is that a 737-800 or a MAX? This is JetBlue Airways Flight 100 taking off to Fort Lauderdale on an A321. Have a great flight. So it sounds like people are starting to sit down inside the cabin of this United. This is United 440 coming in from Denver. Finish give me some information. I'll be able to forward some of that stuff. All right, we're moving crew members around so we can get passengers and seats. Uh, should be, be a few minutes here. And uh, yeah, some passengers threw up everywhere and fouled the whole app cabin. Okay. Ooh. That's not pleasant. Not a pleasant thought. <sighs> Ian. With a super chat, says, great stream. Wish you had a channel in Florida. Thank you, Ian. Chris, with the $10 super chat. Thanks so much, Chris. Thanks for a great Sunday fun day. Kevin and Rudy, hope you guys have a great week. Well, thank you so much, Chris. 
appreciate your support. <laughs> Rita just heard it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 523, cross 258, ground point 75. Cross 25, right, ground point 75, we got blue, cross point 15. 10, 15, heavy, runway 25, right, line up away. Yeah, I'd be getting out of my seat too if that. Yeah, the 498 can take departure. That's United 498 taking off to Denver on a Max 9. But, you know, what do you do if someone next to you just. Well, I mean, it's got to be bad because, you know, there are bags. Doesn't sound like they used it though. No. <laughs> Hopefully they didn't use someone else. Japan 15 Navy on that Docker, wind 2308, runway 25 right, clear for takeoff. Flight, yeah. If you guys haven't yet, make sure to hit that like button. We're approaching 4,000 likes here today. Air China, the 777-300ER. Starting taxi, we'll continue down Kilo, make that left-hand turn onto Bravo. Now, if I could say anything about that situation, if you're not feeling well on a flight, I would say let your flight attendants know because then they can help, whether it's giving you something, giving you something or preparing you with extra bags or if they're able to relocate you somewhere, I don't know. But always communicate that to your flight attendants. All right, the J Japan Airlines Dreamliner. This flight heading to Haneda, now rolling down to five right. I mean, that plane is still sitting there, though. This is Japan Airlines Flight 15 taking off to Tokyo Haneda on the 787-9 Dreamliner. Right there, China, the 777-300ER heading back to Beijing. Look at that left-hand turn. Lufthansa Queen, now just seven minutes out. Number two for arrival on the north side. I mean, I don't know. I mean, what do you think, Rudy? I mean, that plane's just still sitting there. For they could be treating the passenger. Maybe they're. I don't know. Yeah. But I'm sure you'd want to get it moving, right? Get everybody off. I would Go assume to the gate. so. I'm sure everyone needs to get off that plane. Open a door to Ugh. get some fresh air. Well, hopefully, no one opens up the door. Yeah. Trevor with the Super Chat. Thank you so much, Trevor. Sad to hear Air China won't be flying their 747-8 Intercontinental to LAX this summer. Really? I heard about that. I think JFK is the only place. Well, we got to go back to JFK. Oh, darn. Thank you, Mods, for <laughs> taking care of the chat. Yeah, TMI. Star 1 and good afternoon. Lux 641 with you, taxi, Ombro. Lux 641, I tell I just continued full length. TD Fuel Link, Lux 641. LA United 440 
Center 440, thank you. Cross 25 right, you're right on Bravo, and you're going to, uh, still going to 73, correct? Yep, we're going to 73. Cross uh, 25 right on Juliet, and then where? To right on Bravo, and then taxi the ramp, Charlie 7. Bravo, Charlie 7 to the ramp, uh, over to ground? That's right. No, you, you can monitor ground if you want to, but they know you're coming. All right, sounds good, thanks. Go to 299, cross 25, right to Juliet, contact ground point 75. All right, on the cross move, 25, right to Juliet, over ground point 75, go to 299, good day. City out, 86. Go ahead, city out, 86. Are you done? The negative, I was picking up some pod. I'll continue with you. Okay. Just three minutes out from a north side arrival. Tower Skyway 5384, short funnel to the visual to the left. Skyway 5384, 12308, and 25 left. 25 left, 35 left, 5384. Two A380 supers sitting there at the gate. Uh, Good to see one of those taking off from the south side later today. But we're not done. Oh no, we're not done with the A380 arrival. Oh no. Asian Airlines like 204 coming up from Seoul. The A380 Super now just 25 minutes away. Arrival here at LAX. Shane, a member for 30 months. This gold member says Kevin, Rudy, and I guess Bob. Thanks for another great Sunday. <laughs> we'll let Bob know when he comes back. Yeah, forget Bob. Back. You know what? I don't want your Pop Tarts anymore. Oh! Anybody want Pop Tarts? Oh. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> you know what, in fact, throw them on the ground and just... Bet, bet, <laughs> you want some Pop-Tarts, bet? No, don't feed the birds. <laughs> and we have the Lufthansa Queen on final approach for 2-4 right. I was 5384, hold short, runway 25 right at Juliet. KLM, the Dreamliner, heading back to Amsterdam, it's like 602. suspect that to come here to the south side. Flight time from Frankfurt, 10 hours and 53 minutes. Number Still have that Air China 777-300ER number two for takeoff here on the south side. Air China 988 heavy, wing 408, RNM to Docker, runway 25 right, good takeoff. RNM with Docker, runway 25 right, good takeoff.
And Air China on the roll on 25 right. Left one, crossing on 25 right at Fox Cross, and right on Bravo, going. Sorry, sir, again, first one. Left one, cross and wait 25 right, turn right on Bravo, taxi to the full length. Okay, so it's 25 right, turn uh, right on Bravo, full length, turn on one. I was looking through the port, see you at cross and wait 25 right, that point 75. Cross, uh, try to get rid of the gas, go in 3 4. Last of 31, see you at cross and wait 25 right, that point 75. This is Air China Flight 988 taking off to Beijing on a 777-300ER side chain. I forgot to ask you, Rudy, what did you think of running the camera? Is that your first time running? Uh, I was kind of nervous <laughs> because I'm not used to shooting with that camera. Yeah. And, uh, you know, want to keep things up to par with you, but I can't. <laughs> so. One point only, runway 25 right. Caleb, the Dreamliner heading here for a south side takeoff, flight 602, heading back to Amsterdam. Nine, Thank you, Allison. What's that? Allison says I did great. I'm sure you did. I, I, just, I was just wondering how you two, felt five, right with on the, the, the setup. It's nice. I will say that. It's a nice setup. Right Does this five, lens five, feel like five, the old, the what lens you use, or no? It's actually smoother. A smoother. Yeah. I didn't feel like I had to like work too hard. Oh. You know. Gosh, have you, have you ever used the 200 to 600? Um, I think <laughs> once. That, I mean, you go from that, from this to that one. Oh, that is like, like the Cadillac of lenses. It's <laughs> it's almost too perfect. It's yeah. like, oof. Yeah. The other thing I noticed is you're standing on somewhat unlevel ground. Yes. So that threw me off a little bit. <laughs> Is that like, why? I'm that's like, probably why my right leg has been hurting after the Sunday show. Uh, yeah, it's <laughs> kind of unlevel there. Oh, great! We need a platform. Yeah. <laughs> Add to the list of equipment. Bob, add it to the list. Oh, that's right. He's left. Well, I guess it's not happening. That Gulfstream 650 ER taking off to Zurich. Carol Workman, a member for 21 months, is a platinum member. This is when I was upgraded my membership earlier. I accidentally downgraded myself first. Whoops. I got straightened out. There you go. Thank you, Carol. Nice. Thank you. This is Spirit Airlines 816 taking off to Kansas City on an A320. Coming up to the top of the hour once again.
Tower Sky West, 4628, visual 251. Guy was 46, Alex, remember for 18 months, this is so remember, says, isn't, it isn't Sunday without AVL. No, no, no. But you're going to have a nice Easter Sunday without us coming up in a couple weeks. <laughs> Wendy B, a member for nine months, is a golden member. Thank you so much, Wendy. And that officially takes us to the top of the hour. And officially 3 p.m. here in beautiful Los Angeles, California. You are watching continuous live coverage of LAX plane spotting right here in your home for LAX live streams. That is Airline of Videos Live. Today is a big Sunday show here on March 10th. 2024. We are the plane jockeys here at Imperial Hill, taking it all, taking it all in. This beautiful day, the awesome South Side departures and arrivals and all that jazz. We got a lot more to go, so don't go anywhere. Isn't that right, Rudy? Including a second live drawing yes. giveaway coming up this hour. Oh, that's right, this oh, hour. Oh yeah, boy, oh, boy. All right, the Lufthansa Queen heading over here to the South Side. Running a little late here today. You know what, Rudy? This might time out. We might have the king and the queen taken off around the same time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you don't sound too <laughs> thrilled by that. I'm, I'm just bummed that we're not going to see the Lufthansa king today. I know. Yeah. Well, I mean, are we ever going to see it on a Sunday show? <laughs> I mean... That makes it a pretty long day for it, me, and I, I know for you, of course. Yeah, because I get out here at 6, so that's 12 hours. Yeah, yeah. just standing here. I think we should set a healthy boundary and say we won't be seeing that takeoff on a Sunday show. Yeah. Out of protection for Kevin, <laughs> doing overtime. Like you said, we're in it for a, this is a marathon, right? We're in it for the long haul. I'd like to come out here and I'd like to grab some 4K yeah. of it taken off here on the south oh, side. Of course. Yeah, we're in it for the long haul. <laughs> the all Dreamliner now pushing back. Have right, a south side takeoff happening soon. KLM is our next takeoff. Porter also taking off here on the south side. And the Lufthansa Queen making that turn on to Kilo. Wendy B, gifting one airline to videos live and membership. Thank you so much, Wendy. And Mike, about for 10 months. So remember, this is love from La Crosse, Wisconsin. What a beautiful day. Hello, Mike. To the last left, American, 1997. Queen making those final turns, heading into the southwest corner of Tom Bradley. The KLM Dreamliner now rolling down to five right. That was 46 meters to the end. Julia, across 
1957 heavy hold short on the 25 ride at Juliet. Two kings and a queen. United Airlines, the 311 heading back to Newark at a 777-300ER, starting taxi heading to 25 right. Philip, member for nine months, this is self a member, this is a great show as always, this is the best show online. Well, thank you so much, Philip. Appreciate those awesome, kind of words. United Airlines flight 1957 committed from Chicago O'Hare. It's a triple seven at 200. Asiana flight 204, the A380 Super announces 11 minutes out. Thirty-nine minutes away. Nice. Lee becoming a silver member. Thank you so much, Lee. And a friend, Quality Mobile Video with a five dollar super chat says Honolulu, Honolulu, Honolulu. Two five right line, no wait, United three eleven heavy. Honolulu. <laughs> what if I told you Quality Mobile Video we're going to give you St. Martin instead of Honolulu? Ooh. I like that. Yes. Sign me up. <laughs> Let's go. We should be seeing the All Dreamliner head to the 43 south for a takeoff to Tel Aviv, flight six. Hold short, runway 25 right at Juliet. Hold short, 25 right at Juliet, American This is Air Mexico 645 taking off to Mexico City on a Max 8. Adios. Oh, quality both video says both are great. All right. This is LL Flight 6. We'll be taking off to Tel Aviv on the 787-9 Dreamliner. Got that 777 at 300ER with United heading back to Newark, rolling down 25 right. Right, 
Really, did you see that I was on the news the other day? Yeah. <laughs> I did see that. Fox 11 interviewed me about the United 777, since I was out here live streaming the, the diverted flight here. Yeah. An old co-worker, Sam Dubin and Susan Hirasuna, were the team that came out to do the story. Worked with them for, well, Sam's kind of younger than me. Uh, he'd been there maybe the last couple of years I was there. Susan and I go way back, even to the mid-2000s there at Fox. Anyway, so Susan interviewed me, and I didn't know Sam took a photo behind the scenes. He put it on social <laughs> media. And Sam's kind of funny. He's very quirky. He The caption of the photo was... This man, and he's talking about me, is the smartest man in TV news because he figured out a way to get out of TV news. <laughs> but still kind of be in it. <laughs> well, I guess, yeah. It's so funny. I can't escape it. I'm still supplying video to the, the stations constantly. Yeah. I'm being interviewed constantly. And you thought you were done. I thought I was done. That's it. But I thought his caption was funny. <laughs> this guy is the smartest person in TV news. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> he also said they're hiring if I want to come back. Well, <laughs> I laughed. Lisa letting us know, unfortunately, her mom passed away. Who? Lisa Habaneth. I'm sorry, Lisa. Sorry to hear about that. Our condolences. But Lisa says that we're keeping her spirits up today with this footage, this live footage of LAX. This is American Airlines 1659 taking off to Dallas Fort Worth on an A321 Neo. Number nine Delta Sierra, expect runway 25 left for departure. Front row seat of the Lufthansa Canada, Queen. 787, taxi hotel Juliet, cross from lane 25 right, contact ground point 75. Okay, Hotel Juliet. And cross if you guys haven't yet, make sure to hit that like button, feed the beast. We're almost at 4,000 likes. Subscribe if you're new and make sure your notifications are all set. We'll be back here on Tuesday for the Tuesday Super Tuesday show. Back here at Imperial Hill. Rudy and I have been talking about it. I was going to start a little bit earlier, but I'm thinking probably 11 a.m. so I can get the Lufthansa King departure. And Delta Sierra traffic seven mile final, runway two five left, one of the way. My boy, two five left, find Delta. Asiana Flight 204 just over downtown Los Angeles, two minutes away from arrival on the north side. Up first on the Pond Airways Flight 126 coming from Tokyo Haneda and a 787 to 8 Dreamliner. Also have EVA Air, EVA Air Flight 12 coming from Taipei at 777-300ER, 11 minutes out. Also north side arrival. The Cathay Pacific Cargo, 747-8. Now just 33 minutes away. How are you holding up there, Rudy? How's, how's Cafe Rita's coffee? I need more. Oh, you need more coffee? <laughs> 
Do you need to order something? Maybe. I'm struggling, I'll be honest with you. <laughs> You're struggling? Yeah. Neil asking, when are you going to St. Martin? Okay, so June 14th is the 24-hour live stream. That's a Friday. We go into the 15th, which is Saturday. There is no Sunday show. At least that's what we had said right. back then. So no Sunday show on the 16th. Right. So we have those last two weeks of June as possibilities for either Anchorage, Boston. So we went up to Anchorage at the end of June last year, and it was cold. And I remember the week later, it was nice and sunny and better weather. So I think we, 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 we get as close to July as we can for Anchorage, don't you think? Yes, I would say July for Anchorage. Steve Ballmer's plane. Okay, so Anchorage in July. Okay. Where does that put Boston? Where does that put Chicago? It's <laughs> a lot. My last day of school is June 7th. Well, Boston's kind of a two for one. We've got Boston yes. and St. Martin together. So yes. that's, that's two right there. We'll figure it out. I'm almost thinking that last week of June. How's the weather in Boston at the end of June, Sarah? <laughs> Is the shot Nice and fresh that time of the year. Do we do Fourth of July in Boston? <laughs> no, I know you want to be no, here. No, you know, well, here, that's another question I have for you, Rudy, because every year you take off the Fourth of July week and go hang out with your family. Are you going to do that again this year? I don't know. What is coming towards us? Eva error. I don't know what it's doing. It's making a turn. Huh. Number six three seven Alpha Sierra LA Tower. Taxi up to you and hold short one way from five left. Seven Alpha Sierra is going to be runway five right at the full length for Wake for Dillon. Hello, it's heavy. Alpha Richter. This is LL Flight 6 taking off to Tel Aviv, Israel on a 787-9 Dreamliner. Shalom. Eva Air, 777-300ER making that crossover heading to 25 left. Not a cargo, Flight 12 coming in from Taipei. Number 7 Alpha Sierra at Foxtrot, cross runway 25 left, cross runway 25 right, and right on Bravo to the floor. All right. Next A380, arrival on the north side, flight 204, coming in from Seoul. We're going to get back to the elephant in the room. Rudy said he's struggling today. Yeah. So is Steve. 
<laughs> yeah? I he's sitting over there. Sit I, I spoke with him earlier when I, I ran over, over to to that side to go uh, get some footage. And he just sounded really grouchy. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> Someone had asked, what about doing Chicago? <laughs> Chicago, Boston, and St. Martin all in one trip. No. But that's, I, I, Rudy knows I don't like to mix too many trips together because yeah, I don't like living out of a suitcase for very long. I gotta, I gotta refocus. I gotta regroup after. I also have to figure out who's gonna watch my cats. That's another thing. Oh, so, oh, well, the question. So, are you not doing July Fourth with your family this year? I mean, I kind of do my own thing normally. Last year we went to Washington. It just kind of happened that way. And the year before that you went to Boston. Yeah, I don't think so. We were trying to figure something out for my birthday. I, I need to book a Delta flight at some point. So, <laughs> you know, I, I got some gift cards from some people. <laughs> yes. My dad gave me a gift card. And of course, you got the gift card from, is it Patrick? Craig. Craig Russell. Craig yeah. Russell, right. And so I got to use that. This is Spirit Airlines 591 taking off to Houston Intercontinental on an A319. Chris, become a nice silver member. Thank you so much, Chris. Circle for a landing. A member for 13 months is gold members. This is another beautiful day for LAX plane spotting. Thanks for the views and the commentary. Our pleasure. Thank you, Circle for a landing. Chris, now upgrading membership to gold. Thank you for that upgrade, Chris. Sarah, the real deal, back with the $2 Super Chat, says it will be in the 80s in Boston that time. Is that oh, yeah. good or bad? Hot and humid, that's I'll right. right. Yep. <sighs> Definitely don't want to do Boston in July. That's just me, though. So, <laughs> either... Wait, when do you go back to school? First week of August. First week of August. Yeah. So basically, all of July is good, fair game, except I don't know what I'm doing for my birthday. That week is up in the air. <laughs> what, what? Okay, so we've got New York already in the books. That's two weeks away, just over two weeks away. Let's decide right now what our next stop is. Sounds to me like it's going to be the Boston St. Martin in June. 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 How about June? Sarah? Week after 24 hour or two <laughs> weeks after? Um, I, that week after might be a little much. Yeah. I would How, say the final week of June. How is the final week of June? Uh, Sarah, the real deal. Do we have a date? Sarah, do we have a date? <laughs> How's that? How's that? <laughs> Otherwise. Nick? Any other Bostonians? Who's ready for a wicked good time? <laughs> this is how we do our planning on, on the show. Next take off here on the south side, Delta Airlines flight 715 heading to Atlanta to 757-200. If you want to, you want to grab the chairs? No, I'm good. Do you want a chair? No. I'm good. But I'm just, I'm I just, sit down. I'm now realizing why my right leg I'm telling you. bothers me after the Sunday show. It's because I'm standing on a lopsided hill. It is so clear right now. You can see the, all these flights over us. So cool. Jerry was looking up industrial quality, uh, you know, like they use in the kitchens at restaurants for the chefs, uh -huh. the cushions yeah. to stand on. Yeah. 
This is Delta 715 taking off to Atlanta on a 757-200. Won't see any more 757-300s with Delta. Why? The 300s. We don't see them? I haven't seen them in a while. The kids will be out of school by then. Sarah, back with the two dollar super chat. Perfect, last week of June. Shut up. We'll be ready. <laughs> I thought that was an earthquake. Everything was vibrating. I think we need coffee. <laughs> Zero one two heavy, hold short, sunlight two five right at Lima. What? <laughs> <laughs> you have air flight twelve two landing on two five left. Very two, rare. Two Super zero, rare. One zero, runway two five left, Cordelia. Cordelia two five left, there's many Flight time is 10 hours and 30 minutes. Skywood 3775, contact the contact of Pelt Archer. Skywood 4680, runway 25 right at the point. I'm telling you, it's not level. I know it's not level. Just ask my right leg. It's like I put strain on my right leg. I was wondering what, what was going on. But instantly, when I started operating your camera, I'm like, what? It feels weird about... It's not level. It's not. No, I know. I can How much is it off? It's off oh, oh, you tested it. Yeah. Rita says it's off eight degrees. <laughs> Whatever that means. That's. <laughs> is that a lot? You're shooting on a hill, literally. <laughs> <laughs> is it eight degrees a lot? Wow. My poor leg. On a doctor, runway 25 right, to take off, Skywest, 4680. Yeah, we got to look into those mats, the cushions. I know Costco has them. I went to Home Depot right, looking for them a while ago, and I didn't see them there. I know Costco has them. They're not industrial quality, but I mean... I have one at home. Actually, I think one I have at home, I got on Amazon. Oh. But I mean, it's... It makes a difference when you're washing the dishes, you know, you're there for a while. <laughs> How about live streaming in one place uh, for almost 12 hours in one day? That's a good point. What? It won't work here because it's not level. Oh, yeah. What are we going to do about that? Well... Here's a thought. Why is it not level? Is it going to fall out again like it did? Well, you're also standing literally where the sidewalk meets the bricks. The boss is standing where the hole disappeared. There was a hole. I mean, the whole thing dis disappeared last year, if you guys remember. That's right. This is flight 204 coming up from the one zero one Mike X ray Asiana A380 Super. Number one zero one Mike X ray Lake Air number three one two three zero one zero runway two five left for land. 
For three, two to land, two, five left, one, zero, one, Mike X-ray. Boy, what a lineup this is going to be at Tom Bradley. A queen and three kings. Woo, nice. Here's Brent 858, uh, expedite down the runway, turn left to Delta 7, traffic mile and a half final. Off at Delta 7, 858. Air Sprint 858, make the left turn all the way onto Alpha, then taxi to parking this frequency, where do you park? Still stay with you, going to Atlantic for 858. Oh wait, hold on, hold on, hold on a second here. Where is that going? All right, then. We need to do that, not Rita. Okay. Runway 25 right, monitor way to the full left. Number 101, Mike X-ray, Lincoln. Go ahead. Mike X-ray, 40110, runway 25 left to the land. 25 left to the land. 101, Mike X-ray, and we're going to signature. Either 623, contact the top departure. Next takeoff here on the south side, heading to Philadelphia. American Airlines flight 513, it's an A321neo. Followed by Delta Airlines flight 844, heading to Austin, Texas on an A319. This A380 will be taking off back to Seoul tonight at 11.22 p.m. Russell, our friend Russell is in the chat, Rudy, trying to talk you out of St. Martin. <laughs> American 1459, LA car number two. Let me clarify, I want to go to St. Martin because it's been a bucket list item for me since before the pandemic. Yeah, we need to get him to St. Martin. That's it. I wasn't <laughs> suggesting it as a live stream location. We'll bring Ed, we'll bring Ed. Yeah. We'll bring all the equipment. We'll, we're gonna leave most of the equipment back in Boston. Yeah, no, I'm bringing my camera, getting some stills. But I wasn't really thinking of it as a live stream location. I mean, even if it's using Ed connected to a handheld camera at the beach. Yeah. I mean, we could do something like that. It doesn't have to be a full-fledged, you know, normal live stream. I don't think that's that wasn't our intentions. No, because I know viewers aren't going to stick around for very long if it, there's not a lot of traffic there in the first place. Right. But it's about the experience. I mean, yeah. you got everything going on. The beach, you got all that that uh, restaurant next to the beach. Yeah. I was trying to get there for my birthday. It was going to be a birthday trip. I was really close to doing it. And then just the whole trek down to St. Martin is its not an easy one. So you have to connect. There are no direct flights from LAX. And the layovers are super long. Everything is red eye. So even the flight out of Boston is red eye. No, I mean if you're going non-stop or not non-stop, but you know direct. One like X-ray from Delta Seven. You know what I mean? You have to connect, but making the trip Delta Seven back, Alpha, back to back on the West Coast. Yeah. Uh, signature with the frequency. One like X-ray. This is Delta Airlines 844 taking off to Austin, Texas on an A319.
Brian Henry with a fine dollar super chat. Thank you so much, Brian. What airline are you and Rudy looking forward to seeing at JFK that you don't get at LAX? I know Kuwait Airlines and Royal Air Maroc go there. Who else? I saw the Royal Jordanian, right? There was a lot that I saw, but it, to me, the one thing I really remember the most is just the constant British Airways, Virgin, Ita, Air Eddie had, I mean, Eddie had the, yeah. But it's just the constant flow of all the international carriers coming in. It's not just one or two flights a day. It's, it's like every two hours, there's another one coming in. Did you have blue E-190s? Eh. <laughs> I hope we see that blueprint. Livery. Oh, the blueprint. I like I that one. Yeah. That. Yeah. Blueprint. Well, you get really close to the gates there at JetBlue. Eddie had. I'm trying to think. There's cargo there that we don't get here. There's a few, yeah. Um, I just I love that taxiway. Yeah. To the gates. I think just being there close up to the planes and getting constant flow nonstop. Granted, being at the TWA Hotel, I'm just thrilled for that. The vibe is great because of the music. The music, constantly playing. Not in your room, but throughout the whole. It's just, it's a, it's, I think there are 400 songs on a constant loop. Wow. Did you ever hear the same song twice? No. And then when you're out on the patio deck, you can't really, as long as the, the mics are facing out toward the airport, you really can't hear the music, but you can still hear the music just standing there. And there's some good songs that come on, like, California, dreaming. No, I start singing. It, like, gets you in the mood. It's a good, it's a good vibe. I hope the, because they, the shelter, the outside patio, bar during the winter. I don't know at what point they take that down. I wonder if, uh, I don't know. I was going to say, the drawing, but we have that queen coming in. This is American Eagle 3206 taking off to Albuquerque on a CRJ 700ER. How far out is the queen? Number three for arrival here on the south side. And the Netherlands at Pixel standing right next to me with the $2 Super Chess is happy March 10th day to all the Marios in the chat. Oh, Mario. <laughs> Wait, I don't get it. Well, look, it looks like Mario. Looks like a Mario. Oh. Really? Yeah. Is that new or has that been around? It's been around? Wow. I don't know. That's Mario. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Robin Thompson with the $2 Super Jet says, if you do an Anchorage in July, bring gallons of bug spray. We were up there last June, and we had a yeah. lot of mosquitoes. We bought one of those. Um, <laughs> we bought everything. What do you call it? Candles. You light it up. It's like a little, <laughs> in, it's like an incense thing yeah. it's not instance though it's like uh yeah you light it up and then it does like a little smoky thing where repels bugs but i think the bugs were bad that day because it was raining and so the grass was yeah. wet they got a the bracelet out. remember the bracelet yeah, the bracelets yeah but i just remember the woman at the home depot <laughs> and she was trying to explain all the bug sprays that we should get she was also like this is nothing you really gotta watch out for the cuckoo moose Oh, yeah. And we were like, the Cuckoo Moose? Yes, the Cuckoo Moose. She said, didn't she say, it's like a moose that's having a bad day. <laughs> Doesn't really care who you are, what, what you are. It's just going to have it out for you. We never saw any Cuckoo Moose. We saw, we saw, we saw two, two. I think it was the same moose. Got driving back and forth between the airport and the hotel. Yeah. It was like feeding of course, off I, a bunch of trees. I kept trying to like film the moose. <laughs> it's like as soon as the camera went out, it's like, nope. 
no moose. Well, now you have a DJI Osmo 3 to try to. Yeah. Good luck. <laughs> Can use it right now. Cathay Pacific Cargo Flight 2080 coming up from Dallas, Fort Worth, Texas, 747 8 Intercontinental. Next arrival here on the south side. Ops 90 at Golf, crossing like 25 left, crossing 25 right. Crossing 25 left and 25 right at Golf, Ops 90. That was 32, 42, right? Ops 90, left on Bravo, ground point 75. Left on Bravo, over to ground, Ops 92. Uh, good afternoon, Allegiant 783, visual 2000. Allegiant 783, Allegiant, Allegiant 783, Allegiant 783, Allegiant 783, Allegiant 3240 Is that free shipping? Well, she said they're originally from Germany, but they live locally now. Oh. American yeah. 1459, your gates pushing at Lima, crossing Lake 25, right, ground point 75. This is Cathay Pacific Cargo, flight 2080, coming in from Dallas, Fort Worth on a 747-8 freighter. Will she go long? Big no. Making that left hand turn onto Alpha 8. So Anchorage has the moose. Does Boston have anything that you need to like watch out for? <laughs> What's the equivalent of a moose in Boston? <laughs> I know in Australia you have your kangaroos. You have your spiders, your snakes. Well, what do we have in California? Um, coyotes? <laughs> it's a dog. I mean... Bears, right? Yeah. Why don't you go pet a coyote? <laughs> yeah, the bears... I've never seen a bear here. Allison says rats. Rats. Yeah. Oh, rats. Sounds about right. <laughs> a rat's size of a big dog. Yeah, we have lots of squirrels here. She squirrels all the time at work, every yeah, day. The squirrel's not going to do anything no, to you. No, no. Not at all. I'm, I'm just thinking of something that could be harmful to watch out for. Have you ever seen a scorpion out here? No. You know, in all my years of living in Phoenix, too, I yeah, hardly Arizona. ever, ever saw a scorpion. Really? Yeah. I saw a couple growing up at my aunt's down in Nogales. They get scorpions. It's the small ones you got to be careful of, not the big ones. No, these are the small, clear ones. Oh, that, yeah, those, yeah. yeah. Those are dangerous? Yes. Really? <laughs> Rebel Squirrel with a $5 super jet. Thank you so much, Rebel. What airline would you say had the best in-flight food? Uh, so far, in my experience, hands down, JetBlue Mint. Yes. Rudy hasn't experienced it yet. He will. Liam with the $2 super jet. Thank you so much, Liam. Did I hear Boston? When you all be here at Boston? That's what we're trying to figure out. Last week of June, sometime. 
Paul, gifting five airline and videos live memberships. Thank you so much, Paul. Did Bob come back? No. No, he did not. All right. <laughs> Drop it, Paul. Gifting five airline and videos live memberships. And just in time, we're going to be doing our live drawing here shortly. Oh, yeah, I saw Roadrunners growing up out in the Coachella Valley. Yeah. Trevor, back with the Super Chess. Says, what is the building blocking Alpha 8 runway? I know what it is. Rudy, do you know what it is? You mentioned it a couple weeks ago. Did you say Aeromexico? Aeromexico Cargo. Yeah. Though I never see any... Obviously, you can't park a plane there. Well, I want to talk to them. <laughs> it's scooching. <laughs> I want to know how old that building is and what does it do for its next inspection. Doesn't need to be. What's it when you? I can't even think right now. What am I thinking of? Inspections? Wait, inspection, but... Like, inspect it for what's the little rodents? Termites? The little termites, termites. Oh. When was the last time this building was inspected for termites? <laughs> well, the last thing we want is for that to get tented. <laughs> well, oh, that's true. <laughs> I think they should just level it to one one floor. Yeah, why does it need to be a... <laughs> Let me remind you what we're giving out here next. How about this? The official Airline Videos Live hoodie comes in many different colors. You can go check them out at shopavl.com. This could be yours if you're a lucky AVL member and are in the chat. We give you a code word to enter. It's coming up next. Yes. Uh-huh. <laughs> I think it's time for Rudy to explain the rules. <laughs> Rudy, would you like to explain the rules? Fasten those seatbelts, everybody. It's going to be a bumpy ride. Oh, boy. Number one. Yes. You must be a member of the channel. Yes. There's no green lettering with your name, little airplane icon next to your name. You're not a member. You got to be a member to participate. Number two, we're going to play this music. Sounds something like this. <laughs> when that music begins, you have until that music ends to respond in the chat saying, I'm here, I accept. Of course, I'm going backwards because first you have to know <laughs> that we are. See, it's not easy. <laughs> We're going to give you a code word. It's going to be in lime green font on the screen, which will display in lime just green. a moment. Yeah, lime green. Not my favorite color. That's the code word you're going to type into the chat. That officially enters you into the drawing. If you don't type it in just the way you see it written, you won't be entered. So make sure to type it in, all one word, all in caps. And then Bob, wait, where's Bob? Bob's not here anymore. We're going to pick the winner. And at that point, we'll give you 15 seconds to let us know that you're still in the chat. I feel like I'm forgetting something. You are. Yes. Do what not, are we giving away? Do ah. not, do not enter it more than five times, or Rudy will kick you out of the race. I'll kick you out. Yes. <laughs> and once we have confirmed that you are the winner and you've accepted, you will send us an email info at airlinevideos.com, giving us your address. Got to get those deets. The address. And the color, color and your size. size. Very important. Now, this is a hoodie. Yes. <laughs> what about these hoodies, Rudy? They run a little snug, a little, little tight. So if you're a medium, I would go for a large. There you go. That's it. That was pretty rough. But that was my first time. So no, you did a good job. Next time, I'll have it pre-scripted. <laughs> No, we're going to run a video. We're going to get that video produced. Yes. All right. Uh, if now, you guys are ready. Question is, are you ready? 
Are you ready? What's that? Are you ready? No. I don't like that line. <sighs> what else can I say? Are you excited? Let's go. Are you pumped? Just get it over with. Come on. Let's do it. <laughs> like Nike says, just do it. All right. We better start rolling the tape. Yeah. All right. On your mark, get set, go for it. There is your code for it to enter once again. AVL. It's the lime green text on your screen. AVL. All caps. No space. Enter it now for your chance to win this official airline of videos live. Hoodie, like Rudy mentioned, comes in many different colors. Go check them out at shopavl.com. We do these live drawings twice on Sundays for the big Sunday show. Now, if you don't win today, don't worry. We do this every Sunday as long as you're in the airline videos live member. And of course, if you really want this hoodie, and I don't blame you, you can head over to shopavl.com and buy one yourself and help support the channel at the same time. These hoodies and all of our merch ship all around the world. Lots of satisfied customers. <laughs> Five stars on you. You're not supposed to laugh at that, Rudy. <laughs> All right. Who is it going to be? Who is going to be the lucky winner here today? Again, A-V-L. What does that spell? A-V-L. A-V-L. All right, the chat is going crazy. No, they're not autographed. Nope. <laughs> All right. That is it. Time is up. Let's see who the lucky winner is. Amy at altitude. Amy at altitude. All right. Amy at altitude. Right. Amy at altitude. If you're there, let us know. Rudy will start the music here in just a second. Amy at altitude. Amy at altitude. There you are. Yay! Congratulations to be on the lookout for that email, Amy. Forget to email info at airlinevideos.com. All right. It's always fun. Dallas Flyer becoming a silver member once again. Thank you so much. I feel like that needs to be a jingle. Don't forget to email us info at airlinevideos.com. Doon, doon. <laughs> LX2009 with a $5 super chest this afternoon, Kevin. If you do come back to Boston in June, there will be a lot of new airlines at Logan. Etihad, Amero, Mexico, Austrian. Hope to see you soon. Well, we'll be coming back. I guess it's the next trip to plan after New York. SAS, flight 932, heading to Copenhagen in A350-900, next takeoff here on the south side. Remen Cliff, becoming a silver member. Thank you so much. Yeah, just want to check in. We're with you on the ILS 125 left. Sheriff 
Everyone's leaving. They're all leaving. <laughs> yeah. That was 3244 wins. So like, that's it. I'm done. Runway, See you next week. <laughs> Virgin Atlantic Flight 7 coming in from London Heathrow at 8351,000, now just 27. Minutes away from touching down here in Los Angeles. Thanks again. See you next time. You out of yes. here? Thank you. Thank you. All right. See ya. Air 724, keep your speed up. Traffic two miles behind you. Turn left on Alpha 7. So, gifting Auto five airline Auto videos Auto live at memberships. Thank you so much, Sue. Bob, did he come back? No. Nope. Bob says bobbing around. Sue Vander Clip, gifting five. Airline Day videos live. Memberships, thank you so much, Sue. Steve, you out of here. Hi, Steve. He looks so sad. He's so tired. Sammy the third, a member for 24 months, is a platinum member, two years with the AVL, and I've earned the badge. Number two, two, five, 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 a new sheriff in town. Thank you, Sammy. The flight heading to Seattle, Alaska Airlines flight 1147 to 737 800. How do you think uh, the behind the scenes LA stuff is going to look? <laughs> Good. I can't wait to see like on a full screen how it came out. Yeah. yeah. Kemi Hudson, a member of 34 months, is the sum of members. Is you set it for all the changes at LAX? You know, I was we, we were at the H on Friday, and some uh, visitors were asking about the whole people mover thing. And from up there, you can really see the whole, you know, the whole track. And yeah. I was explaining because they were asking, where, you know, where is that going to take you? And I said, well, you can park at the economy parking garage and then take the people mover over to your terminal. Right. You can, you know, go to the car rental facility. You can go, you know, from one place to the next here at the airport. So that's really exciting whenever that opens up. 
Of course, with all the new, you know, terminal, the terminal zero. That's going to be really exciting. That's gonna, that's, they keep people or keep things exciting here at the airport, that's yeah. for sure. It's never going to be a dull moment, just like this show. <laughs> never a dull moment. So that takes us to the top of the hour. Oops. And officially 4 p.m. here in beautiful sunny Los Angeles, California. You are watching continuous live coverage of LAX plane spotting right here in your home for LAX live streams. That is Airline Videos Live. Today is a big Sunday show here on March 10th, 2024. We are the plane jockeys. Hello here at Imperial Hill. Well, you know who we are. As we continue on here, things should be cooking a little bit. Should be having the queen and the king <laughs> taking off here on the south side this hour, right? Or is it, yeah, it's this, this coming hour? The bottom of the hour. Bottom of this hour? Top of the next hour. Top of the next hour? <laughs> I'm all turned around. Yeah, well, thanks for joining us. <laughs> Landis with the $5 super jet. Thanks so much, Landis. And our friend Skittles, gifting five airline videos live at memberships. Thank you so much, Skittles. Nice. Bob? No. You know what? Give me that Pop-Tart. I'm going to throw it on the ground. Here we go. How about it? Tower 3089, 5 All right. Skittles, gifting five airline videos live at memberships. Thank you, Skittles. Well, my name is Rudy. R U D Y. Not Randy. <laughs> Close. Randy. Someone call me Randy. No, my name is not Randy. <laughs> American 142 contact, so come apart, you're good. Yeah, American 142. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? You know, rich being rich. This is Delta 1876 coming in from Los Cabos on an A321. So the Lufthansa Queen now set for departure at 455. Okay. Ita set for 450. We're just going to end this show with a bang. <laughs> yes, indeed. <laughs> One thing Eric said to me is he thinks it's so cool that we've been able to go into the LSG Sky Chefs, we've been able to go into the United Hangar, been able to go into the Qantas Hangar, and kind of look at what it looks like from that vantage point compared to, you know, we're always here at the hill every weekend. Right. But for us to be able to kind of go into the airport and see how these different parts of the airport function behind the scenes, I said, yes, sir. Thank you so much for helping Called us. Called him sir? No, I didn't. <laughs> I said, thank you so much for, you know, for helping us make these happen. And I told them, I know there's going to be more and can't wait for that. What did he say? <laughs> I said, absolutely, absolutely. Okay, good. Very nice. Thank you. Thank you. More to come. Yes, including our newest one will be released in a few weeks. That's right. We're ready to go. Looking forward to that one. 
Did we decide if we're airing that before we go to New York? The 23rd, yeah, Saturday before we leave. So it's two weeks. I know, and I feel bad because Charlie sent me the script to voice, even to proof, two days ago, and I haven't had even a chance to read it. Should we read it live on the air? Read it live on the air. <laughs> you guys want to hear the proof? Might as well, right? <laughs> Practice session. And action. Let's see. <laughs> What do we got here? Hey, send him Friday. Uh-oh. You've had two days. <laughs> Quick Nats music montage of Breeze Planes. Track. It was a big day for Breeze Airways. Nat Pop of Breeze Planes. The small startup which began passenger service in 2021, announcing the purchase of 10 more Airbus A220s in February 20th. Nat of Breeze Planes. Oh boy, he's got all these Nats of Breeze Planes. I really want to put some right jazz and, uh, music on. <laughs> Should I continue? Yeah. In converting their entire passenger fleet to the tech rich aircraft, Nats of Breeze Planes. Oh boy, I better come out here multiple days if he wants all these Nats of Breeze Planes. All part of the company's ambitious, ambitious plans to make their mark in a very competitive industry. It was a big day for us as well, heading up to Utah to check out Breeze's operations. Nat Pop A220 simulator, including piloting an A220 simulator. It's, it's a long script. Boy, he's got a lot. Woo! <laughs> I better, I better jump on that. I gotta voice that for him tomorrow. Yes. Because <laughs> if not, we're gonna have to push that by like a week or two. Eek! Landis, gifting one airline at Videos Live membership. Thank you so much, Landis. See, even when we're not live streaming, and when I'm not live streaming, I've got I've got work up the the wazoo behind the scenes. You know, it's a lot. Delta 2317, taxi hotel to Juliet, hold short, runway 25 right. Hotel Juliet, hold short, 25 right, Delta 2317. We're almost to 4,000 likes. If you guys haven't yet, make sure to hit that like button. Almost 4,000. Wow. By the way, Emirates A380 Super estimated time of uh, departure scheduled 440. Flight radar 24 saying 503. If it stays at 440, which I don't see why not, it was pretty much on time today. That would put it in line with the Lufthansa Queen taking off around the same time. And that will be quite the grand finale for today's show. Is that Halls? Yeah. You want oh, one? Yes. Because you know what? I'm sitting here. My throat is yeah. sore. Because this tree, I've, the allergies. <laughs> I've been having that since this morning. And I know it's allergies. Not like that one time I was kind of sick. No, it's, it's allergies. That was JetBlue Airways. 1374 taking off to Newark on an A321. Ita now pushing back. So what was she was? That was 450. See, that's off. Scheduled time was 425, estimated at 450 for Ita, and she's already pushing back. Huh. So I don't believe those times. I think we're going to see everything pushing back here this hour. Thank you. Yeah. It's it's so funny. Funny. I was like, oh, he's open up a halls. Yeah. I've just been like, because my throat is like, it's not sore, it's just like, it's like itchy. And, yeah. 
Cargo jet 767 will be taking off to Hamilton. We got JetBlue Airways like 188 heading to Boston. A321. Who are we going to take to Boston? JetBlue. Yeah. I think I asked you that last week. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Who did I? Oh. <laughs> I'm like, who did I fly with last time I went? <laughs> Spirit. <laughs> it wasn't bad. I mean, can't remember if I told you this. There's a bunch of kids on that flight. It was like a whole school or something. And they all had like cowboy hats on. And I remember my mom and I were like, oh man, this is gonna be a long flight. These kids were like running all over the place in the terminal. They were really loud, but once we got on the plane, it's like they all fell asleep. When Charlie and I went up to Utah on the breeze flight out Orange County, we were in the Ascent, which is the so-called first class. And I can't remember how many seats they have up there. I think it was two, 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 four, six, eight, maybe 16 seats. Up there. So yeah. Four cross runway two five right ground point seven five. Cross two five right ground point seven five. Seven seven zero. Taxi hotel Juliet. Cross runway two five right ground point seven five. Hotel Juliet. Cross two five right ground point seven five. Two one mega chair. Runway two five right at Fox Trot. Line up and wait. Traffic crossing downfield. This is Mike India, November Tango, taking off to Boston on this A321 with JetBlue, flight 188. So there was a family, and I think they had, I don't know how many kids they had, but the whole first class section was the whole family. It was the two parents and a bunch of kids, and they were kids from like five all the way up to like 12. And I looked at Charlie, I said, we're surrounded by a bunch of kids in this first class section. This is going to be nuts. They were the most well-behaved kids I've ever seen in my life. Really? No rowdiness, no nothing. I was shocked. Huh. Interesting. This is Latam at 603. We'll be taking off to Santiago, Chile. Taxi 212 to ride high speed and turn left on hotel. Taxi 212, taxi hotel to Juliet, hold short on 25 right. <laughs> this Gulfstream 5 is taking off to Austin, Texas. Number, two to eight here, Remember our friend Evan from Anchorage? Evan from Anchorage? Yeah. He said July is a good time to come to Anchorage. So we'll do Boston at the end of June. Anchorage in July. Jay with the five dollars super chat. Thanks so much, Jay. As long as they have the um, dream lifter. <laughs> Southwest 3687, the taxi hotel at Juliet. Cross from a 25 right, ground point 75. Hotel Juliet, clear to cross 25 right, then over to ground. Southwest 3687. Ridge, kilo traffic, cut a three mile final. Cross from a 25 left, turn left on Alpha. Okay, cross 25 left, uh, Quebec, and uh, turn on left on Alpha. Never. Hey, Sam, this is a fan, Sam, with the Super Chat. Thanks so much, Sam. Another great stream, fellas. Have a great week, everyone. Thank you so much, Sam. Have a great week as well. Amy in Altitude, one of our newest winners with a $5 Super Chat. Thanks so much, Amy. I always look forward to Sundays knowing you guys will be streaming the AVL Big Sunday Show. Thanks for bringing us the planes. Well, our pleasure and congratulations 
Yay. Sporting that new hoodie. <laughs> Oh, don't forget Dallas. Yeah, I'm going to have to go to Dallas by myself. Yeah. When is uh, Reagan National? I don't know. I'm going to probably have to do that by myself in May. You wouldn't go in June? It's too hot. Okay. Yeah. I mean, when I went in July, it was just humid. And then it rained. <laughs> oh, yeah. Skechers. Skechers? It's your shoe company. Yeah, so comfortable. I think I might have to keep buying these shoes. I love these shoes because they're, so they're slip-ons. They have this like cushion, so you literally just slip them on. Slip them on. I'm not a morning person. And when I'm running out the door, I like to be able to just go, Doop. all right, let's go. I have so many pairs of the same type of shoe. I've talked about this. If I find a shoe that I like, I continuously buy the same pair over and over again. Have you ever tried Skechers? Yeah, not, it's not, I don't know. I like Adidas, Adidas. I have, what are these? It has like an arch support because apparently, I've gone to the foot doctor, the podiatrist, the podiatrist told me they did some x-rays that I have a very high arch. So I need something that gives me arch support. I don't know how that happened. Just did. What size shoe do you wear? 10. See, this is why, I think this is why I don't wear Skechers because their shoes run, a, the shoes are a little the bit bigger. They're just bigger shoes. And I wear a size 12. And you, when you wear a size 12, you don't want your shoe to look like a size 12. And I just remember wearing Skechers. Cars I felt like I just had like clown shoes on my foot because they were so big. Okay, plant two five right for departure, hold short two five left. I have some students who wear size 12 shoes. I'm like, what? <laughs> How? Virgin Atlantic Flight 7 about to touch down. It's A350, 1000 from London Heathrow. Let's pick up 25 right. I have Docker, that's 90 now. Virgin 938, heavy cross, runway 25 left at Box Charles, hold short, runway 25 right. Box 25 left at Box Charles, hold short, 25 right, cargo jet 9 Cargo jet, gonna taxi into position for takeoff. Cargo nine three heavy, you're only two five right at Fox Shark, line up and wait. Two five line up right, right at Fox Shark. Two five right at Fox Shark, cargo jet nine three heavy. First on Bravo heavy, right turn the next five speed. Oh, I like New Balance. New Balance, those are good too. Version Bravo Heavy, Taxi Taxi Hotel to Juliet, hold short on way 25 right. It's out of Juliet, then hold short on 25 right. Version 938 Heavy, wind 250 at 10, RNAV Docker, on way 25 right at Fox Truck, let's take off. RNAV Docker, clear for takeoff, 25 right, cargo jet 9. Evan's three, asking if we want to do wind Lake Hood. We tried doing nine. Lake Hood. Get those, what are they called? Water planes? I don't know. The day we went there, there was like no action. Uh, Nothing. Yeah. What? It might have been blue, but it might have been blue, but 
Tower American 1676 GT inbound for the visual team right left. That was Cargo Jet Airways 938 taking off to Hamilton on a 767 300 converted freighter. And our next takeoff is Latam Airlines, flight 603, heading to Santiago, 787-8 Dreamliner. ETA will be number three. Float planes. All right, T5 left clear to land, American 1676. Other 21 20 LA Seaplanes. <laughs> For your sun bravo heavy traffic holding in position, cross from a two five right, country ground point seven five. This is Latam Airlines 603 taking off to Santiago, Chile on a 787-8 Dreamliner. Lost, not yet bound, is asking, is there a best way to book a flight? I like using Google's flight search feature. Go to flights.google.com. Yeah, it's a good way to price your... What I like about it is you can actually kind of navigate their pricing filter to show you when is the best time to take that particular flight. Oh. I usually just go to the, the whatever uh, airline's website or their app. Well, I go there first. I don't book it through there. Once I figure it out, okay, so I want to go to... I want to go to Boston. What's the best or cheapest airline? And then you can narrow down, like, I only want to fly JetBlue or I only want to fly Delta, JetBlue or Delta. You can narrow it down by um, Airline Alliance, like, I only fly SkyTeam or I only fly Star Alliance, and then it'll narrow it down to those airlines. Then you go from there. Right at the high speed of American 1676. Option 2030 Papa at Quebec, crossing the 25 left turn, left on Alpha, and then contact ground point 75. ETA number two for takeoff. Following Delta Airlines flight 2120 heading to Las Vegas on an E319. Virgin continues taxiing up to the north side of Tom Bradley. American 1676 at Juliet, hold short runway 25 right. At Juliet, hold short 25 right, American 1676. 4,000 likes, thanks you guys. 4K! Okay! <laughs> 4K is okay to us. This is Delta 2120 taking off to Las Vegas on an A319. Vince was saying I should take this flight <laughs> to Vegas. We have an American Airlines special. Oh, yeah. America West Retro Livery coming in from Dallas, Fort Worth. This is flight 1676 on this A321. Don't get me started. <laughs> Eat up. up next, flight 621 heading back to Rome. A35900.
American 764, call from Richard Five Red, ground point 75. American 1676 at Juliet, cross point 25 right, contact ground point 75. Alright, at Juliet, cross 25 right, contact ground point 75 on the other side, American 1676. He's out of 61 heavy, contact for Carla Parcher, Chalk. Carla Chow, he's out of 61. Chow, Vita, Arrivederci. Also had the one world livery, 777-200ER, heading back to London Heathrow, now pushing it back. That will be a south side takeoff. And I just realized, was the A319 this off-color gray on the top, too? I think it was, wasn't it? Yeah. That's what's throwing off that green, because it was white on the original. They are starting the tow of the Korean Air E380 Super over to the remote gates. Big shot, turn six nine, turn left on Alpha seven, turn left on Alpha taxi to parking. Left Alpha seven, left Alpha taxi to Alpha parking. Big shot, turn six nine. It's a right-hand turn on the Lima. We have the 1524, wind 25 right, 9R, and have Docker, runway 25 right, cover takeoff. Clear for takeoff, 25 right, R, and have Docker, just in Brian Wright with the Fine Dollar Super Chat. Thanks so much, Brian. Brian says, thanks for a great Sunday. Kevin and Rudy, Ita has the best livery, and pineapple doesn't belong on a pizza. Well, I agree with you, Brian, on half your statement. On the other, I disagree. It, uh, I'll agree with you. Does it belong on a pizza? No. Is it good on a pizza? Yes. <laughs> We're bringing up this debate again what? were we the original ones that talked about that because i feel like i watch these other airport live streams and it's like people talk about the pineapple and the pizza and i'm thinking there's no way that this is a universal discussion because we have talked about it and it's been a long time since we've talked about it did we start well, the trend i feel like we started a lot of trends <laughs> <laughs> I'm just making sure. You know, I just think it's really weird that all these other aviation live streams are talking about pineapple on pizza. And I'm thinking, huh? What? <laughs> yeah, I'm noticing a lot of similarities rubbing off to other live streams. I mean, like our goodie bags. Goodie bags. Bumper stickers. little things well I was wrong Korean Air just towing it over to the West Gates you know I was looking up our flight that we're taking in 15 days scheduled departure time is 4 35 p.m. today that flight not leaving until 7 25 which one it's flight 11 24 with JetBlue Oh. So, almost a three-hour delay. Ooh. That would get you in there at, like, almost 3 o'clock in the morning, right? Yeah. Eee. So, I don't know if that typically happens, although I'm looking at the history. <laughs> Yesterday, same thing. It landed <laughs> oh, at 3.10 no. a.m. Oh, no. Day before... Landed at 1.46 a.m. Oh, no. No wonder it was so cheap. The day before that, <laughs> they landed at 6 a.m. What? The day before that, landed at 1.45. So, oh, my gosh. I, I think we should just plan on getting there late. <laughs> and maybe don't, don't schedule an early start. <laughs> no, no, no early <laughs> start on Tuesday. 
What? Because if that happens. Wow. I guess it's just something we can anticipate. The last time they were on time was <laughs> March 4th. What? And they landed at 12.32 in the morning. That's an on-time arrival. Okay. Wow. Not a good track record for that flight. Come on, JetBlue. This is, this is what I've been talking about. You need a little oil on your machine. So, as a plane spotter, I guess it helps to know this ahead of time because when you're anticipating an on-time takeoff, it kind of really stresses you out when you get delayed like that. Now I know to anticipate it. Well, we'll think be of arriving it this at way. 3 a.m. I know, but think <laughs> of it this way. Does it really matter? It's We're getting to the hotel and going to bed anyway, so sleep on the plane. For us, it doesn't matter, but... I think about people who have like jobs that they need to report to. Yeah. Maybe that next morning. True. It's kind of a bummer if you get delayed like that. But yeah, you're right. Just sleep. Alaska You can close your door. I'm gonna bring my eye mask, my eye shades. So I'm, to the, I'm on the left side. Rudy's on the right hand side. We're row two. I'm always right. <laughs> Both have the thrown seats which has the door, if it's working, sometimes it just doesn't work. But even if the door doesn't work, I can't physically see you yeah. by looking to my right. And you can't see me by looking Not to the left. Not a big deal. You know, in see, United, we didn't have a door. It's fine. We didn't? United don't have doors? On the Dreamliner? I don't remember I a door. You, that's still the best seat I've ever sat in. Yeah, I don't remember a door. No, because I was asleep and you came and took pictures of me sleeping. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> yeah, but the way this, the Polaris is set up on those streamliners with United, it's, it's like so you're nice. kind of like so tucked in that the, the outer yeah. part kind of acts as a, a barrier. You know yeah. what I mean? Well, depending on what seat you get, because if you get one of the angled seats. Oh, that's true. Because remember, some of them are up against the window and some are kind of angled. And we both had the window one. Yeah. I almost didn't when they swapped the 10 for the 9. But Riddy's going to enjoy the food on JetBlue. He's going to try the mint specialty drink. It's very good. It's very minty. Minty fresh. It's gonna be a minty good time. You look at the menu, they say pick four. There's four. usually there's usually two hot items. Actually there's six items. There's usually about four hot items and two like a salad and something else. Air Canada 792 and 24 right minor on F Docker, one way 25 right for the takeoff. The takeoff 25 right on F Docker. So we got that British Airways 777. Also have China Airlines cargo flight 5137 heading to Taipei. Both those heading to the two fives. Finishing up, packing up on the Emirates A380 as well as the Lufthansa Queen. I bet you anything, Rudy. I've been calling in and I'm usually pretty good at by this. I suspect those two will be taken off back to back here on the south side. You want to talk about a finale for the big Sunday show? Oh, yes. We have the grand finale right here. Oh, yes. James F.L., a member for six months, his gold member is enjoying the AVL. Big Sunday show with Kevin and Rudy. So relaxing to watch. Thanks, guys. Our pleasure. Thank you. Glad you guys are enjoying it. I'm in Air Canada. 737 Max 8. Actually, it's A321. Now rolling down.
Alaska 1375, cross runway 25 right, ground point ground 5, drop the boarding in position. Public traffic, amateur, cross 25 right to the air, ground point ground 5, ground point 5. 7805, relay tone, 24 short minor, relay 25 left, relay. I'm sorry, stay in front of the user. This is Air Canada 792 taking off to Toronto on an A321. I already know I'm not going to be able to sleep on that flight. Oh, you will. <laughs> really? <laughs> you will. Why wouldn't you? I get too excited. I know on the way back from Chicago, I was out because I was tired. I'm sure on the way home, I'm going to be out. That's a morning flight. Yeah, I'm going to be out. So the setup obviously is different on the A321neo. I've never, I've never actually seen it with, with my own, with my own eyes. eyes so I, I don't know if they're smaller than the throne seat or what it is. I feel like <laughs> Joe. Like where did Joe go? I think Joe's been on that. Oh, he has. I think so. The Neo. Next takeoff here on the south side, United Airlines flight 2019 heading to SFO at 737-800. Be followed by the Speedbird 777-200ER. Michael with the five dollars super jet. Thank you so much, Michael. Always an enjoyable way to spend a Sunday. Great show and thanks. Well, thank you for your support there, Michael. This is United Airlines 2019 taking off to San Francisco on a 737 800. Southwest Airlines Flight 2121, coming up from Houston, Texas, a 737-800. Up next, Speedbird, British Airways in the One World Livery, Flight 282. Heading back to London Heathrow in a 777-200 ER. Flight 2121, Air France, a 777-300 ER, heading to 25 right. what air france flight six five what grand caravan is back southern airways oh really grand caravan hmm. what's going on of course can't see it right here <laughs> So it sounds like we have Austin, St. Martin, and Anchorage, July. Chicago. Chicago. July. July. End of July. Mid end July. What am I missing? You're missing. Are we doing another JFK before? Well, I don't know. We'll see. Yeah. <laughs> I'll, if, if I can't fit it in, I'd like. I'll probably go back and fall again. Yeah. Okay. Boston, Anchorage, Chicago. Got 
Southwest 4777, contact with Cal Apache Connect. Yes, Southwest 4777. Right, 518 Navy LA Tower, runway 2510, runway 25, left to the left. Good land, good land. We have an MD-11 freighter on final. I have no hope for it going long. So as you can see with the king and the queen, both baggage doors still open. Planes Network, the Super Chat. Ah, hey guys. <laughs> hey, fellas. Always miss most of the Sunday, Monday shows. Start later, please. <laughs> Much love from Briz Vegas. Briz Vegas. Brizzy. Brizzy in the house. Who do we have here? Is it James? Is it Maddie? Probably James. Willing to bet James. Thanks, you guys. Yeah, I'm always missing your streams as well. Normally, they're on... Our Saturday, like pretty late, so I usually miss it. I hope you guys are doing well. This is Alaska 1360 taking off to Los Cabos on the Max 9. Of course, our friends Matt and Sam have also been going live, but they've been going live at weird times. I saw them live this morning almost. Yeah, which is in the middle of the night for us. They were both wearing like white shirts. And Matt, HD Melvin, is back home. He was gone for a long time. And he's back home in Melbourne. He said the flight home was pretty rough. <laughs> oh, really? Why? <laughs> Just long from is it Abu Dhabi to Melbourne? It's a long flight. Five eighteen, have you turn left on Alpha Eight? Turn left on Alpha, and then Alpha Eight. Alpha Eight, Alpha is in parking. Five eighteen, heavy. Got that China Cargo Triple Seven freighter heading to the two fives. This MD-11 was built as a passenger plane converted to freighter. Delivered to American in 1991. American Airlines. Something special in the air. Remember that, Oprah? The outro to Oprah? You used to have an MD-11? Oh. Aircraft name is... Special. Is it Aquina? Aquina. LA 33 59, years old. Wait, what year was it delivered? 1991. Uh, I wasn't even born yet. <laughs> you weren't? Oh, wait, no, never mind. 1991. <laughs> I'm thinking 1990. April. No, oh, yeah, I was not even a year yet, is what I meant to say. 2377, yeah, we're uh, right here near Fox Trap for 259. Okay, then restriction no longer resists down to the No problem, we'll go full length United C triple freighter now rolling down at two five left. This is China Airlines Cargo 5137 yeah, taking off to Taipei on a triple seven freighter. Dynasty. Got that Air France triple seven. Heading to the two fives. Got that Moss Air Cargo heading to Guadalajara. Got La Star Malta flight 6811. Dave HD, gifting 20 airline videos live memberships. Thank you so much, Dave. Is this a train? Do we have a train? 
Is there a train? Is there? <laughs> did you bring your... I did, yeah, but do we have a train? <laughs> well, bring it out! <laughs> Maybe this is the start of the train. Okay, well, maybe I need to launch it. <laughs> I can't believe that Rudy bought this, but you guys are all going to laugh. I laughed. Are you ready for this? Tower <laughs> left, 1354, we're... Uh, all aboard! Dave, thank you so much. <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright. Oh ships. Oh man. <laughs> Can you tell I teach middle school? Yes, I can. <laughs> Mr. E with a $5 super chat. Thank you so much, Mr. E. I was at a junkyard today, which is just below short final for Albuquerque Runway 3. Highlights, three F18, F18s and an Amazon cargo with a missing bottom winglet. Ooh. <laughs> Interesting. Thanks for the update there, Mr. E. And the Neverland Big So with the $2 Super Chess is home in time for the grand finale. Yes. Thanks again for hanging out with us. Speaking of which, it started. Who is so ready? The baggage door is still open on the Lufthansa Queen. Yeah. I think Emirates heard the train horn. <laughs> it was heard miles away. <laughs> Ah. Stop the Sudan 31 for right turn first available. Traffic close in trail. First available, Southwest 5971. You can stop the Sudan 71, then taxi Hotel to Juliet. Hold short runway 25 right. Appreciate it. Hotel Juliet, short 25 right, Southwest 5971. Ah. Scrambled egg 81 with the $7.47 super chat. Do. 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 <laughs> Southwest Airlines in the Missouri one, one Liberty Flight 5971 coming up from Vegas, 737 700, touching down here on the south side, just on the other side of the building. So last year, one of my classes played a piece called The Great Locomotive Chase. It's a very fun piece, but there is a very important train whistle part. And when I handed the train whistle over to the kid who ended up playing the train whistle, he was ecstatic. <laughs> He's like, yes, I will do the train whistle. It's a very important part of the yeah. song. And they kept begging, can we play it again? Can we play it again? It was their favorite piece. The kids nicknamed it Choo Choo. Let's play Choo Choo. Choo Choo. Choo Choo. Choo this is United 2377 taking off to Houston Intercontinental on a 737-900ER. Air France number two for takeoff on 25 right. Still waiting on that Galastar Malta flight 6811. Heading to Guadalajara, A330-300. This is an old China Southern. A330. Heavy, runway 25 right for the takeoff. Arnav Docker, 2-5 right, clear for takeoff, Air France 065 Heavy, bye. Danny B with the $2 Super Chat. Thanks so much, Danny. Send in y'all. Thanks for another great stream. Thank you, Danny. By the way, I owe you an email. Southwest 
Some baggage doors still open. They will take it. Queen. Uh, tower right, that's the hotel and watch over golf, and uh, we will let you know that was 49. At the Air France, triple seven at 300 ER, now heading back to Paris. Oh, we. Oh, 352 heavy, 25 left. 352 heavy, LA 12 and 240 to land. Fairland, 25 left, L352 heavy. Alpha 5971, cross from 25 right, ground force down 5, traffic position. Alpha 25 right, one seven five, top left, 5971. This is Air France, flight 65, taking off to Paris on a 777-300ER. Au revoir. Alright, I'll cover the phone. Over 472, right, Juliet, we'll short runway 25 right. Juliet, 4225 right, come up. 1650, runway 25 right, come up. Gulfstream 280 is coming in from Las Vegas, Henderson Executive Airport. Well, if they're coming in for the Oscars, they're going to be in the late. Got eight minutes. No, never going to make it. Ground 4932, gates open, we're checking with ramp. Now we'll hold before crossing over as we have a Delta A330 NEO next arrival on 25 left. Now let them golf and cross runway 25 right golf and the contact ground there is 4932. The Emirates A380 taxi lights are on. Richard, a member for 11 months. Diamond members is awesome show today. Kevin and Rudy, thank you so much, Richard. Michelle Ras, one of our great mods, member for 31 months, is an Emerald member for 31 months. No, might see you in New York. Surprise! It's going to be a big party there, Michelle. Big party. Might as well rent out the whole TWA hotel. Thank you, Juliet. Caution with 25 right now, 0.75. All right, Emirates now starting a taxi over here to the south side. The right hand, left hand turn, left hand turn on to Lima. Well, now, eventually, make his way over the two south runways. Mr. Six Seven One, can you take departure from two five right at Fox Shot today? Yes, we accept Fox Shot departure from two five right, Mr. Six Eight One One. Thank you, Master Six Eight One One Heavy. Five sixty four heavy right turn the next high speed, Right turn Got that Gatlin Star Malta, like sixty heading to Guadalajara. A three thirty. Dark caution, we come on three speed by the heavy Dreamliner. Two four zero one zero, only two five left, clear to land. Only two five left, we are clear to land. I feel like the A three eighty is going to be sitting there for a little bit. Juliet caution, we two five right, constant ground point down five, drop the holding position. Juliet cross two five right, constant ground down five. Officer 6811 heavy, you're only 25 right at Fox Shot, line up at 8, drop the top of the field. Malta. 
Crossing right. over, right. heading to 2 5 right. right. Good afternoon, sir. Wind 24010. Show me 25 left for land. Caution, make sure everyone's heavy air belts to the park. Alan, a member for 14 months. That's a golden member. Thank you so much, Alan. Monster 611 heavy, wind 2401, zero, RNAV Docker, runway 25 right at Foxtrot, clear for takeoff. Yeah, put the coffin with the five right, Monster 611. Fever 2 above, wind 5 exit, hotel 7 high speed today, please. Exit, exit. Alright, got the Moss Air, Galastar Malta. It's a converted A33300, used to fly for China, Southern. Emirates now Emirates rolling Emirates down Emirates Emirates two Emirates five Emirates. right. I think the Emirates A380 is going to be sitting there for a little bit. Emirates East on Victor Super Taxi, hold on Lima and hold short on the two five right. Four on Lima and hold on the two five right. Over zero extra go. Six, three, go, Mr. Golf, turn left on Alpha 8, turn left on Alpha. Left on Alpha 8, left on Alpha, Mr. Golf. Mr. Victor Super, Lima Cross, Lima 2-5 right, hold short, Lima 2-5 left. Lima Cross, Lima 2-5 right. 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 Lima Emirates clear to uh, start heading toward the two fives. Here we go. Well, I was wrong on the king and the queen. Yeah, that's okay. I think I would have been right. It just seems like they, for whatever reason, they're waiting on some last minute luggage. All right, already cleared the crossover two five right, right and the two five left. Turn it. 
into Alpha now heading down to 25 and left. So just had a China Airlines cargo, triple seven, just touching down. Next video is going to be turned left on Alpha, turn left on Alpha, taxi, I see supers waiting for you. All right, left turn Alpha, Alpha, Alpha 8, Alpha. No pressure. <laughs> alpha 8, turn in front of the super. They're waiting for you. No pressure. I mean, they could just go all the way to Lima. Yeah, I know, I would have, I would have just said, you're going to Lima. Sorry. Well, I got 500 people in that plane. You got cargo. <laughs> Get to Lima. Flight 5167 coming in from Taipei. 25, 47, and, uh, and close the baggage door on the Lufthansa Queen and should be pushing back here shortly. Grip take up 25 right, Sky with 5415. Yeah, pilots have to train for ground school, taxiing planes with the taxiways, keeping it on the center line. Would you be nervous if you had to taxi a plane this big? Yes. <laughs> Are you kidding me, Rudy? I was nervous flying an A220 simulator. <laughs> Pilot in the simulator said, All right, take us over to 24 left. I said, How? <laughs> I'll let you do it. You, do you take us over now? Echo, Delta. <laughs> the only time that I took control of the plane was after we took off flying over the ocean. He said, Grab the joystick and turn us back toward downtown. And you mean I the said, side All right, <laughs> the side stick. I turned it and I felt like it was too sharp of a turn. He said, No, keep on turning. I was like, Are you serious? I felt like I was going to turn it over. I was like, Turn, baby, turn. <laughs> keep going. Man, I missed out. <laughs> Someday. I'll have to guess. Hi. How are you? Got Did a triple seven at 300 ER coming from Paris. No. Today's your lucky day. Happy belated birthday. Right, the 1407 LA Tower, wind 2010, wind 25 left, Alaska, Should be seeing the Lufthansa Queen that pushing back here shortly. The Nana Lana Pixel, a member for 13 months, is full of Oh, a milestone shot. Gonna use it to say, you guys are awesome. Let me know if you want those pastrami fries from Disneyland. Showed you earlier. Ooh, I could not do that during the show. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the thing you brought this morning, uh, it filled me up just half of that. Right on high speed, American 2547. Thank you for hanging out with us today. Steven, yes. 
becoming a gold Shall member. Thank you so much, Stephen. And Dave H. T. back with the Super Chat. Thank you so much, Dave. When will AVL be at JFK again? Will the Sunday show be there too? So we'll have a Sunday show before we leave the 24th of March. We hop on a plane on the 25th. That's a Monday. Tentatively, we have a show scheduled Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. We come back Saturday, and we're going to take off Sunday because it is Easter. And by that point, I think we're going to be pretty tired. Right? I thought I heard something about an emergency. Really? Am I hearing things? <laughs> From a pilot or the ATC? Uh, pilot said something about emergency frequency. Yeah. March 26th through the 29th. Yankee, of course, you're a tech with Fox truck cross from a 25 left, full circle, only 25 right. M. Billy, a member for 17 months, is gold and member. Thanks so much, M. Billy. Hey, Kevin and Rudy, so excited for private jets. The Oscars are in LA today. When will AVL be at Las Vegas? Ah, uh, well, probably, I wouldn't say Vegas never, but it's right not on our list. <laughs> Yankee Eclipse, you're only 25 right at Fox Truck, but the takeoff are now docked for the 240 Why do we have, first of all, why do we have to be at smaller airports when we got all the action right here? Yankee 2299, taxi hotel to Juliet, hold short, only 25 right. Hotel Juliet, hold short, 25 right. Right? Yeah. Right, Rita? <laughs> She'll hear me in 15 seconds. The big Q. And down at Taxiway Kilo. Just waiting for the 15 second delay for Rita to hear. Right, Rita? <laughs> Mike D, a member for 19 months, is gold member since Great Sunday Show. Thank you so much, Mike. NRB Photos, Ben with the $20 Super Chat. Thank you so much, Ben. Hey, Kevin and Rudy, thanks so much for the awesome Sunday coverage. My family and I always enjoy watching. Nice to have you on board. Thank you, Ben. Yeah. Thanks for your help yesterday. Ooh. M? M, Billy, are you watching? What do you think of this one? This Embraer Legacy 600 jetting on out of here to uh, somewhere. Yeah, Emirates wasted no time. I mean, we could go hang out with Vince, of course. Turn left, heading 220. I do owe oh, Vince a visit. I did promise. I gotta do it soon because it's getting hot. Yeah. When? <laughs> I have no time. I know, I don't know. Right, I mean, April. April is opening up a little bit. You're not much of a Vegas person, are you? No, not Let's really. Say we could go for your birthday. <laughs> no, there's too many people coming that month or week here to LA. All right, Emirates. The 216 sending back to Dubai. Now rolling down. 25 left. Hey, Charles, 
Team Lufthansa Queen and now pushing it back. She too will be heading over here for a south side takeoff. Next thing off here on the south side is United Airlines flight 1170 heading to Honolulu in a 777-200. Oh, Lufthansa. Nice. <laughs> I'm getting really competitive with Joe. Like, who, who shot it better? <laughs> He's got the fancier camera. Yeah, he was bragging. He's like, I got more megapixels than you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay then. Being beat by an 18-year-old. Runway 25 right, Pacific Coast. Yep, take off runway 25 right, RNAV docker, United 1170 heavy, here we go. That's 5419, Cosmic Jones, runway 25 right, Alarm going. Alarm on the Taco, 25 heavy, go up to the, uh, Mitchell Road, 25 left. Turn around. Radio land, 25 left, heavy. Pushing her back a little farther. All right, we got that triple seven now taking off. This is United Airlines 1170 taking off to Honolulu on a 777-200. Michael, back with the $5 Super Chat. Thank you so much, Michael. Are your choices for places to go based on viewing locations? Uh, kind of, but also based on the amount of traffic at the airport. We, if, you know, for uh, an airport live stream, you need constant traffic. And, of course, LAX also has the variety of aircraft plus the constant traffic. Now, people always say, go to Atlanta, go to Atlanta. We'd like to go to Atlanta, but it will be constant traffic, just kind of like Chicago. But you're going to see it all Delta, for the most part, Delta, Southwest. So I say it's based mostly on, first of all, is there a location for us to get a good shot at? Is there enough traffic? Is there enough variety? Like we went to Dulles, I went to Dulles. It's a great airport, a lot of history. It's too big for its own good and not enough traffic during the day. Yeah. So we won't go back there and do another live stream. Had some slow moments. Yeah. It did. <laughs> it did. L.A. Spotter, a member for 23 months, is a platinum member, says, laugh out loud, Rudy, you gotta add context. That was supposed to be a joke. I missed the joke. <laughs> I, everything's over my head. We were shooting the Emirates together, and uh, I just said, wow, look, I, I got a really good picture. So then we were kind of like flexing, so to speak. And then he said, I got more megapixels than you. 
Megatron. I'm like, okay, well, that's so true. Still got to get shot down. How about this shot? King and Queen. What was the joke, though? I, I missed that part. I have no idea. Number two, two for takeoff here on the south side. It's the big Q. Qatar Airways fleet 740, heading back to Doha at an A350-1000. Then Asiana A380 Super will be towed possibly over to the west gates or could go all the way to the west side to the remote parking. The Lufthansa Queen will certainly head here to the south side for a takeoff on 25 left. Yeah, we got the big Q now rolling down 25 at right. You should see this queen start her taxi here shortly. Make that left and turn into Lima. This is Qatar Airways 740 taking off to Doha on the A350-1000. All right, the Queen now starting taxi. And a left-hand turn on to Lima. LA Spotter back with a five dollars super chat. Thank you, Joe. What's he doing sitting in his car? It's probably tired. It's not cold. Can I sit in your car? I'm tired. <laughs> I told him yesterday, I don't think we're going to make it to Proudbird. And then I messaged him earlier, I think we're going to the Proudbird. <laughs> we'll be all right. As long as this queen. No, we'll make it. Which is fine because I feel like I've had a lot of pizza this week. Yeah, I feel like a hamburger instead of pizza tonight. Yeah. There you go. I never did eat that leftover pizza from Friday. I did. Yesterday. I, I was like, don't eat the pizza, Kevin. It was, it would have been Saturday morning, Saturday afternoon before the big photo shoot. I'm like, don't eat the pizza before the photo shoot. I had the pizza before the photo shoot. <laughs> I was fine, but then when we went to dinner, I was like, why do I feel like I, like I just ate? I felt yeah, cool. It, yeah. Just kind of sitting there. <laughs> and then I had a quarter of 
Ben's. It was like a burger, but it was like four Hawaiian rolls that made up the bun. So I had like a quarter of it. And then I was full. And I got the hot dog, and I was like, ooh, I'm going to have to power through this one. <laughs> I hate when that happens. Like, you get a big meal, and you're like, I'm not hungry. What do I do? <laughs> that is not going to be a problem for me later. No, not today. <laughs> I remember growing up and being at, like, different, we had different babysitters. And I remember one time being fed a meal. And I was not hungry. And the babysitter like kind of yelled at me, like, "You need to eat it." I'm like, "I'm not hungry." <laughs> She's not very nice. She didn't last very long. So at one point, I told my mom, "You know what?" She was really mean. <laughs> she got angry that I didn't want to eat. I'm like, I'm not hungry. And you still remember it to this day. I still remember. It, yeah. All right, so we got the Queen on Lima, the Asiana A380 Super. We'll be towing that either to the west gates, but I'm thinking they're heading to the west remote gates. Also, have Swiss, the 777-300ER, waiting to head into Tom Bradley. And, of course, it's kind of blocked, not going anywhere. As they wait for the Queen to start taxi once again. Also, on the Pond Airways, the Dreamliner, made a left-hand turn onto Delta. We'll be making a left-hand turn onto Papa and head here to the south side. Isn't it weird that it's currently 522? Oh, and it really should just be four. It, yeah, it just, it's so bright out for 522. <laughs> so crossed over 25 right, right will hold the short of 25 at left. Swiss now making her way to the gates of Tom Bradley. United 737 Max 8 touching down. We should now allow the Queen to cross over. I know we missed um, top of the hour, but there's a lot of action right now with the Queen. Up. 
the four five seven. Anything to turn left on Alpha Hotel Park. Put a four five seven left on Alpha Hotel. Now two thirty two traffic gonna hold the position, cross number two five right, country down point seven five. Left two five right down point seven five. City Ops Los Angeles Cap. Tower City Ops is up. City Ops, uh, good afternoon. There's some fodder on my 25 right, right by the display special in front of the friendly caravan in position. Uh, okay, let me see if I can get someone else over there. I'm stuck with the Roger. Tower Sky's 4835, visual, uh, 25 left. That's 4835, LA Talk, caution, trouble, speed speed by every 777, 124012, runway 25 left to the left. Tunsit Queen continuing taxi down to 25 left. This is flight 457 heading back to Frankfurt there in Deutschland. Asiana A380, originally flight 204, coming up from Seoul, being towed over to the remote gates on the west side of the airport. Asif on the Pan Airways, the Dreamliner heading back to Tokyo Haneda, flight 125. That aircraft heading to 25 right. Turn left on hotel and hold short of Quebec. Do not block Quebec, please. Left hotel, hold short Quebec, American 135. Oh, Bob, you're back. More pop tarts? Oh. No, I was giving them back. Oh. <laughs> I'm a co-host here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Daniel's visiting from Montreal. Hi. Kevin, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Hello, Los Angeles Tower, number four, five, six, call south is with you for oh, excellent. two, five, left. Are they watching right now? Brian Henry with the two dollar super chat. Thank you so much, Brian. Thank you. More hard eight barbecue here at DFW, Kevin and Rudy. Oh, I'm coming back for the hard eight. Trust me, Brian. Cameron, member for 13 months. This is several members. Thanks for the entertainment. Our pleasure, Cameron. Thanks for supporting the channel. American Airlines 135 coming in from London Heathrow. It's a 777-200ER. Flight time is 10 hours and 39 minutes. This is the one with the Al Blackman sticker. Al, a longtime employee of American Airlines.
tower off time. I don't see anything else. Can I confirm that with, it, with your plane? Affirmative, uh, friendly 806. Do you still, you still see the fog? No, sir. That's what I was looking at. You know what it was? Yeah, that was the rubber joint seal. It seems like it comes up between the blocks. And offside, he's clear if you can break it. Thank you. Friendly 806. 24012, runway 25 right for the big off. Lufthansa Queen, the number two worldwide track plane right now on Flight Radar 24, tracked by almost 500 people. You guys are tracking machines. Go 4835, turn right on hotel, hold short sure of golf. Right hotel, short of golf, guys. 48 It's been a beautiful day, all like day, for plane, plane spotting. Gorgeous. I believe we have the Grand Caravan rolling. Our friend Skittles back with a $25 Super Chat through PayPal. Thank you so much, Skittles. The coverage of the Queen alone is worth the dip, but we also get the King and the Long Haul Swiss, too. How lucky are we? Thanks, Kevin and Riddy for the great coverage. Our pleasure. Thank you so much for your awesome support there, Skittles. Thank you, Skittles. And look what we have here. The Grand Caravan. It's like the chariot on top of the Sunday. I never thought we would see this Grand Caravan. Southern Airways Express. It's flight 806 headed out to Imperial. How's the weather up there? It's great, Rudy. <laughs> oh, easy now. If you guys are new to the stream and you're liking it, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Make sure to hit that like button on your way out. And make sure your notifications are all set. We'll be back here on Tuesday for the Super Tuesday show back here at Imperial Hill. Alpha 125 Heavy, wind 25012, RNAV Docker, runway 25 right at Fox Truck, over take off. Special delivery with JetBlue in this A320. This is JetBlue Airways 1732 taking off to Salt Lake City on an A320 in the NYPD livery. Blue Finest on the Pan Airways Wing 125 heading back to Tokyo Haneda 787-8 Dreamliner. Next takeoff on 25 right should be followed by the Queen on 25 left. Just had a Global X touchdown. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Global X. A320 in the blue livery coming in from Seattle. Boeing Field. Probably see it over here in a second. Right, the, dr the Dreamliner now rolling down at 25 right. Scott with 4835 at Golf, cross runway 25 right, and then ground 475. At Golf, cross 25 right, and ground 75, you guys, 4835. American 135 Heavy, uh, traffic pushing off the gate, turn right at Quebec, cross runway 25 right, and then ground point 75. Right, back cross 25 right, ground point 75, right, ground point 35. This is all Nippon Airways 125 taking off to Tokyo Haneda on a 787-8 Dreamliner. Lufthansa 457 now 
taxi lining up on 2-5 left. All right, here we go. The grand finale of today. Who is ready? So real quick, since I don't know how much longer we're going to see these. Canyon of Blue 737 700 coming back. It's like 2137 coming back from Phoenix, Arizona. Not quite sure how many more of these are left. We got the Queen now rolling down at 2 5 left. Can I tilt the power to reach it? Also, the 457 heavy. Goodbye. Goodbye. All right. Well, that is going to wrap it up for today. We'll see you guys back on Tuesday before we head out here today. I'd like to give a shout out to our Emerald and Diamond members. guys for tuning in today what a fantastic sunday show as always i'll tell you we got these a380s and 747 8s taking off here on the south side for the next six months my gosh yeah a lot of fun we'll be right back here on tuesday looking like 11 a.m start time on tuesday for the super tuesday show so hopefully Ooh. you guys can tune in and then for more south side action that will be back high atop the h, h hotel on friday afternoon then we'll be back here next sunday all right already thinking about sunday rudy thank you so much yes thanks for a super day and can't wait for super tuesday it's gonna be a super <laughs> awesome stream super super and thanks for the <laughs> super support from all of you guys yes. awesome support as always and thanks to our great mods always doing a great job as well thanks you guys all right what you guys have all been waiting for i hear it all the time rudy proud bird <laughs> Oh, I'm on. You're on. Thanks for watching ADO. It's our time to go back home for the day. 
but we thank you for watching us. Uh -huh. What a day it has been here at LAX. We are so glad you came to our big Sunday show. We even had a great time with Bob. Here we go! Thanks so much for watching ABL! We hope you had a great time here at ABL! We miss Later Tater, but we had such a great time with the A380s taking off on the south side. Thanks for watching ABL. Thanks for all the mods too. Thanks for all of your support and for watching ABL. Say with me, we are ABL. <laughs> oh, oh, I left it on. <laughs> Sorry. Uh oh. Right. Uh, uh, <laughs> good job, Rudy. Hi. Always a good job. Uh, 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 <laughs> Sorry, I was thought that it was a studio audience. All right, let's get out of here. Let's get gross. Yes. Here. Thanks, you guys. Hope you have a great rest of your Sunday, if not <laughs> Monday. And we'll see you on Thursday. Tuesday. All right, from all of us here at Airline Videos Live, good night, everyone. Bye. Take the train. We're out of here. <laughs>